You have rocked with the hottest boxing podcast in the land. True Media Boxing Radio with your host, Coach Malachi Williams. True, true, true. Yeah, 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 man. Salute, fam. What's going on, everybody? This is our boy, Coach Malachi Williams in the building. We back. Two Media Boston Radio, man. We are back. We are back. We are back. I was, I was sitting there trying to, I was sitting there trying to, um, uh, uh, I was sitting there trying to get everything set up, trying to get everything set up on, um, over here on, um, on my te television. But for some reason, man, my damn design be tripping, man. Like on the television, it seemed like it be streaming real, real slow. So I try to simul, I try to uh, 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 simulcast it. That ain't, you know, it's still kind of doing the same thing. I don't know what it is. I'm thinking it's, a, I don't know, maybe the connection with the television. So now I have it right here on my phone, looking at it right now, and it is what it is. Y'all know what it is. Uh, shout out to Martin. Martin, what's going on, fam? What's happening, brother? He said, "What's cracking, man? You know what it is, man. I'm just, I'm just, man. I'm just cooling, man. I'm just cooling, man. That's all I'm doing. Just cooling." Having for hey, 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 you probably, I don't know how old you was, Martin, but um, there was this group called Levert that came out in like 87, 1987, 1988. Levert, they had Jail Levert, his um, his little brother in there. I forgot his little brother's name. And then he had his cousin in there, right? They made a song called, uh, they, they had an album called, you know, they had on four, four, um, four Seasons on there and stuff like that. They made a song called Just Cooling. You know what I mean? I'm just cooling, man. <laughs> Hey man, I'm just cooling, man. That's all I'm doing, Martin. True, true, true. Yeah, man. I'm just cool. Matter of fact, I need to, I mean, you know what? I'm I'm thinking about Levert. I need to go ahead and download that song on, on my playlist, man. When I be working out, I have so many songs on my playlist. Yeah, man. I just want to sit here, man, and just enjoy this shit, man. Uh, shout out to G5. What's going on, brother? Shout out to Doggone. Uh shout out to Knockdown 305. Salute fam. Harvey in the building. Pauline is in the building. I'm sitting there watching this fight between Chamberlain and um, Gwen. That's the dude named Gwen. Chamberlain and Gwen. Let's see what's up, man. Chamberlain and Gwen. All right, I'm looking, I'm looking right here. Looking at it right here. Shit. Shit, I don't know which one Chamberlain, which one Gwen. Okay, Chamberlain is the one with the black and gold. Okay, cool. Gwen is a look like okay, look like Gwen trying to do a little something. They both of these dudes got some long ass arms. I wonder what, hey, what, 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 on what weight class is this? Chamberlain and Gwen, what weight class is this? I haven't seen the uh, shout out to Reborn. He said he's driving and listening. Okay, cool. Shout out to uh, shout out to uh, I haven't seen, I haven't seen the, I haven't seen the uh, this is the first fight I've, I've seen thus far. Boy, look like doggone Gwen, look like Gwen getting folded up a little bit though. He hitting the punch, punching on the back of the head. He can't punch in the back of the head. Uh, he punching in the back of the head. Okay, let's see what's up. Both of these guys. All right, we'll see what's happening. Yeah, this this is the first fight. This is the first. Oh, that's a nice uppercut by Dog on Chamberlain. Man, that was a nice little sneaky little left uppercut. All right, both men, both men in the both men in the open hand stance. Both in the open hand stance. Okay. Open hand stance. All right, all right. It is what it is. 
Uh, okay, looping left hook, miss. He, he getting jabbed. You know what, man? Look like doggone Chamberlain. Look like Chamberlain picking doggone Gwen a pole. Lord, that's a nice straight left. He look like he Chamberlain picking Gwen a pole. Got him on the ropes again. Straight left, can't miss. The straight left, can't miss. Lord have mercy. Man, right, oh, Lord have mercy. Boy, he folding up. He folding up. Chamberlain got him on the ropes. Gwen, boy, you got to get out of there, man. He's murdering you. He's murdering you, Rocky. That straight left, that straight left hitting you. All right, both men in the open hand stands. You know, I think I think he having trouble with the southpaw. Shout out to Stephen Ace. What's going on, fam? Shout out to Dog on Tyrone. There you go. We got Chamberlain and Gwen right now. Chamberlain and Gwen. I don't know who any of these guys are, but it doesn't matter. You know, like I say, boxing is a global sport. You know, there's a whole lot of fighters I don't know. Um, anyways, let's see what's up. Uh okay. And all right, there you go right there. Yeah, nice little jab. And look, you know what? I haven't seen it. Now, this is my first first round I'm seeing. But so far, what I'm seeing, it looked like doggone uh, Chamberlain is piecing Gwen up. And it looked like that right eye. That right eye don't look good, boy. You know, the, you know, you know they going to do this. the fourth round. He going to the body. Good. Boy, Gwen going to the – Chamberlain going to the body. Good, though. The body was – referee stopped it. Referee stopped the fight. Yeah, man, go ahead and stop it, man. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, you know what, man? The referee did a good job. Let's get referee round of applause. Yeah, yeah, get a referee round of applause. He might as well. He might as well. He did. He did the right thing. He did the right thing. You get what I'm saying? Live, live, live to fight another day, young man. That eye didn't look good. That eye didn't look good at all, boy. Live to fight another day. <laughs> live to fight another day. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, man. Shout out to shout out to Jamie from New York. What's going on, brother? We sitting here just cooling, man. Just cooling like the vert. You remember that song? Just cooling. Well, y'all got me, y'all shit, y'all got me one up. Now I got now I got to pull the song up right here. Now, now I gotta pull up LaVert. I have to pull LaVert up now. You get what I'm saying? Harvey said that yeah, that eye, his eye busted up pretty well, pretty good. That eye was taking a beating, brother. And those are the facts. Those are the facts. That that, that eye, that eye was taking the beating. True, true, true. Lake your man, we got a, all I know. All I know is this here. Yeah, Sheila said the eye collector. That's right, the eye collector. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> the eye collector, man. <laughs> hey, you, hey, 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 uh, Sheila, you, you, you brought back memories on that. He the eye collector. He the eye collector. <laughs> Look what he did. <laughs> Look what he did to Uga Shah. He the eye collector. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my God. I'm so glad we ain't got to hear none of that shit down no more, boy. Boy, it, it, listen, I ain't going to say a lot to you, boy. It, it, it's two it's too fair bases. I'm glad you can hear you can hear catfish piss on the water right now. Boy. Both of them come from the same record label staff and as a crew. Both of them with, you know, as, as a matter of fact, you know what? Before we get into the show, I got to say all praises due to the most high, the most exalted, the greatest human being on the planet Earth, Mr. Al Heyman. Well, you know, I guess I got to be like everybody else and thank Al Heyman. <laughs> I can quit my job now, baby. Six figures, baby. You feel me? I'm about to but, but a name, a name. Do you have a name? Oh, nah, nah. I ain't got no name, you know? Name them names, man. They know who they is. Name them names, <laughs> please. The names need to be but they named. know who they is. <laughs> the Mexican monster. Yeah, man, gotta say all praise due to Al, man. We gotta do that. You know, Al, you know, Al, you know, we gotta worship Al first. You know, you know, Al is the first name. Guess what? I tell you what, if you ain't mentioned Al Heyman name first, when you before you wake up every day, and, and his last his name last when you go to bed at night, something something is seriously wrong with you. True, true, true. You know how these idol worshiping ass niggas is on social media, boy. These niggas be worshiping idols and making deities of of, of, of invisible men and <laughs> Hey, nigga, boy, Lord have mercy. You know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to sit here. I'm just going to sit here and, uh, you know what I mean? I'm just going to sit here and just have me, you know. You know. I'm just going to enjoy the ride. That's what I'm going to do. Uh, shout out to Reborn. Reborn say, Coach, can you do me a favor and get my son, uh, Pablo, Pablo Adino Castillo, um, a shout out while he's traveling with me from VA to, uh, to Texas. All right, man, let's give a shout-out, man, to Pablo. Pablo, what's going on? What's going on, baby boy? What's going on, fam? Shout-out to Pablo. 
I see, I hear you on your way to Texas. Salute, uh, so shout out to Pablo, man, and shout out to his father. Both, I, I wish both of y'all uh, safe travels, or whoever is with you in the vehicle. I wish everybody to get there safely. Shout out to Pablo, man. Let's give Pablo a round of applause. Yeah, man. Shout out to Pablo. Anyway, you know, you know, we, you know, we do requests over here. We do requests over here. We do requests over here. You know what I mean? You know, we, <laughs> we do requests over here. You know, we, you get what I'm saying? You know, we know if we're doing that. Brothers say, uh, hold on. Hold on. Natural say rumors are Bud and you bank. Yes, those rumors are true. <laughs> those rumors are true. But 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 Bud and Chris Eubank Jr. You know what I mean? Those rumors are true. They, they don't they don't have a uh, they don't have a location yet, but those those rumors are true. They will be fighting each other at 160. So Bud is leaving 147 pound division. I don't know when uh, when is he going to drop the belts, but you know, I guess he'll drop the belts when the sanctioning body say he can tell him to drop them. But yes, he's moving on. He's leaving the one. He's he's, he's officially leaving of the 147 division. It's official. Uh, Stephen A. say Bomack is both of their coaches. Yeah, see, see what, what's going to happen. See, Bomack going to coach both of them. See, what, what he going to do, Stephen? He going to coach Bud in the first round and then go to the other side and coach Chris in the second round. Then he going to go back in the third round and coach Bud some more. Then he going to go to the fourth round and then go coach uh, Chris. It's going to be the first time. It's going to be the first time you've seen something like this, brother. Bomack going to coach both of them. You know, now, you know they got three trainers. So we got Coach Red. We got um, Esau, you know, they call him Saul, but we got Esau and we got Bomac. So between the three coaches, we'll, you know, you know, they, I, I think they'll be able to work it out. True, true, true. Between the three coaches, they'll be able to work it out, fam. Don't worry about that. I think Chris, you know, they, we got it covered. <laughs> we got it covered. <laughs> Don't worry about that. Chris, Chris going to be all right. <laughs> Chris going to be all right. Hey, boy, let me tell you something, boy. And if, um, and if, um, and if this work out, and if this work out the way I'm hearing it's going, if, if, if this if this turn out the way, way I'm hearing it's going to happen, I don't know now. I'm hearing, I'm hearing, boy, it's going to be some big. Oh my bad. I'm hearing it's going to be some big money, people involved. That's what I'm hearing. I'm hearing that it's going to be some, it's going to be some. A rap money involved. That's what I'm hearing. I don't know. I don't know how true this is, but I'm I'm hearing it's gonna be some Arab money involved. That's what I'm hearing. Yes, sir. I'm hearing it's gonna be the Arabs involved on this hill, boy. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> shit, you know. Shit, ain't nobody. You know what I mean? Well, I'm gonna try to get that Arab money now, man. He said, "Well, Eubanks the next victim for Bud." I don't know, man. Eubanks a big guy. He bigger than Bud, man. He may, you know, he may, you know what I mean. He may, he may pull out an upset. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> uh, hey, Melvin ever say now where's the ducking or same energy for Bud? Nah, Bud ain't ducking. Um, he he get a chance to pick and choose who he wants to fight. Just like Floyd Mayweather said. Floyd Mayweather said that um you can pick and choose who you want to fight. He said um you know uh, all the other fighters are doing it. So since all the other fighters are doing it, you know don't come over here with the selective outrage. You, you don't like Bud, so you don't support him. Don't buy the fight. That's all. It's, it's simple as that. <laughs> don't buy the fight. Who cares? Uh, shout out to the G5. He said, come on, coach. You and I know both uh, Bud retires undefeated. I mean, you know, you never know. You never know. You never know. You never know. You know what I mean? They still, they still got to get in there. They still got to get in there and fight. They still got to get in there and fight. You know what I mean? <laughs> Niggas want to. See, let me tell you something, right? So I figured this shit out. I, you know, I was, I'm over here fighting a good fight, but I, I've been noticing, I've been noticing, uh, hey, Sue said, don't nobody want to see Crawford fight Eubanks. They don't watch it. Simple as that. Don't watch it. I don't think no one is going to be crying because hey, Sue's don't watch the fight. I mean, don't watch it. Simple as that. <laughs> you hear what I'm saying? So I, I, just, I just solved that. I just solved that for you. Simple as that. Don't watch it. Um, Shout out to D Town. He said that's right, coach. Yeah, yo, the thing is, the thing is, I ain't, you know, I ain't finna be having this selective outrage with these niggas because I've been over here talk, talking about, I've been over here talking about boxing criterias. I've been over here talking about commandments. And you know what motherfuckers been saying? You know what motherfuckers been saying in the chat? Oh man, nobody would have cared nothing about that commandment shit, coach. 
Don't nobody care now about no boxing criteria. Man, yeah, yo, yo fighter. Y'all, listen, I when I go to talking about three, four division world champs, motherfuckers in the chat been shit. Oh man, that dude, he three forty. Oh, he ain't fought nobody. Nobody don't care about him being undisputed. These been the same niggas that's been coming over here shitting on legacy, talking about belts don't matter, mandatories don't matter, this and that, but then all of a sudden niggas want to have selective outrage. I said, when you the same niggas, when you the same niggas so long that were talking about belts don't matter and oh that's our old school shit and ain't nobody want to hear that no more. It's a new time, new day now. Uh, you know, we following we following the, uh, the Mayweather Green print. So it, it's funny. It's funny how you, how these niggas like to pick and choose when they want to be outraged about something. But when you when when you are put in a, a certain position, he should be go. I mean, he's able to, like like me. You know, when I was in a position, I can pick and choose who I want to. Cause I, I, I earned that right. Simple as that. If you don't like it, don't watch the shit. I don't think nobody. I don't mean. I don't think Chris Eubank, me or Bud, or, or Chris Eubank or Bud gonna give a fuck. Don't watch it. He still gonna get paid. That's just like when Canelo pick and choose who he wanna fight. Canelo don't give a damn about who say who who they gonna watch his shit or not. He gonna guess what he gonna do. He still gonna get paid. He don't give a fuck. This where we at in boxing. Jake Paul is fighting doggone Mike Tyson. <laughs> Jake Paul is fighting Mike Tyson. You know, Roland Romero's is getting shot at Tank Davis's and stuff like that. So, I mean, that's where we at now. That's where we at now. I don't accept it. I don't accept it. It's simple as I don't accept it. I'm finna sit here. I'm finna. I'm finna sit. I'm, I'm, I don't accept it. I'm finna sit here, man, and just have some fun with this shit. I'm finna sit and have some fun with this shit and get paid doing it. True. 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 Simple as that. Y'all ain't gonna see y'all. Y'all ain't got to worry about seeing Coach Malachi on nobody channel going going arguing for eight, nine, ten hour lives. Nah, I ain't finna be arguing no niggas back and forth. Not me. I told y'all what it is. Y'all weren't listening. Told y'all what it is. Same niggas. Same niggas. I was telling. I, listen. I've been I, I've been holding the line for three years. I've been holding the line for three years. Telling y'all what it is. Guess what's been happening? Niggas been attacking me. Belts don't matter. That shit, oh, that shit overrated. This and that. You know what I mean? Niggas been putting their fighters in the witness protection program. That's what they've been doing. They've been putting their fighters in the witness protection program. Picking and choosing who they want to be outraged about. I don't like him. I ain't gonna watch his face. So? <laughs> I mean, these fighters ain't these fighters ain't thinking about these fighters don't give a fuck about what what Coach Malachi say or what a nigga in the chat say. They don't give a damn. They gonna get their check and go to the bank. The A Rabs put the money up. So, uh, shout out to Mister Nice. He say facts. Belts don't feed the kids. Sources said. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. I mean, they be claiming they always quoting Floyd. They all listen. They all listen. They always quoting. They always quoting Floyd, right? What? What? Hold on. What Floyd say? What Floyd say? These niggas always quote you. They say Floyd the GOAT, right? See, y'all know me. I'm a master at taking what they say and throwing it back in their faces. I'm a master at that shit. Because I ain't letting these say, I ain't, ain't going to let these niggas forget, see. Because what, hap what happened in today's time, in today's time, do, they like to forget and project. You won't do no forgetting and no projecting over here. Won't get away with that. Not over here. They like the whole, what, what, what my main man, Two Tone the Superstar? What Two Tone the Superstar? Two Tone the Superstar, where you at, fam? Two Tone the Superstar dropped the video that I need to, that I need to add to my sound bites. He dropped the video I need to add to my sound bite. <laughs> Give me a thumbs up if y'all can hear this. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Can y'all hear this? <laughs> if y'all okay, I'll play it for you. I'll play it for you from the phone. <laughs> y'all can't hear this. Y'all probably can't hear this. I'm listening to something. I don't know if you guys can hear. Let me see. Let 
me see. No, nah, y'all can't hear. Y'all can't hear. Don't worry about it. I'm going to put a flag. See, 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 listen. They love Floyd. Oh, they love Floyd so much. They love Floyd. They always quote Floyd. 50 and 0, you know, legacy. I can't, I can't pee my kids with belts. Legacy don't pay the bills. And then, yo, wait a minute. Wait, why he, why he fighting Green Bay? What'd that do for his legacy? What'd that do for his legacy? True, true, true. I said, it's amazing how these niggas pick it too. Like, bro, like, niggas been snapping on me. Oh, now y'all want to hit that old school shit. A quality of opponent, that don't mean nothing. It's about putting butts in seats. My, my fighter got Lambo with suicide doors. Ain't that, ain't that what y'all was saying? Ain't no problem, no problem. Don't worry about it. Um, I'm finna play it now. Ain't that what y'all was saying? That was that, that what they were saying, right? Like Roy Jones said, y'all must have forgot. No, no, I said, I ain't gonna let you forget. I ain't gonna let you forget. I ain't gonna let you forget. You moving up two weight divisions. Fighting a guy, two weight divisions bigger than him. Yeah, I ain't gonna let you forget. Oh, no, no, no. I ain't gonna let you forget, no. I, you know, I, I, I love using Floyd Mayweather. As Floyd Mayweather, Floyd Mayweather, uh, Floyd Mayweather is, is pushes my argument so good. Everything. Like, like, I'm like bowling because I knock him right down with all the shit. Y'all keep, 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 keep fighting all them hard fights. Y'all keep fighting all them hard fights. Y'all keep fighting all them hard fights. Easy pay, they easy check, easy on the pawn. Y'all keep fighting all them hard fights. That's all I do. Line him up. Line him up like bowling because I knock him right down with all the shit. Y'all keep fighting all them hard fights. Y'all keep fighting all them hard fights. Y'all keep fighting all them hard fights. Yeah. Easy pay, they easy check, easy opponent. That's all I do. Line him up. Line him up like bowling because I knock him right down with all the shit. Y'all keep fighting all them hard fights. Y'all keep fighting all them hard fights. Y'all keep fighting all them hard fights. Guess what? Guess what? And, 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 and I'm going to show you the video. I'm going to play the video. These the same niggas. They're the same niggas that be quoting Floyd all the time. No, he Floyd. Floyd, yeah, let's no, 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 no. See, it's about it's about working smarter, not harder. Ain't that what you niggas been saying? But when you when when you are put in a a certain position, he should be go I mean, he's able to like like me. You know, when I was in a position, I can pick and choose who I want to. Because I I I earned that right. So Floyd said you could pick and choose when he was in that position, he could pick and choose who he want to. I don't like him. He cherry picking. Why he cherry picking? But these same niggas are, are die hard Floyd Mayweather fans. Floyd Mayweather said, you know, he earned the right to pick and choose who he wants to, right? So so who so 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 who is uh <laughs> is it just certain fighters? Yeah, only the fighters that we like earn the right to pick and choose. Trust me, I get it, I get it. True, I get it. I get true, it. true. <laughs> I get it, 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 I get it. I understand, I understand. Don't watch it, don't watch it. See, Floyd Mayweather is my go-to guy. Floyd Mayweather is my go-to guy. I'm going to always go to Floyd. You want to know why? Because <laughs> Floyd is a walking contradiction. And the people, and, and pe the same people who are defecate on Canelo are die hard Floyd fans. The same people who are defecate on Crawford or defecate on Devin Haney or defecate on a new way to monster or whatever, they're die hard Floyd fans. You will have video footage of Floyd saying, I you know I know I, I I I pick and choose who I want to fight. Y'all keep fighting those hard fights. You know I'm gonna fight the easy fights. But this ball became the easy matches. <laughs> fight another ball. The, 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 you hear them all call the boss boy. Yeah, nigga, Floyd. Floyd was a genius. He was a genius. Okay, so so and then they make these same arguments for certain fighters today. I ain't gonna say no names. But when it's a fighter that you don't like, that do it that that's following the Floyd green print. Or following the tank green print, or following what whoever may be doing, y'all they got a problem with. True, true, <laughs> true. No, no, you ain't getting no, you not getting away today. Not today. No. What that what that video? Let me, let me find that video. No, no, no. Friday Kickboxing movie. movies back everything in. like. No, 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 no. No, that no, not with me. 
No, no, no. Anyways, anyways. No, 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 no. See, they pick and choose. They pick and choose. They pick and choose. <laughs> this nigga here, man. <laughs> I got a nigga. I got a nigga. Uh... <laughs> That nigga mad in the mother. Ah, ha, 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 
me see if I find this video for y'all. What that video at with Floyd? <laughs> yeah, keep fighting those tough fights. I'm gonna keep robbing the bank. Yeah, oh yeah, that's what he, he that's what he called a legal bank robbery, right? That's what that's what he called a legal bank robbery. I will, I will, I will, um, I will address the super chats. Yeah, I'm gonna put this. I'm gonna put this in. Anytime a nigga wanna argue. No, 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 no. <laughs> That's one right there. That's one right there. Shit. Floyd, Floyd got so much stuff out here. These niggas be quoting. It's just so much stuff out here. He talk about how he finessed the game. I finessed the game of boxing. So like y'all, y'all, <laughs> these niggas pick and choose. You know, these niggas pick and choose. Okay, so, yeah, we want my fighter. See, we don't mind my fighter for the game, but we don't want nobody else doing it. I ain't missing with this fake-ass outrage. I ain't trying to hear that shit. Not me, not me, not me. Man, man this dude got so many receipts over here, man. Lord, this man got so many receipts. Shit. <laughs> um, shout out to Pauline. Salute. What's going on, Pauline? Let's get to the Super Chats. What it's a, it's a shout out to Keith Bulldogs, man. I thank you, brother. Shout out to Mark. Hey, okay. Dropping that quarter of a damn dub on your boy. Hey, Leroy. Super Jack received. Playtime's over. Oh, yeah, man. What'd you say? You took PTO? Hey, boy. Hey, listen. Hey, you brought back. Hey. Hey, uh, Mark, you brought back some memories, bro. You said PTO, boy. Yeah, man. I got. Yeah, I had to take that PTO. Hold on. Hey, you brought back memories, boy. Talk about PTO. Hey, for, um, for Nick Sachs, who don't know what PTO means, that means pay time off. True, true, true. Wait, wait, wait. He said PTO? Wait, wait, wait. What do you mean PTO? He talking about the probation officer? Down from the bar, there's a platform stage. People pimping, pimping, sharp as razor blades. He, he said PTO, that, that, proba that probation, bro. That probation. I, I told you he was on probation. No, oh, man, PTO, that paid time off. <laughs> it's an acronym for paid time off. Oh, 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 I thought he, I thought he said something about probation. Oh, she had PTO. I had, you know, I had a PO. You know, I had a PO. You know what I mean? PO means probation officer. <laughs> <laughs> I'm finna sit here. Man, you think I'm finna sit here, man, and be, hey, look here. Listen, look here, man. I'm, I, listen, I fought a good fight for three years, dog. I fought a good fight for three years, and I'm still fighting it. I'm just fighting it differently now. Now it's just like, man, now it's like, <laughs> I am not finna sit here and argue with these niggas. You wanna argue? I can't argue with you. You mad. Look at you. You mad. I don't get paid to argue with you. Who is you? You ain't nobody. I'm trying to see. I'm, I got it on the fight right here. Is it the undercard went off? Uh, so somebody said that. Uh, he said, "Are you cool with Chris Eubanks? Boy, fighting Chris Eubanks." I'm listen. I told you guys what I told you guys five days ago. I said I'm cool with anybody fighting anybody. I don't care. Go back to the live we did fight. I say, look, uh, Canelo can fight who he want to fight. Tank can fight who he want to fight. Uh, Devin can fight who he want to fight. Shakur. Bam, a new way, Crawford, Spence, don't matter. I'm cool with anybody fighting whoever they want to fight. Because I remember a heavyweight named Anthony Joshua was fighting the tougher fights, unifying the division, trying to make the big fights. Y'all shit it on him. Shit it on him. Oh, man, he ain't fighting nobody. He ain't doing nothing. So there's a pattern with these niggas. You know, the dudes who doing shit, you know, they shit on them. So I'm like, all right, man, fuck it, I ain't, you know. Y'all in the nigga, I ain't, these niggas, I ain't, I'm not finna get caught up in these niggas in a selective outrage. Not the coach. That shit ain't happening. I know, I listen, I know these, I know these niggas on YouTube full of shit. Y'all think I don't know that? I'm gonna turn all the shit. I know these niggas on YouTube full of shit. I know that. Shit, I ain't, I ain't finna be sitting there arguing with these niggas. Not me. I don't give a damn who fight who. I don't care. Jake Paul, Jake Paul can come in Boston to rob the bank for all I care. The sanction the bodies are in on it. I told you guys that. That said, Mariso, the sanction the bodies are in on it. Um, there's no more hardcore boxing fans. 
you know, people like myself, Blood Boston, Bruce Gass, and a few, ain't but a handful of us, we the last of a dying breed. It's over with for us. I have accepted that. The lighter weight divisions, these niggas don't even know who fighting in the lighter weight divisions. 115, they bumping at 115. They bumping the dog on 122, 118. They bumping at 126. But because they're not the popular names, they don't nobody talk about them. Boxing is doing very, very well all over the world, globally. Trust me, it is. Um, and don't let nobody tell you it's not. Now, now in America, it's about the, the idol worshiping, the uh, you know, the celebrity worship. That's what it's about. And uh, you know, since I've been online, all I've seen is niggas arguing or arguing for cer over certain fighters. They they require one thing for one fighter, but they don't require that for the other fighter. The other fighter can fight doggone Godzilla, King Kong, Mothra, Gamera, um, Iron Man, Thor, Optimus Prime, Megatron. Oh man, he he man, he ain't fighting nobody, man. That way he ain't man. What you think? My fighter, my fighter will fight them dudes and knock all them dudes out too. But they'll say they fight ain't gotta fight none of those guys. So they'll shit on the guy who's unifying divisions, fighting for titles, doing A, B, C, and D, they shit on those guys. And the guys who ain't doing none of that, they praise them. True, true, true. So I'm I'm done. I'm done. I've been doing this shit for three. I'm done. I am done. I ain't finna be arguing with these niggas about this shit. Yeah, I, listen, I don't give a fuck who fight who. I'm going, we going to throw up. We going to go live for the party. We going to throw up fight party. We going to um, laugh, have fun, talk shit, and keep moving. That's it. That's what I'm going to do. Um, shout out to Eric Rosas. Shit, we got we got this fight right here. Only we got dog on Francis and Gano, a guy that's 0 and 1. <laughs> hey, what to say, Food Revolution? She said that's all they do: gossip and cap uh, for fighters on their shows. Yeah, so I mean, it is what it is. It is what it is. I ain't, I ain't tripping. I'm not tripping at all. Since I'm like I'm, listen, Food Revolution. I'm done. When I say I'm done, I'm done. Done. I'm done. Done. I don't tap out. Right now I'm finna right now I'm finna get we finna get some of this money and uh we just gonna we gonna cover it. We gonna cover it. Let everybody fight who they wanna fight. I don't care. I ain't arguing about no ranking systems. I ain't arguing about number one should be fighting number two. I'm not arguing about this guy the champ and he we don't wanna fight his mandatory. I ain't arguing about none of that. Let 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 the good times roll. Let's just have some fun. That's where I'm at with it. Let Canelo do what he wanna do. Let Crawford do what he want to do. Let Tank do what he want to do. That, that's what Booger Ray said, right? Let uh let uh Shakur do what he want to do. Let uh 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 let all them dudes do what they want to do. I don't give a fuck. And uh Sheila say love PTOs. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. Hey, Jamie said he said coach boxing done as we know. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's over with. That's over. I mean, I'm not saying this. It, it, it'll probably come around years down the line because everything go in cycles. Everything go in cycles, Jamie. And I, as I told you, boxing is not done. But you got fights that are happening. It's just that the popular names are what the what what the, what American boxing fans on social media are focused on. It's the popular names. Boxing ain't done. Boxing is live and well. But if all you watch is the popular names, you ain't gonna know. You ain't, you know, you're not gonna know. You're gonna think that, yeah, man, hey, man, you know, damn, man, they ain't showing that. You, it's the popular names, dog. I don't give a damn. My thing is what's good for the gander is good for the goose. Shit, if 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 if, if this fight, if one fighter can do it, let all of them do it. That's what I've been saying. Listen to my son. I say, listen, man, if you're gonna let one do it, you I, what I said, I said you I said you opening up the floodgates. If you're going to let one do it, let all of them do it. Don't be crying about who Tank fighting. Don't be crying about who Crawford fighting. Do y'all remember that show? Don't be crying about who Errol Spence fighting. Don't be crying about who Boots fighting. And we know Boots ain't fighting no goddamn body. Don't be crying about who, because y'all ain't paying attention to old Shockey Foster. When I say y'all, I ain't talking about anybody in the chat, but to those who ain't fit. If I throw a rock in a pack of dogs, it's the hit dog that hollers. So if you're hollering, you the one I'm talking about. And but it, but it, but it, but if it don't, but if it don't, if it don't apply, let it fly. So so this is what I've been saying. The ain't nobody been listening. They ain't been listening to me. Look, niggas looking at me like I got nine heads. I said, okay, cool. Jake Paul and Mike Tyson finna fight now. 
I'm getting behind Jay. I'm getting behind Mike Tyson on that. And and I plan on being in Dallas for the fight. Just see Mike Tyson and Jake Paul fight. This way it's at. I told y'all this way it's at. So I ain't got to worry about no drop the addies. No, I ain't got to worry about no niggas calling, want to argue with me about shit. I ain't, cause I ain't trying to, I swear to God, I ain't finna argue with you. Like, yeah, yeah, nigga, whatever, nigga. That, that, that's selective outrage. You just saying that cause you, you just saying that cause you hate, cause you hate Crawford. You ain't say that with Tank. You ain't say that with Spence. You ain't say that with, with Floyd Mayweather. If listen, if you are, if you are a diehard Floyd Mayweather fan, you can't tell me shit. And I've been following Floyd since the amateurs. If you're a diehard Floyd Mayweather fan, you can't tell me a motherfucker thing about legacy and certain fighters need to fight certain fighters. Nigga, don't tell me nothing about that. Because, hold on, where's the legal bank robbery at? Hold on. Legal bank robbery. He said, he, when he, he, got a, he said, I'm robbing the bank. I'm robbing the bank. <laughs> At the Gucci store, Floyd going to the Gucci store. <laughs> they like, they like, they, they, they like to, the, they like to the always, that's what they like to call. They like to call on Floyd all the time, right? Yeah, man, Floyd the one, man, Floyd the one got made it cooler. The duck and do this and do that and pick and choose. That was, they, you know, that, you know that, that was some people saying. Oh, 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 Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. Shout out to my good brother, Floyd Mayweather. My good brother. See, I love throwing these receipts at him. What a, what a, you know, you know, uh, what a, what a, what a Floyd Mo's at? No, 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 no. You're not going to get away today. Not today. No, sir. No, sir. See, one thing, one, see, one thing a good marketer does. Show y'all how good I am. One thing a good marketer does, a good marketer studies the crowd. He studies what people are saying. He studies the chats. He studies Twitter. He study, he studies, he'll study whatever field he's in, he study what they're saying. And the reason why it's good to study what they're saying is because you can always have the receipts lined up to refute everything they're saying just in case something was to occur. Remember that. Um, let's see this. Bro, incredible. Let's see this. This is easy. And this is the guy who they love. This is the guy who they love. They say he the best that ever did it. Greatest fighter in the history of boxing. That's what, that, 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 that's, that's, that's what his fans say. That's what the flow mold say. He best ever did. The best. Yeah. That's what we did, huh? Let's go. It's, it's not all about the money. Well, your kids can't eat legacy. The patches on my trunk, that's 30 man alone. So who's really the smartest one in the sport of boxing? If you don't, if you guys don't want to see me do no exhibitions, don't come. Don't watch. When it comes to legalized bank robbing, I'm the best. I don't care if y'all write good stories. I don't care if y'all write bad stories. At the end of the day, I will always have a last laugh. Damn, I'm writing this story about Floyd. But look at the house I go to. And look at the house he go to. Then all the guys that y'all said was extraordinary, the Canellos and the Pacquiao's, I made them look ordinary. And then when I see it's a chance for me to do a heist, a quick, a quick heist, at the end of the day, I'm the smart one. They say, oh, Floyd don't look good like he used to look. My bank account looking better and better each and every day. So, you know, I just, you know, I, you get what I'm saying? I just, you know, uh, you know, like, like you got to pick and choose now. See, when you, see, see, when you come to me, when you come to me, you better be ready. When you come to me. When you come to me talking that double standard talk about what well, this fighter ain't fighting, no, he ain't fighting no legacy fights, but you a diehard Floyd Mayweather fan? Man, miss me with that bullshit. True, true, true. You miss me with that bullshit. You a pro PBC guy. Because you will be most 99% of the pro PBC guys are that because of Floyd Mayweather. And you'll shit on other black fighters, but then say, Yeah, well, my fighter, no, he ain't got to do it because he's about putting brushy sheets and we doing this and doing that. Yeah, yeah, I just, I just throw Floyd back in your face. True, true, true.
Leg, you know, I can't, you know, I can't feed my kids with legacy. That's what Floyd said. So you niggas all about, man, this ain't no legacy fight for such and such. When have you ever gave a damn about legacy? That's what I've been talking about over here for three years since I've been on this podcast. When have you ever given a damn about legacy? Oh, it's amazing how y'all got that selective memory now. It's amazing. Well, you know, oh, that different. That different. Oh, wait a minute. Nah, 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 nah. Yeah, the nah, nah, nah niggas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. True, true, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, 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 we gon' no. No, that what it gonna be. That what it gonna be. It is what it is. I get it. That what it gonna be. Hold on. Hold on, guys. I'm trying to. It's a fight coming on now. No, nah, they ain't getting away. They ain't getting away. They ain't getting away. Anyways. Shout out to Mimi. Mimi, what's going on? See, we got a fight coming on right now. Fight coming on right now. Shout out to Preacher Joe. Preacher Joe in the building, Brady 12. Shout out to Sheila from Cali. Stephen X, salute, bro. Shout out to Food Revolution, my sister. Round one on started. This um uh, I can't pronounce, man. I can't pronounce these dudes' names, man. What is it? Cor Cor Korbov? Korbinov. 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 I think Korbinov is in the white. No, no, no. Who, hold on, you know what, Korbanov and the other dude name is um Madrimov. Korbanov and Madrimov. Korbanov, so Madrimov, Korbanov is in the red, and Madrim, 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 Madrimov is in the white. Man, see this shit right here, man. They gotta, they gotta, listen, listen, they gotta, they gotta get these dudes, they gotta get these dudes some nicknames or something, man. They gotta get these dudes some nicknames, AK or something. You get what I'm saying? Shit, I can I can't pronounce his goddamn name. You get what I'm saying? So, anyway, let's see what's up. This round one don't start it, man. This is a twelve rounder. Um, these guys look pretty big. They look like they might be light heavyweights. Oh, that's a nice jab. Nice jab by the dudes in the white trunk. Madrimov, Madrimov, Madrimov. Okay, nice jab. That's a nice jab. Nice jab. He got, you know, he got some long ass arms. Now the dude in the red trunk's going to step up a little bit now. He's going to tighten up. Thank, thank, thank you, Floyd. Thank you so much, Floyd. Let me go ahead and say this video right here. Let me say this one. Thank you, Floyd. It's too easy. It's, it, 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 it's too easy. It's too easy to be the Flomo. Flomo, Flomo, too easy. Easiest way, easiest way. If you ever get into a debate, the easiest way to win a debate, find out. You got to do your research and study. Find out what all their talking points are going to be. What they what all their arguing points are going to be. That's if you're in a real debate. If you're in a real debate, not not this YouTube shit with niggas yelling and screaming, calling each other bitch, had niggas and muting each other. None of that. I ain't, I ain't, they ain't don't do no debate on YouTube. I'm talking about real professors. I was used to put, used to be a part of the debate team in, in high school, so you used to have to, you know what I mean? You got a research team, and then one guy speaks, and then you know he lay out every, all of his facts, and he don't say anything, and the other guy just sitting there, he might be writing those, taking those down. And when you when you're doing your research, you know you you know when you come up with a with an argument to support what you're saying, you got to poke holes in your argument as well. Have a counter. Okay, we got something that's strong that we think we're gonna win with. Okay, but now we got to find a way to poke holes in it. If I was them, how would I attack? What would be my counter rebuttal? Whatever. Like that's that's how it's supposed to be. This shit here on YouTube. Nigga, you the bitch ass nigga. You the bitch ass nigga. Shut up. You better not come to the fight. Drop the Eddie. I got shooters. You know I ain't. You know uh, my father got my father living in the mansion. You heard what Floyd say? You know, you, you can write you can write all the names. You can write all you want about me, but look at the house I go to and look at the house he go to. <laughs> I can't I can't feed my kids with legacy. That's what he said. The flow modes. Right? So it is what it is, oh man. It is what it is. Yeah, they need some nigga. I mean, I can't pronounce these motherfuckers, man. Round one over with. Shout out to shout out to Aunt Jessica. She say sound like some medicines. Yeah, one dude named Mark um, Marbadov and another dude named you know. Ah oh, man, I don't know what the motherfucker name man. Hey, hey, Jessica, I can't I can't even pronounce this dude name. We gotta we gotta give him some nicknames or something. You get what I'm saying? Like AK or little shotgun or you know uh, you know little shotgun little shotgun coming through here. You know what I mean? He he shot the jab out there. You get what I'm saying? Hey, I said the brother said PTO. <laughs> yeah, these niggas here, boy. Hey, you know, I, you know, I like I like to point out the hypocrisies. It's the hypocrisy for me, fam. 
it's always a hypocrisy. Like, you know, like, boy, these niggas, boy, they come out in the woodworks, boy. I'll be, you know, I'll be ready. I'll be ready for them. I know what they're going to say for they say it. They're very, they're very predictable. I start, when I say I study these niggas, and for real, I study them for real. Yeah, that's it. Study them. I know what they're going to say for them. Say it. Preparing for them is too easy. Shit like taking candy from a baby. Night jail. Night jail. I ain't going to lie now. Doggone on um, mom. Oh, what's it no dude name? Oh, Madromov. Madromov got a night jab, though. That's a dude in the, uh, in the white, the white and gold. He got a night jab. The Madromov got a night jab. Oh, shit, okay. I ain't gonna lie, Madromov, night jab again, Madromov, okay. Got a nice little jab, you know. He timing them pretty good. Jab to the body, trying to get out the way. I wanna, I don't, you know, I wanna see him throw that on, throw that back in, though. Hey, what to say, in my opinion, he said, you got Twitter live pumping this week, this, this past week, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. You know, oh Lord, that's a nice. He almost caught him with an uppercut just then. He almost caught him with an uppercut just then. Tighten up now. All right, goddamn, Mar 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 Oh, that's a nice right hook, my dog. On uh, court, is that, uh, what's that? Court, Corbinov, Corbin. Let me write this shit down, man. Let me write this down. Yeah, cause they these dudes here, man. Corbin. So we got, we have Corbinov. Let me write this down. Corbinov. What is it? Corbin. Cur Corbinov. Kurbanov and Madromov. Damn. All right. Madromov in the Madr Madr was it Mar Mar Madr Madromov is in the white, white and gold. And the other dude in the red. Okay, cool. All right, this will help me better. All right. I look like uh, what we got. Okay, look. Okay, uh, shout out to uh, okay. Corbin off, Corbin off, try to throw a right hook and miss. Throw a right hook and miss. All right, all right. Dog on, he threw a left hook and miss. Well, he threw the left hook. My bad. Oh, that's a nice dog on, nice right, right hand over the top. My dog on, uh, by Marjoramal. <laughs> hey, hey, you know what? When, when, um, they already like, when, when they called in the fights, when they called in the fights on TV, they always have the names right there on the screen so they can see. So they can see. I ain't gonna, I said, I said, I got Marjoramal, I got Marjoramal winning so far. Oh, now who's that foot by Marjorie Ball? Okay, this motherfucking Marjorie Ball. Like, nigga, fuck that shit, dude. This shit ain't sweet. Shit, you, know, you might think that's some, you might think I'm a Euro bomb or something. Shit, I don't know what you're talking about. They, oh, okay, that's a nice right hand to the hip. My dog going Corb off. Okay, on Corbin off. Oh, he tried to throw that. He, he still trying to throw that right uppercut. Look like he trying to do the, look like he trying to block with the shoulder a little bit. You know, is he trying to do the, um, the Philly shell a little bit? Okay. There you go. Look like he look doing it. Look like he doing the mongoose a little bit. The mongoose and the possum. You know, I got, I got that, I got that mongoo style. Oh, okay, okay, shit, motherfucking Marjorie Moore, Marjorie Moore, what's happening, baby boy? Let him know what. Oh, that's a nice two piece by Marjorie Moore. Nigga, Marjorie Moore, it was slow, but it got there. That was a nice two piece by Marjorie Moore. Nigga, motherfucking Marjorie Moore, putting hands and foots on that dude, man. True, shit. true, true. Nigga, motherfucking Marjorie Moore, shout out to SP got beats. Man, Marjorie Moore, man, Marjorie Moore, man, come on, man. Hey, 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 uh, hey, shout out to MK, MK, man, salute to you, fam. Shout out to MK, man. Yeah, nigga ain't mother that like motherfucking bullshit. Nigga murder them all. Nigga murder them. Oh damn, my camera went off. Damn. Sorry about that. Nigga motherfucking murder them all. Nigga like shit. I think this shit sweet over here, man. Hey, what he say? He said I need some smearing off. Hey, you know what? Hey, hey, small X. I, I can remember that name. They, they need to call them smearing off. And you know what? You know what we gonna do? Check it out, fam. For you, small X, we gonna call murder them all smearing off because he got white trunks on. And since uh, so, we gonna say smearing off right here. Smearing off. Smirnoff versus, uh, yeah, let's see. What am I going to say? Smirnoff versus tequila? Or Brandy? What is a Brandy? Smirnoff versus Brandy. So, my, okay, round three don't start it. My, my, listen, listen, listen. Uh, uh, Marjorie Marv is Smirnoff. He the dude in the white. The dude in the white is Smirnoff. Smirnoff represents white. Okay, shit, we, we in the motherfucking round three. Nigga, man, we finna get butt out of here, man. Nigga might not, nigga might not. Ooh, that's a nice little jab that dog on Smirnoff, man. Tighten up, Smirnoff. Tighten up. That's what I'm talking about. I'm, I'm riding with the dude in the white and gold. That's what I'm rolling with. I'm rolling with white and gold right here, man. He look like he got a little rhythm, you know, fainting a little bit. You know, nice little block. You know, okay, in the back end. See, see, so let me tell you something. Brandy. Brandy, the dude in the red trunks, his name Brandy. Brandy a little too slow. Now he's dropping the lead shoulder. He's dropping the lead shoulder. Dropping the lead shoulder to swing the overhand right to the top. The, the, the problem is he's he, he, he can hit that jab, though. The eye going to be closing in a minute. 
That eye gonna be closer than the me, but you can believe that there, boy. I can tell you that there, but listen, we we talking in that eye. You think think this shit sweet? This, oh, okay, nice little combo, nice little combo. I like. He did a little something, something. Brandy did a little something, something. Brandy's the guy in the red. Uh, smearing off is the guy in the white. We gonna we just get changed. They name we just gave him some easier names to pronounce. You get what I'm saying? I got dog going smearing off nigga smearing off winning right now, dog. Smearing off winning right now. Shit, I'm talking about man. We ain't, this shit ain't sweet over here, man. Oh, ooh, that's a nice left foot by Smear though. Nigga, Smear though caught up with that left foot pulling back. Okay, but nice backhand. Backhand, but it got blocked though. Brandy threw a black hand, but it got blocked. Nigga, motherfucker, Smearing off ain't playing over here, man. Looking like a, he looking like a, uh, looking like a fake ass on uh, Vladimir Klitschko. Looking like a flake. Look, 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 like a fake Vlad. Looking like, he, he looking like Vlad on the low. On the low. Not on the high, but on the low. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Vlad on the low. There you go, man. Yeah, what I'm talking about, man. Shit. Okay, you know what, man? Brandy, you got to work on that check left foot, man. That check left foot. You been throwing it, but you been missing. You, you been checking, but ain't nothing been there. The check been bounced. Oh, that's okay, okay. Look at motherfucker smearing off coming with that right hand. Jab it to the body. You know, you know what I mean? Jab it to the body. I don't see motherfucker smearing off shit. Look like buddy eye closing a little. Is it closing? No, it ain't closing yet. It ain't closing yet. Yeah, man, you see, this the thing, right? You trying to time him. See, Brandon trying to time smearing off, but he can't time it. His timing ain't on, ain't on right now. He can't find his timing or his rhythm. Okay, he trying to drop that right hand, though. He, he almost landed that right hand. That's what he looking for. He looking for that one big shot. Okay, he doing the Philly shell a little bit. Look at him. Doing the Philly. Okay, doing the Philly. Okay. All right. Yeah. Yeah, I see him. You see him. You know what I mean? Doing the Philly a little bit. Y'all see him doing the Philly a little bit? Yeah, man. Oh, that's a nice, a nice little left. I'm cut by dog on Brandon, but look at that dog on left. That left hook by dog on Smearing off. Smearing off got a nice little left hook. Yeah, man, he faint with the backhand, but look here, man. He trying to, ooh, yeah, he trying to do the, ooh. Yeah, he trying to do the old Philly, man, the Philly. The, okay, okay, okay. I got Smearing off winning three rounds to zero. True, true, true. Hey, hey, listen, hey, hey, Jay, Jay, I got smearing off winning three rounds of zero right now, man. Bet the whole house, bet the whole house on, <laughs> bet the whole house on smearing off. Shout out to Pauline. Pauline is in the building. Shout out to Mimi24. Who else here, man? Any, any, any tender, you know, today, tender on their Fridays, tender on their Friday, 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 tender on their Friday. Ah. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, don't talk about it, man. I'm finna take y'all back to old school, my dad, Miami Dade County, man. Tell them about their Fridays, man. You know what I mean? Tell them about their Fridays. <laughs> hey, here you go. All right, this, uh, this, is this round four? I think this is going into round four. I got Smearing off right. Smearing off, Smearing off doing his thing right now. He doing his thing right now. Shout out to La Jessica. But the baby face assassin. Okay, we got, here you go. We got dog going Smearing off. Round, what round is it? I think it's round four. Yeah, round four right here. This is a 12-rounder right here. Smearing off is in white. Brandy is in. No, you don't need smearing off in red wine. This is what we're going to do, right? And since, 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 the, since the dude got the red shorts on, we're going to call him red wine. Smear it off in red wine. <laughs> hey, smear it off with it right now. Shout out to Cooking with Sir Senior. SP got beats. What's up, fam? Shout out to Cooking with Sir Senior, man. Yeah, man. You know, smearing off in red wine, man. That's what it is, man. Red wine losing right now. Three rounds to zero. Smearing off. We got a nice check left hook going in there. All right. All right listen, red wine had them drop the right hand on him. All right, all right, all right. Okay, smearing off. Fainting to get in. Fainting to get in. The dog going on red wine trying to, he trying to check in with the straight right hand. Oh, Lord, he's swinging. He threw the right hand to the body, but he got blocked with the elbow. Then he, he, he keep pouring at that left. He keep pouring at that right eye, though. You know why he pouring at that right eye? That jab. That jab. True, true, yep. true. He pouring at that right eye because of that jab. It's going to get to him in a minute. It's going to get to him in a minute. I'm telling y'all what time T.I. is now. That jab. Oh, that's another jab. Another jab again by dog on Spear, though. You know, okay, that's what I'm talking about, baby. Okay, nice two-piece to the body. My dog on uh, red wine. Red wine trying to do a little something, something. But it's timing off. He keep throwing that uppercut, but he missing. Nice left hook by red wine. Red wine got a nice left hook. You know, this is we watching a fight right now between red wine, red wine and smearing off. Okay, there you go, there you go, right there. We got some vodka. Red, you know, you know, they got that smearing off vodka. Anyway, but that's okay, that's okay. Anyway, all right, let's see what's up. They done reset. They're in the middle of the ring. There's a minute and 20 seconds left in this round. Round four. Minute and 20, 20 seconds left in this round. There, oh, nice, nice right hand by dog on red wine. 
Red wine, that was a nice, nice jab by red wine. Okay. He dropping it. He gave him the shoulder though. He gave him the shoulder, trying to do the, you know what I mean? Look like he trying to do the laughing taffy a little bit. Look like he trying to do the laughing taffy a little bit. Yo, ooh, that's a nice jab by dog on spear though. You know what I mean? The laughing taffy. The oh, nice left hook by dog on red wine. That's a nice one there, boy. Nice left hook by red wine. Okay. Smearing off in red wine. Nice dog on right hand by dog on um by dog on smearing off. Caught him good, caught him good too. He tried to hide, tried to hide his head behind his shoulder, but it didn't work. It didn't work. You get what I'm saying? 40 seconds left in this round, round four. 40 seconds left, jab it to the body, jab it to the body. I, you know what? I think I think Smirnoff setting up that right hand though. He, he jab it to the body because he want to he want to drop that. He want to jab to the body and come over the top of that right hand. That's what he want to do. Referee done broke him up. 20, 25 seconds left. 25 seconds left. You know what I mean? Hey, uh. In my opinion, said red wine just got cleared to fight this week. <laughs> shit. Hey, I'm trying to shit. I'm trying to get some of that. Hey, you know what? I'm, I'm trying to shit. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get some of that cheese too. Shit. Got, I got I got to find me a sap suck I can fight. Shout out the dog on La Jessica. Everybody getting that a rap money. Shit, I want to get some of that a rap money too. Nice two piece. But dog on but dog on smear. No man, I'm trying to tell you, man. We got some of that vodka, vodka versus red wine. True, true. True. I got, I got, I got, I got, I got that smearing off vodka. I got vodka winning. I got vodka winning. Dog on uh, four rounds to zero. Shout out to La Jessica. She said me too. Yeah, listen, man, it is what it is, man. It is what it is. Yeah. EMT Rick said you guys picking AJ by stoppage. Who you got? Who you got, EMT? Who you got? Shout out to Sean Carter in the building. Shout out to Robert. Robert, what's going on, fam? AI's in the building. Who else we got? Pac, though. Pac. Let's see. We got Eric in the building. Sheila from Cali. Hustino, what's going on, brother? Cooking with Sir Senior. Ali Muhammad. Uh, Leonardo Rodriguez. SP got B. Steven 47. All right, we got round five start. Pablo, what's going on, bro? Uh, we got round five start. Shout out to Rick Tim. Rick in the building. South side of Houston in the building. There you go, round five. Nigga smearing off his beating dog on red wine. I would call him MD2020 mad dog, but he, he I don't see mad dog in him. I don't see no mad dog. It, it, it'll be, you know what I mean? I got to call him red wine. I can't, even though, even though mad dog MD2020 is, is a wine, but, but you get what I'm saying. Y'all get what I'm saying. You get what I'm saying, though. Oh, no, that's a nice right here, my dog on mad dog. Nigga motherfucking red dog. Dog on wrong. What I call a mad dog. <laughs> Nigga motherfucking mad dog had to drop that right hand. What I write, oh, that night jab, night jab by EJ. Night jab by EJ. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Tighten up, Vaca. Tighten up, Smearing off. Tighten up, Vaca. Night up, no. We got some of that naughty head. We got some of that naughty head. That Jenny, Jen, Jen. We got that Jen over there, too, boy. We got that Jen over. Oh, no. Nice left hook by dog on Vaca now. Tighten up, Smearing off. Smirnoff doing this thing. He doing this thing right now. Tighten up Smirnoff. Somebody, I, oh, nice jab. Both men traded jabs just then. Red wine and Smirnoff traded jabs. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. We got that red wine and vodka right now. Or we can go, or, or we can, or we can go to the gym. That night ahead. We can do that night ahead. We can do, oh, that's a nice right hook. Oh, Lord, that person. Boy, that nigga, the EJ. EJ caught him with the right hook and the left hook. Nigga, goddamn, nigga, Smirnoff got him on the ropes. Smirnoff ain't playing, man. Nigga, motherfucker, Smirnoff, boy. This shit. Y'all talking about this shit sweet. Nigga, motherfucker, Smirnoff, boy. Shit. Nigga, he caught him with a leaping right hook. And then came with the leaping left hook. Yeah, man. Shit, nigga, we beating the brakes off this boy right here, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. I bet you can't do it like me. <laughs> I bet you can't do it like me. True, true. <laughs> yeah, true. man. Yeah, I bet. I bet you can't do it like me. No, you can't do it. No, you can't do that, man. No, I know you can't do it. I know you can't do it. Yeah. All right. Yeah. You, you get me? Yeah, man. Shit. I had the dude. The dude in the white and gold is winning. He went it. That's all y'all need to know. <laughs> he got him on the ropes. Let them hands go. There's a minute left. Minute left in this round. Let them hands go. Okay. Don't 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 don't. Just don't put yourself out now. Don't. Oh, not nice right hook. Nice. Look here, man. Look here, man. Y'all got this. Y'all got this old weak ass red wine over there, man. This man ain't doing that, man. I I can't. I, oh, that's a nice over here, right by dog go. Smear it off. Oh, he said the referee waved it over. <laughs> Get a motherfucker smear it off. Ah, he doing backflips in there, man. Y'all know what time it is, man. Spear it off, baby. I told y'all, man. Adrian. Y'all see dog go spear it off, man. Yeah. Y'all see what it is? <laughs> Try to tell y'all, man. Get that weak ass shit up out of here, man. 
Yeah. <laughs> they gonna ride here with that old flip flam. Ain't nobody, ain't nobody on all that there, man. Yeah, get him, man. Get him out of here, man. Get him out of here. Hey, he, he, listen, he ain't had no business in the ring anyway. Get him out of here, man. For real, though. You know what I'm talking about. Y'all all know what I'm talking about, man. <laughs> you feel me? Don't everybody believe in Google? Go Google that shit. <laughs> That's what time it is. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Hey, y'all remember that song Rapping Duke? <laughs> you feel me? That different. That different. Nigga be saying, "Ask me that. What he nigga be saying? Hold on, hold on, nah, nah, nah. That different, nah. You hold on, nah, nah. Well, you, you do know that Godzilla. You know the Godzilla, motherfucking King Kong. From the, they got a movie coming out, man. They finna fight all the other monsters in the monster first. You do know that, right? Yeah, see, I see what I want, yeah. Now you see your fighter, your fighter. See, we don't work it out. See, your fighter got to fight. He got to fight. Uh. Oh, 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 you gotta fight Goku, Ultra Instinct Goku. Now, not regular Goku, Ultra Instinct Goku. Then we got to fight Lord Beerus. Then he got to fight Megatron and then Ultimate Prime. And then once he be all of them, then we'll give him some credit. Ran off on the floor twice. Soon as a nigga do all that, oh man, you know you you know you know my fighter, my fighter would have ran through them a lot, a lot easier. You do, you saw my fighter did his sparring. <laughs> These niggas, boy, I say, I say, boy, these niggas. Oh my God, yeah, yeah. All right, all right, yeah, brother, yeah, brother. yeah, whatever, yeah, whatever you say, fam. Whatever you say. From this point forward, from this point forward, I'm just pulling out floor. That's all I'm doing, pulling out floor. That's what I'm doing. Yeah, man. Shout out to Leo. He say, he, he say, um, he say, Coach, I missed the finish. YouTube put the honey dips. Okay, they put the honey dips on your feet. Mark say, uh, Korbanov lost me $8, but it's cool. Yeah, man, you know. Referee jumped in there and stopped it. You know what I mean? Referee jumped in there and stopped it. George say, um, he say, hey, Tim, he say, Tim Bradley was funny yesterday, coach. Yeah, 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 for sure, for sure. Shout out to Jamie. Jamie, what's going on, fam? Jamie, you ought to know what it is. You ought to know what it is. You know what I mean? So I'm just, you know, these niggas, yeah, listen, these, this dog on, your dog on red wine, red wine got stopped. He wasn't going to win anyway, though. Oh, so buddy, oh, so buddy got the European title? What that is, though? That's the IBF European title, huh? Okay, see, Eddie Hearn in there, Eddie in there, so his fighter won? Okay, Eddie in there with his fighter, his fighter won, huh? They don't got the dog on IBF European title? Um, efforts say, um, coach, any thoughts on what Ward said about Canelo's resume? No, nah, no, nah, I haven't even heard it. I haven't even heard what Ward said about Canelo's resume. Oh, you know, again, but, but, you know, I mean, it doesn't matter. According, according to Floyd, don't none of that shit mean that anyway. You can't feed your kids with resumes. You can't feed your children uh, with belts. You can't feed them with legacy. That's what Floyd say so. It is what it is. Who am I? Who am I to argue with what they say the greatest fighter in the history of boxing? True, true, true. Anyway, you know I'm bleeding that shit. But anyway, anyways, y'all, you got you guys know me as, uh, as my brothers and sisters in the UK would say. I love the banter, Coach Malachi. I love the banter. I love the banter. I can do this shit all day. I used to do this shit in school. I used to do this shit in school. I was like a class clown in school, right? Me and my homeboy Sydney. Me and my homeboy, Big Herm, you know, Big Herm, it, it, it was a class. That, that's, that's all we did all day on the school bus, all that shit. School bus, city bus, shopping mall, didn't matter. That's it. So we, I can do this shit all day. Uh, shout out to Teo. He says it's for the WBA belt, Charlo belt. Oh, okay. Okay. You talking about Jamel Charlo? All right. They got some, they got, they got some dudes in the ring. Oh, uh, I'm not, you know what? I had the volume turned down, so you know. SP say, Coach, you just gave me and I gave me a short video about funny criteria you got to have to get the fights you want. I mean, I mean, it's the truth. It's the truth. I've been listening. I've been calling, listen, I've been calling this shit out, SP, for three years I've been on YouTube. 
I can we came up with commandments. I have a boxing criteria. You know what these niggas in the chat told me on uh, YouTube? Throw the, they say throw, throw throw the criteria away. Ain't nobody doing that. Yeah, she uh 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 level of competition. What you mean? My party who you level of competition. See, my party, you know, that dude, he he gotta earn the right fight. My party, we ain't fight, we ain't fight him. Okay. Um how many top ten fighters you fought? What you mean? Whole head cheese. Just as good as any of them other dudes. All right. Did you dominate the weight division? Yeah. We not that pooch out, Willie. Hobo Sam. Show the big nuts. Start from the Thundercats. Papa Smurf. And our Gargamel. All right, all right, all right. Well, you ain't fight Megatron in your division. Optimus Prime in your division. Goku in your division. Uh, uh, Vegeta in your division. Yeah, yeah. Them dudes, they don't bring that to the table. Okay, cool. All right, all right, all right. Um, how many career defining fights you had? Let's see. Pooch chop Willie. Whole Head Cheese. Show the big nuts. Chico Stick. All right, all right. You know, do know that Godzilla no more over there. Yeah, yeah. They, they don't. They know, you know, it's about putting Bunch of sheets, okay. You know, uh, that, that you know, no fights ain't no big fights. Why y'all keep saying they big fights? Okay, all right. Uh, and, and number five, did you fight the best in the division? Yeah, I fought the best in the division. You know, I, you know, we, we fought, we, we fought dog on Godzuki. You know, God, no, I'm talking about, did you fight Godzilla? No, we ain't fight Godzilla, but we fought Godzuki. True, true, true. Uh, 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 uh. So, so that we do, that we doing now? That we doing now? I've been, I've been, I've been holding it down for three years. That's what we doing? Okay, cool, cool, cool. Let everybody, let everybody fight who they want to fight. No problem. I ain't tripping. True, true, true. Just don't come over here telling me about a fighter that you don't like ain't fighting nobody but while capping for the other guy that you do like and, well, and he ain't fighting no goddamn body. To this day. You get what I'm saying? Shit. Hey, me, me, you feel me? I'm just saying, because uh, listen, I'm going to point it out. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to point it out. I'm going to point it out. Yeah, man. He ducking it. He ducking it. Cherry picking. You know, he cherry picking, man. He like, you know, shit, you know, uh, real champions, real champions, they don't duck and they don't do no cherry picking. But when you when, when you are put in a, a certain position, he should be go. I mean, he's able to, like, like me. And you know, when I was in a position, I can pick and choose who I want to because I, I, I earned that right. You feel me? <laughs> you feel me? You know, that rule, that rule, that rule only applies to people who are on the popularity list. Anyways, anyways, anyways. Um, yeah, I got, I got, I got the volume on mute, man. I ain't man. Shit, I'm feeling on man. Law today, Friday. Just got paid. Friday night party bumping. Oh Lord, have mercy. And get what? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, hold on. You know what we gonna do? I'm gonna play y'all one of my rap songs. One of my favorite rap songs. By one of my favorite rappers. I love the dude, man. R.I.P. to this brother here, man. All right, all right, Peter, this brother. Where he at? Wait, all right, Peter, this brother, man. God damn, man, I'm feeling man shit. I'm feeling good today, fuck it. I'm feeling good today. Just gonna play some of it. Where he at? Where he at? I'm just gonna play some of it, fuck it. Man, man. Yeah, man. Nah, he ain't, man. Yeah, oh man. Got me some of the good green. R.I.P. the Young Dolph, man. R.I.P. the Young Dolph. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Listen, man. Uh. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. We was down for so long, didn't have no. Still got those fist bags. Pull up, 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 pull up. 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 Pull up.
long as I'm no trust. On my girl, watch the hook glow up. Rich nigga still in the neighborhood, still eating coke. Yeah. Great nigga, bitch, I'm in the Bentley doing donuts. Yeah. I can tell myself how to get millions, ain't nobody show up. It's tall. From my young nigga, 50 bucks, told him little nigga grow it's up. Dope. Hold up, hold up, hold up. <laughs> yeah, this is CCC right now. I ain't. Oh, hold on, I I'm gonna get out. Right now, dog. I, right now, like, this bossy shit, I'm done with it as it relates to that. This bossy shit, we just gonna have fun with it, dog. Just enjoy ourselves. That's all I'm gonna do. I ain't finna be all in tongue wrestling with these niggas no more. Let, let them let them do what they wanna do. It is what it is. I, I see it for what it is. I see it for what it is. I'm just gonna have me some fun with this shit. It is what it is. Like 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 my main man Steve Kim say, I'm convinced that I have seen the best years of boxing that I'm going to see. Those days are over. So let everybody let everybody do what they wanna do. I, one thing about Coach Malachi, I'm not gonna complain. I'm going to make adjustments. I'm not the guy that's going to complain about, man, I, I ain't getting this and I ain't getting that. I ain't going to complain. I'm going to make adjustments. I'm going I'm to do like uh, Peyton Manning used to do. Peyton Manning get to the line. He see something that he don't like. He say, Omaha, Omaha, Omaha. He'll, he'll change the play. Omaha, Omaha. He make, he make, he do an audible. Yeah, so it is what it is. Shout out to Jab Step. Hey, okay. Dropping that. Bam, dub on your boy. Hey, Leroy. Super Jack received. Playtime's over, boy. Boy. Shit, you know what I mean? You know, I ain't trying to change these niggas, man. Let them do what they're going to do. Shout out to Jab Step, man. I appreciate you, brother, man. Shout out to Jab Step for the support, man. It is what it is, man. You know, we you know we, we know we love the people over here, man. It is what it is. We going we going we going to hold our line over here. Trust me. We ain't changing on that. We holding the line over here. It just right now, you get what I'm saying? It just that uh you know, I got I got to show these niggas. See, what it is is this: what it is. They got to get a strong dose of what they've been capping for. Once they get a strong dose of what they've been capping for, and they don't. See what I what I notice about these what I notice about these hypocrites, these hypocrites in boxing. What I notice about these hypocrites is they, they don't like it when their hypocrisy is shown to them right in their faces. So let the hypocrite get his way for now. And then when the whirlwind of what the hypocrite was fighting for comes back to him, they're not going to like the taste. That's, that's, how it, that's how it is. That's how it is. You know what I mean? So that's where the selective outrage comes in. Down from the bar, there's a platform stage. People pimping, pimping, sharp as razor blades. Yeah, see, when the whirlwind come back from what the hypocrite don't say he wanted, no, 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 nigga, this is what you niggas been saying. How I know? I've been saying this here for three years, dog. Three years. Came up with commandments and have a boxing criteria. I got shit it on. So, you know, hey, man, I'm done. Shit, I'm done. Let a nigga do, let a, let a nigga do what he's going to do. I'm going to say smoke this weed listen to Dolph. <laughs> I'm going to smoke this weed and listen to Dolph. Yeah, y'all, nigga, you want to argue? Yeah, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I ain't got time to be arguing with no niggas, no, sir. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Well, conda niggas, ain't shit but a laptop revolutionaries. Get the fuck back. <laughs> no, sir. I am not fixing to argue with you. I care nothing, sir, about your feelings. How you feel, those feelings are subjective to you. I came with, we came with the boxing commandments and the criteria. Don't nobody give a damn about the criteria or the commandments. Fine. Fine, I ain't tripping, I ain't tripping. I ain't tripping. I am not tripping. Hey, listen, these niggas, listen, man, I'm gonna advise all of them. Canelo, Crawford, uh, Tank, Devin Haney. Because y'all see what's going on, right? Like this is the this is you know, this is the the money game, money game. Sanctioning bodies, belts don't mean nothing no more. Don't nobody care now about legacy. You got dudes calling the show, arguing about that. They don't care now about legacy. They pick and choose when they want to cap for certain fighters. They use duck language. They use duck language when they defending their fighters. That's fine. That's fine. I ain't tripping shit. We ain't tripping. We ain't tripping. Nah, we ain't tripping at all. 
We ain't tripping on that there at all, boy. Bam, put that right that there. So fuck it. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, nigga, whatever you say. Whatever you say, fam, whatever you say. I'm finna sit here listen to, I'm finna listen to Dolphin and Burn. That's what I'm gonna do. And that's what it is, so. Uh, shout out to Eric. He said, he said, hold up, Coach 999. Hold up. <laughs> hey, 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 you know what? That's what I be, that, listen, that, that's, that's, that's what I be thinking. That's what I be, hold on, 999. Yeah, you nigga, nigga, fuck, I look like arguing with you about some millionaires. I'm not finna be arguing about no motherfucking niggas that's millionaires. I'm trying to get the money they got. I am not fixing to be arguing about no millionaires. Not me. Shit. I like women. I like women pussy and money. I ain't finna be arguing with no niggas about no about, about some about some more niggas. That ain't happening. Not with me. Uh anyways, anyways. Oh, I, oh, you know what? I got I to gotta be a little bit more PG because I, I have kids listening to the show, too. I have kids listening to the show, so I got to be a little bit more PG, man. So I got to try to clean my language up a little bit, to be fair. I got to try to do that. I got a lot more kids listening to me, so I got to I gotta tighten up on my act. Or as it relates to that. You know, but anyways, anyway. You get what I'm saying, though? He said, is it just me or these UK fights uh, make, make, the, make the day drag? <laughs> Hey, G5 say, man, is it me? Bro, they, hey, they, hey, they ill dragging it out, though. They, I ain't gonna lie, hey, G5, hey, they ill dragging it out. See, I haven't, I haven't been watching all of it. Like, this is my second fight I've seen so far. It's dope. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Yeah, man, shit. That, that's my favorite Dolph song, bro. Like, I miss that dude, fam. I miss that dude. That's my favorite doll song. That song right there. Hold up, hold up. Like, bro, I listen. I had that shit on repeat yesterday. I listened to that shit about 25 times straight yesterday. 25 times straight. Literally. And this another thing, too. It seemed like, like the, all, all the dudes who, we, it's like we eat our own. I'm going to tell you what I mean by that. The people who, the people who make it and come up, <laughs> anytime he break himself back or whatever, keeping it real, he gets killed. Or the ones who represent it for the people, they get killed. And the people who you represent it for, nine times out of ten, it's going to be one of them that kill you. And... You get what I'm saying? And once you once they got you out of the way, whoever they is, the people move on. And it keeps going. I noticed that. I noticed that my 25 years ago, I lost my mother, right? And when, when she passed away, it was one of the saddest days of my life. So I have her on the wall right here. I have my mother on the wall behind me. My mother, my aunt May, two, two of the most influential women in my life. Um helped raise me, right? So, what I remembered about that day, well, it was that night, rather. But what I remembered about that day, when I got the phone call that she passed, what I remembered was the bird, the sun was out. The birds kept chirping. People didn't feel how I felt because what I felt was subjective to me. Right? And over time, time heals everything. Over time, I learned to deal with certain things in life, as you all do. You, at time, you learn to deal with things. And what I realized is, you know what? It's going to be the same shit happen when I leave this motherfucker. Shit going to keep going, dog. Got to keep living, right? So I'm not going to, as related to this boxing stuff, I feel that I fought the good fight. And I'm just going to sit back and watch it. I'm just going to sit back and watch it now. I'm going to laugh. I'm going to kiki. We're going to talk that. We're going to talk that trash like we always talk that trash. We're going to have some fun with it. I'm going to sit back and watch dudes send gun emojis on Twitter. And dudes call me cool all the time, sell out, whatever, whatever they want to say. I'm just going to sit back and watch, laugh, have some fun with it. Get this money. We're going to do these bomb-ass live shows. We're going to... 
shit. We did. We don't did fifteen hundred new subscribers in the past between uh, February and March. Between February and March, we don't got fifteen hundred new subscribers. Before this month is over, we'll we have another five hundred more. I can promise you that, and we're gonna be at thirty three thousand, and we're gonna do a thousand subscribers a month. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I know this shit. Know what I'm talking about. We go, we gonna grow. We got a movement going on over here. Ain't nobody gonna stop this movement. And uh, how we gonna do it? This is how we gonna do it. How we gonna do it is when we, we not gonna be arguing with these niggas. I'm not going to be hammering uh, certain things home to them. Let Jake Paul come in the game and make him some money. I don't care. Let Tank fight whoever he want to fight. I don't care. Let Canelo and Terrence Crawford and uh, David Benavidez, uh, uh, Connor Ben, uh, whoever, right? Let them fight who they want to fight. I'm not finna be have selective outrage on this shit. It's dudes that sing a new way to monster ain't fault nobody. Because they don't watch the 122 pound division. Oh man, you know, how he pound for pound? Why he pound for pound number one? He ain't did nothing. Okay, well who give me a fighter that's that's three four division world champions. And that's back and that's um um, uh, two time undisputed in the two back to back weight divisions. To give me a fighter that's doing that. They talk like everybody is doing that. So these guys, they defecate on the fighters that are doing things. The fighters that's really doing it, they, the fighters that's really doing it, they defecate on them. Tear them down. Oh man, he ain't did that. He ain't bought nobody. They ain't doing nothing. And the guy who ain't doing nothing. Because he put a brush and sheets and he popular and he went to the mall and bought a new purse and he got a lot of TikTok followers. They praised that guy. So don't come to me about no, don't come to me about no, uh, don't come to me about no doggone legs. Y'all, y'all don't give a fuck about that. It's fine. Let's go on back over. Let's go on. Let's go on back over here. Let's go on back over here to Dolph. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I just pulled a eight of codeine and a Coca Cola. I make it look too easy. I carry my whole hood on my shoulder. Yeah. If money not in the equation, please do not approach us. Swear to God, cut my day one nigga off because of jealousy. Yeah. Every day I'ma get fresh and pull up medicine. Dirty. Pull too much hurt by mistake because I'm heavy hand. Bitch, I'm the plug, best friend. You just a plug, man. Hey, fuck them niggas. I don't fuck with them hey, niggas. Hey, I'm yeah, yeah. Ask your CEO and your rap friend why they hate dog. <laughs> Rich nigga, how I pop it on? I the top come out, so I dropped it on them. Pay 30k over sticker price, I had to cop it on them. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Ain't nobody on right now. We was down for so long, didn't have no choice but to go up. Go up, go up, go up, go up, go up, go up, go up. Go up, go up. Is on my girl watching her glow up. Rich nigga still in the neighborhood, still eating coca. Yeah. Straight nigga, bitch, I'm in the pit. I don't know shit. Yeah. Taught myself how to get millions, ain't nobody show up. From my young nigga, 50 bows, told a little nigga grow up. Let's see what's up. The fight's on yet? Nah, the fight's ain't on yet. Fight ain't on. Oh, they showing, they showing, they showing a commercial. Do y'all see a commercial right now? Are y'all seeing a commercial on the zone? Like I'm seeing a commercial. All right, they got, a, they got some dudes coming there. All right, they got some dudes walking to the ring. I have to listen. I have this on mute. I have this on mute, so I don't, I don't, I can't hear any sound. No commentating anything. Uh, shout out to Food Revolution. What's going on, fam? Yeah, I see him walking out right now. I see him walking out right now. Yeah, man, shit. You know what? I'm trying to listen. I'm trying to figure out how can I get me now. I'm trying to figure out how can I get me some doggone um some of them crossover books. I say shit, hey, shit. You know what I mean? This what they want. They want to see. They want to see top fighters ain't fight nobody and and belts don't mean nothing and sanction the bottom don't like this. What they've been saying. This what they've been pushing, right? Don't no fight on the floor. Maybe with a green print. Okay, cool. I, I need to follow that green print then. Shit, I need I need to see can I get get in the ring with one of them Paul brothers or something. Shit, hell yeah, get paid doing it too. 
Ah, yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah, man. George say uh, people want to hear, see and hear bullshit. Yeah, pretty much. That's what they want to see and hear. They want to see and hear the bullshit, so give them the bullshit. Give them what they want to see and hear. They want to see and hear it, and they're going to pay. They're going to pay to come see and hear it, too. <clears throat> it is what it is, so. Uh, shout out to Big Bird. Big Bird, what's going on, fam? Mike, the mobile mechanic. Salute. The natural. Salute, fam. JC is in the building. <clears throat> My sister, Food Revolution, is here. Uh, Knockdown 305. Brady 12 say, Coach, we did the heavy lifting. Yeah, I did the heavy lifting. I get it. I get it. I get it. Okay, they got dog on Vargas walking to the ring. Okay. Walking to the ring. What do you got? Okay, we got a... Oh, he got Manny Pacquiao walking him out of there. Okay, Manny Pacquiao walking him out. Dog on Ray Vargas. Got Manny Pacquiao walking him out. Yeah, man. Okay, there you go. There you go. He walking him out. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, man. Shit. Hell yeah, shit. Fuck yeah. Vargas walking out. We gonna see what's up. He say, Coach, can we just have Friday night fights back? No, 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 no. I mean, you're gonna get some fights. You're gonna get some fights. Well, we got we got some. I mean, this fight, we got a fight right now on Friday nights. But I see what you're saying. Regular Friday night fights. I remember Friday night fights, Tuesday night fights. Yeah, them, yeah, them, yeah, them, yeah, them, um, um, MB, them days over with, fam. He say, he said, how, how about a poll, coach? A poll for what? You talking about um for um who everybody gonna win? I think a lot of people, you know, I mean. I mean, I think people are already, you know, again, I, I ain't going to be a lie to you, dog. Like, Stephen X, this is this is a MMA fighter versus a boxer. It's kind of hard for me to take this fight serious, to be fair. Because uh, as much as I like Ngano, he's an MMA fighter. So, uh, you know, I, I, am I taking this fight serious? No, <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. I fully expect Anthony Joshua to win this fight. I would be shocked and surprised if he lose. I'm just being honest with you. Yeah, so. Keith said, I'm picking the black guy. <laughs> hey, Keith said, I'm saying, I'm picking the black guy. Well, guess what? You're going to be right. True, true, <laughs> true. Hey, that's a good answer. That's a good answer. I'm, I'm picking the black guy. All right, I'm picking the black guy to win. Okay, yeah, that's a good answer. You know what I mean? You will, you will, there's a hundred percent accuracy that you're gonna get there. Unless, unless it end in a draw. It could, it could be end of the it could end in a draw. Could end in a draw. Brady 12 said AJ is soft as cotton tissue. <laughs> He said AJ is soft as cotton tissue. Brady 12, man. AJ, AJ must have slept with your girl or something, or your wife or something, fam. True, true, ah, damn. true. <laughs> He's soft as cotton tissue. <laughs> Dude, 666, six, six, 250 pounds, two, uh, two time unified champion, fighting some, 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 fighting some hell of a guys, falling in the living. He said, I got soft as soft as on, on toilet tissue. Woo! Lord have mercy. Brady 12, you must be Godzilla. Um, all right, all right. Um, I get it. I trust me. I get it. I get it, boy. I get it. I get it. I get it. Um, Nick Ball is in the building. Let's see what's up. This this gonna be a good little scrap. This gonna be a good little scrap. <sighs> this gonna be a good little scrap right here. Well, I'm hoping that's what it's gonna be. We hoping that's what it's gonna. Be. Nick Ball look like he rehydrate. Did he rehydrate too much? Nick Ball, he looking he looking a little fat. Look like he rehydrated a little too much. I remember Oshaki Foster had them put Oshaki Foster had them put them put hands and foot on dog on Ray Vargas. School don't say, Coach, you see the rapper Gunner wearing a dress? Oh, he wearing a dress? Wait, 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 he was wearing a dress. <laughs> 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 he say he wear the dress, huh? No, I ain't see that. Yeah, man, she she wear in there. She my father, she my father, my father wearing the dress. Yeah, she dresses in there, and he paint his fingernails, 
his toenail paint too. And yeah, oh, he she. And we just bought us a nice per Gucci purse. Yeah, see that? That what my father be doing. True, true, true. You know what I mean? See my father. See my father real. See you. You don't know nothing about that deal. It's about putting. It's about putting butts. In, it's about putting butts in seats. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah. Yeah, that's where we at, man. That's where we at. That's where we at. Hold up. Yeah, that's where we at. Hold up. 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 <laughs> that's where we at, man. Let's see what's up. Now, all Ray Vargas, can Ray Vargas keep this man? Now, we already know, dog, going on. Ray Vargas got to try to keep this man at the end of the jab. End of the jab. End, end of the jab. We got to keep him at the end of the jab. Let's see what's up. See what Ray Vargas do here. We know Nick Ball got to get on the inside. He got to faint, get on the inside, jab his way in, though. He got to jab his way in. Now, Nick, now, 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 Ray looking to drop that right hand early. I'm going to put the MC Hammer on your motherfucker there, boy. Soon as you bring your bitch ass in here, hack him for the drop that right hand on you. Straight down the pipe. You ought to know what time. Round one don't start it. Nick Ball, Nick got to get around that weak side, though. Ooh, boy, Ray, boy, Ray throwing that right hand already, though, boy. Nigga, Ray throwing that right hand. Look at Ray, Ray. Ray say this. Ray, Ray. Now, Ray, you can make easy work of this now. Now, Nick going to have to use jabs and feints to get in. I want to see can he get around that weak side, though. He got to get his head off that line, though. You got to get your head off the line. You can't jab with a jabber. You got to get your... Bro, if you're going to jab, take your head off the line when you're jabbing in. You the shorter fighter. Devil, ooh, that dog, 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 so that, that's all you got to do, Ray. Ray, that's all you got to do. If you're Nick, you got to double and triple the jab to get on the inside. Ray moving pretty good with his feet now. But Ray got to get off that line. Just get off the line. Ooh, that's a nice jab by, nice jab by Ray. I mean, nice jab by dog on Nick. Dog on Nick. Because what happened when Ray had no dip his head down, he got caught with a jab. Keep the distance. Keep the distance. You know what I want to see? I want to see, see, can Nick get it? Well, Nick can't do that, though. Nick can't do it. I want to see how, can he get around that weak side? He can't, you know, he, jab, he jabbing up. Go to the body, Nick. Nick, you got to go to the body, man. You trying to jab high. Counter, listen, counter. Oh, that's a nice jab by all. Nice jab by Nick. Look at Nick. Nick jabbing, okay. Nick, go to the body, dog. Stop head hunting. Dip your head to the left. I mean, dip your head to the right, dog, and double the jab to get on the inside. Go to the body, man. Go to the body, Nick. Ray, uh, Ray, all you got to do, keep, uh, keep, I said, Ray, nice right cross. All you got to do, Ray, keep on the end of that jab, Ray. Keep that jab in his face. Soon as he breaks his little ass in there, hack up, drop that MC ham on him. Hack up, put that hack up on him. You got to put the hack up on him now. As soon as he come in there, hack up. That's what you got to do. That's all you got to do. True, true, true. Okay, now you did a you did a leg shot. That wasn't no body shot. That was a leg shot there. Okay, look all right. Nice little uppercut. But you got, listen, you know what Nick not doing? Nick got the, has to counter Ray's offense. As soon as he throw that punch, but by, by, by the time he break it back, you got to be coming with something. Counter the offense. Look at that dog go. Ray, Ray, Ray. Ray almost landed that uppercut now. Ray almost landed that uppercut. Just look at Ray. Boy, Ray, you leaving your chin wide open, no boy. That right cross, you leave your chin wide open for that right cross. You can't be throwing that uppercut like that, bro. You was a little bit too far back. Okay, look at Ray. See what Nick do. But Nick, can Nick chop this tree down? Can Nick chop this tree down? This look like it's a, a, a can Nick chop, chop this tree down? That's what I want to know. Let's see what's happening. Let's see where we at. Oh, this okay. Okay, so Anthony Joshua, Joshua and Ganu fight is after this fight. Okay, this 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 is the co-main event. Hold on, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. He said that clip bring back hot memories. <laughs> hey, man, it is what it is, man. Yeah, you know it is what it is, man. I'm sitting back, man. Let's see. 
All right, round two don't start it. Round two starting. Nick, you got to get in there, dog. You got to get in there, Nick. Got to get in there. You know what I mean? There you go. There you go. You got to get in there, Nick. Round two don't start. <laughs> oh, this nigga, this nigga here got... What? Nigga got a skirt on? Cheat up. There you go. Oh, that's Gunner? Oh, they showing Gunner, huh? Walking with a skirt or something. What he got on? Some space boots? And he got some low on. Look at, okay, look at what he look at, Gangster. Nigga got a skirt. <laughs> this nigga got a skirt on. Poor Lord have Lord have mercy. Lord bless him. Bless him. Gangsters with skirts. Okay. Gangster rappers with skirts. All right, I don't see it. Okay, dog on Nick. Nick, you got to keep your head off that line. Nick, do you know what a body attack is, Nick? Come on, man. You got to go to the body, baby. Nice jab by Nick, but you got you got caught with a double jab. Ray, all you got to do, Ray, keep on the end of that jab, Ray. Oh, Ray, this is easy work right here, Ray. Listen, Ray Vargas, this is easy work. All you got to do, keep him on the end of that jab all night long. Keep on the end of that jab. He come on the inside because it's obviously not. Look at him. Nice uppercut by Nick Ball. Nice, okay. Nick don't know how to, Nick don't know how to go to the body, man. How you, listen, how you that short and don't go to the body? You got to go to the body, fam. Stop trying to jab the head. You looking for that haymaker. Looking for that haymaker. Ray, Ray moving around pretty good. He, he, he not even going to the body, dog. Go to the body. You sitting back waiting for him to throw, but then you not even counter him when he throw. Choke and smother, man. Choke and smother. You got to smother him like some, like, like, some smother, like some smothered pork chops. You know, a pork chops. You know, I don't eat swine, but it went back in my swine eating days. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta smother them like, like some, like some smothered pork chops, man. Ah, damn, you act like you Muslim. Smother them like some pork chops, man. Come on, man, go to the body, go to the body, Nick. Nick, go to the body. What you doing? All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. What's up? Yeah, man, tighten up, man. Oh, that's a nice right hand by dog on Ray. Ray, boy. Hey, Ray. Ray, you can't. Ray, he can't. I don't know if he can take too many in the right hands, boy. I don't know if he can take too many in the right hands. Ray getting Ray moving around. Ray dancing around a little bit. Look at that, Ray. <laughs> Ray. <laughs> Ray, like, Ray like this little short motherfucker. He's trying to, he try to get a nigga, man. Oh, wait a minute now. Hold on now. I ain't trying to. I ain't trying to let you get on the inside. Tie him up, Ray. Ray, like, I ain't trying to let you get on the inside. I'm going to put that jab on you now. I'm going to put that jab on you. Shit, look, this, 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 this man, this man refused to go to the body. Dog on Ray, Ray, Ray letting them hands go though. Nick trying to wait for the right punch. There is no right punch, man. How you just gonna put uh, that's a nice uh, overhand left by dog on uh, Nick? You know, how you gonna put Haiti's name in the hat? There is no fucking hat. <laughs> hey, y'all remember this here? Y'all remember this here? Y'all remember what Booker Ray said? Y'all remember? <laughs> hey, yeah, y'all remember what hey, y'all remember what Booker Ray said right here? Sunshine when tanks gone. I'll smack the shit out of in front of everybody. Only dark times for you. I mean, just throw Haney's name in the hat. There is no fucking hat. Ain't no sunshine when tanks gone. I don't play them type of games. Leonard Ellaby, why you always talking about me? Did you fucking learn your lesson from that? With, with AJ? Ain't no sunshine when tanks gone. I'll knock that motherfucker out. <laughs> Boy, look at his nose bleeding already. His nose, hey, goddess, what you say, goddess? Goddess say Muslims eat pork and date white women. You hit the nail right on the head. Yes, they do. True, true, true. I'm talking about, especially them, especially them, them American, I'm talking about the American, well, you know what? The Nation of Islam is, is a nationalistic organization. It's not, they're not Muslims. Because you can't be a Muslim and you can, Bear witness that, there's, that, that, that Allah appeared in the person of Master Farad Muhammad and Elijah Muhammad is the messenger. Once you do that, that's shirk. So that's not nation. That's not Islam. That's NOI doctrine. But I say all that to say this. Yeah, the, listen. The, the proets of the black dudes be the main ones with pork chop sandwiches on their, on their plates and, and find beautiful white women at home. True, true. Oh, he knocked he them out. He knocked them out. What he did? He dropped knocked them out. What he did? Oh, he just tripped him. Oh, I thought that was a knockout. Oh, 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 he said he's gonna take a point. What he did? He tackled him? He must have tackled him. I gotta, I gotta see that again. 
I thought I thought he knocked him out. I was like, God damn. I had no turn in my hand. Shit, man. Come on, man. Shit, that, that's my listen. Them niggas be talking. Them, 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 some, of, some of them main niggas. Like, you could tell. Oh, that's a night nice jab by dog on Nick, Nick Ball. That's a night nice jab by Nick Ball. Shit, let, let, this is easy work for you all night. Ray, you could do this all night. Nick, Nick, your face swelling up. You can't be taking too many no punches like that. Yeah, you got to angle them in the pocket, dog. Why you squared up in the high guard? You can't be squared up in the high guard like that. Yeah. Yeah, you can't be squared up in the high guard like that. Get your head off the line, dog. Like you not bobbing and weaving. You not bobbing and weaving. Come on, man. How you that short today? You got no bob and weave. You got the bob and weave, dog. Bob and weave. Man, they, hey, look, man, Ray Vargas, man, Ray, I got man, Ray, Ray clearly winning this fight. Body shot. Now that's your opportunity right there because he's winding up on shots. You can catch him in between the shot. Catch and shoot, man. Why Ray keep slipping and falling down? Why Ray keep slipping and falling down? Hey, what to say, God is God is saying my family members date white women only and hide and hide while eating bacon. <laughs> it's boy shit. I don't see I don't see dudes doing Ramadan break fast with pork skins and had pork grind residues on the Quran. True, true, true. Hey, I'm telling you, the, 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 uh, the blackest of the black dudes, them be the main ones. Well, like, like, like when you, like when you say you King Kong consciousness and you the Superman of black consciousness, them be the main ones. The proest of the blacks be the main ones. I'm telling you, I'm telling what I know now. They be the main ones. Like, so you got to watch them. The niggas who, yeah, what we got to do now, see, see the white man and the racist white, them be the main ones, boy. Them be the main ones. Like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he cause he he going too hard for it. He just too hard. Like, yeah, no, man, something ain't right about that dude. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Yeah, I know. There you go. Nice three piece by dog on Ray Vargas. Nice three piece. Ray, Ray let them hands go now. You know what, man? Nick Ball, Nick, Nick, I ain't I haven't given Nick a round yet. True, true, true. I haven't given Nick a round yet. Like for real though. I have not given Nick a round yet. Like, bro, like this man keeping his head center line. He's not bobbing his head. Um, he's not weaving shots. You know, he's not, he doesn't. I don't think he threw a body punch yet. He might have thrown one. He might have thrown one. He might have thrown one. You get what I'm saying? He might have thrown one. Yeah. Yo. <laughs> Shout out the dog on uh everybody who's sending me messages on IG, man. Shout out to everybody who's sending me messages on IG, man. Salute, salute to you guys, man. Salute to y'all. I appreciate y'all. I appreciate you. I really do. Here you go, man. Here you go, round. This round four, y'all. Two minutes and twenty. Two minutes and forty seconds left for round four. Yeah, oh, man. There you go, boy. Shit, my love, my yeah, boy. Nick dog on. Ray, Ray, Ray. This is easy fight right here, Ray. Ray, this is easy fight. But it don't get no Ray. It don't get no sweeter than this. <laughs> Nick Ball is tough. He is tough, but it, stylistically, man, this all this fight all wrong for him, man. It don't get no sweeter than this, Ray. Nick, Nick, looking for a wing in the pro. He looking for a haymaker. Putting his head down, throwing bolos. Jumping in the air. He jumping in the air trying to swing. He jumping in the air. Do man, come on, man. This man jumped in the air and did this. <laughs> this man jumped in. <laughs> what the fuck was what in the heezy? What in the heezy? <laughs> oh man. <laughs> oh, bro. This this is hilarious. Oh, there you go. Nice combo by Doggo. Nice combo by Ray, man. Ray, look at up. Ray, look at what he looking like Sugar Ray right now. Look at what's your name? Sugar Ray Vargas. <laughs> Sugar Ray Vargas right now, man. Nice jab by Doggo on Nick Ball. 
No, this, 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 boy, that's Nigel by Ray Vargas. Sugar Ray Vargas, what's up, baby? Sugar Ray. <laughs> hey, man, Nick Ball, man, Nick, boy. Nick, man, you got to come with a different game plan, dog. This ain't working, dog. Nick, this ain't working, dog. This ain't working for you. You ain't going to the body. You straight head hunting. Straight head hunting. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, you tough now. Nick, you is tough. I get that. You is tough. You tough. You you tough you tough now. You tough. I get you that. You tough now. I get you that now. I get you that, fam. But man, you keep doing the same thing, man. You gotta, you gotta look. Why your head on the line, dog? Like why you okay now you now you just angle now you just turn the shoulder yeah get oh yeah yeah caught with a two piece that did though nigga Ray nigga Sugar Ray Vargas Sugar Ray Vargas that caught dog on Nick with a two piece caught him with an uppercut caught him with caught him with all right I'm trying to tell you now I'm trying to tell you now 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 hold on now shoot nigga nigga no Sugar Ray Vargas y'all see Sugar Ray Vargas y'all see Sugar Ray Vargas <laughs> Sugar, Nick 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 wrestling Nick wrestling <laughs> Nick trying to wrestle look here man trying to <laughs> try to wrestle. <laughs> Nigga, I'ma get him, I'ma get him, I'ma get him, I'ma get him. Whole lot of more, whole lot of more, I'ma get him. <laughs> get back here, I'ma get him. <laughs> Nick, Nick, like, you know what I mean? Whole lot of more, whole lot of more. I ain't landing nothing yet, but whole lot of more. Nice jab. Oh, look, look, look at that. Oh, Lord, have more. Here you go, here you go. Here you go. They, they got him on the road. Okay, nice little hook by Nick. Man, Nick, man, come on, man. You gotta do, you gotta do better than that, dog. True, true. <laughs> True. Hey, I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna get him. <laughs> Whole lot of more. They got Big Bang Zay. Okay, you see Big Bang Zay? Nigga, motherfucker. Listen, boy, Zay, boy. Hold on, Zay. Shit. Hey, Goddess. Doggone Zay. Listen, Goddess. Zang, Zang ain't nothing to play with. Zang, Zang is the real deal. I can, I can tell you that right now. I like Zang. Well, I respect your ambition, Willie, but you got to have vision. Yeah, yeah, what I'm saying? I like Zang now. Nigga, Big Bang Zang, but Zay whole Zang is about 40. He about 40, right? 40 years old. Nigga Zang in there working. Nigga Zang Zang got it. Ooh, look at Zang. Look at Zang, boy. Look at Zang. Look at Zang. Boy, I'm trying to tell you, boy. That damn Zang, boy. Look at Zang. Zay Lee Zang, boy. I'm trying to tell you, boy. Man, hey, boy, we shoot, we shoot bad. We shoot bad in the headweight division over here. We ain't got nothing over here, boy. We had Wilder, Trevor Bryant, and my dog, Six Figure Johnny. True, true, true. Trevor Bryant, I don't think he, I think he don't got retired. He got put to sleep his last fight. Johnny Rice, uh, Johnny Rice, round five don't start y'all. Johnny Rice, um, right working the nine to five doing security. And, uh, and Deontay Wilder, he in the studio making, making mixtapes. <laughs> Hey, he, he in the studio, guy. He in the studio. He got another uh, Afrobeat, another, another Afrobeat album he making, man. Wild, wild, wild off in the go, wild off in the go on, um, wild off in the go on tour with Beyonce, man. That's what I heard. Finna go on tour with Beyonce. Like he just, y'all see what Nick Ball doing? Like when Ray Vargas throw, he just ball up, he just ball up, and he let him punch him. He ball up and let him punch him. He ball up and let him punch him, but he don't counter off the offense. Yeah, hey, man, six figure. They got my dog six figure, six figure back. You know the white man don't hide him. He on the white man job, that man. I told six figure. I say six figure. Well, uh, say, say, oh, that's a nice left hook. Nice left hook by Ray Vargas. I'm trying to tell. You, that's a nice left hook. The Ray Ray dancing around the ring, looking like float like a butterfly. Sugar Ray Vargas. Sugar Ray Vargas. Look at Sugar Ray. Sugar Ray Vargas. Man, this is Nick Ball. Nick trying, dog. Nick, I ain't gonna lie. Nick tough now. Nick is tough. I give him that. He is tough now. He is tough. Hey, SP say said ain't so. Man, Johnny Rice got a man. Johnny Rice doing security, man. He top flight security right now, dog. Johnny Rice is top flight security right now, fam. I, I SP, I ain't lying to you. Go on his Instagram page. He'll tell you. I ain't making this up. He'll tell you. He, he you know, he top flight security right now. I say, shit, Johnny, I'm all well, I might well hire you. You might well come over here work for Nick Sack Promotions. You know what I mean? And be security over here. You know what I mean? Johnny Rice, Johnny Rice by 6'7. So we got he by 6'6. Six, six. We get Johnny Rice. Yeah, come on over here, man. Come on over here, man. You know. You know, you gotta, you got you gotta, you gotta defend me from gun emojis. <laughs> you gonna have the easy job in the world, Johnny Rice. You gotta defend me from gun emojis. Drop the addict, just drop the addies. Uh 
You know, you better not come to the fight, demon emojis. You just got to defend me against that. You can have the easiest security job in the world. True, true, true. Uh, must see Nick Buck. See, Nick, Nick ain't got no plan. He don't know how to get on the inside. That's the problem. Nick do not know how to get on the inside. That's the problem. And he's still head hunting, winging, winging wide haymakers, not, not really landing clean. He don't know how to get a jab to get on the inside, man. He, he like, he's you, you head hunting. Yeah. He said, he said, Johnny, he said, Johnny too, Johnny too tough to be, uh, to be a B-side opponent. Man, shit, Johnny right. <laughs> man, shout out to my dog, six figure Johnny, man. Salome, uh, Salome say who, who will Spence fight next? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Good question. That's a good question. That's a good question. Well, hey, where I'm at with it, where I'm at, Salome, I don't give a damn. I don't care who fighting who. Let it, let everybody get their money, man. Y'all get your money, man. Fight the easy fights. If you want to fight tomato cans, fight tomato cans. You want to fight bombs, fight bombs. If you go, if somebody gonna pay you to do it, get in there and do it. I don't give a damn. He said, "Ball looking for a hail mary." Exactly. He's looking for a hail mary, bro. The man don't the, listen. Ball have no idea what body work is. Do you know how to go to the body ball? Do you know how to go to the body, man? Like, literally. You in the high guard for what? Why are you in the high guard? You're not even countering bargains. You're not even, like, throwing punches. And you're still jabbing, reaching for the head. You're still reaching. You finally dip low, try to weave a little bit. You, he looking for that one punch. He looking for that one punch. Vargas know it. We got Sugar Ray Vargas. Sugar Ray Vargas. <laughs> Yeah, Nick Ball is a very limited fighter. Push him down again. He's strong, though. He's strong. I give him that. He's strong. Nice combo by Ray. Sugar Ray. Nice combo by Sugar Ray. Sugar Ray, he's moving around a lot. Now, Ray, um, uh, Nick Ball waiting on him to get tired. He said he keep moving around. I'm going to get him. I'm going to get him. He's going to get tired soon. He gonna get tired soon as he get tired. I got him. I'm waiting on him, wearing him down. He can't keep it up. He can't keep it up. He can't keep it up too too much longer now. He been running the whole fight. And this, and this what Nick said. He been running the whole fight. Stay still. <laughs> Stay still. Stop running. <laughs> it's going. Go, oh, that's a nice right hook by dog. Oh, Nick. Nick. Okay, Nick caught him with a good right hook. Tighten up, Rick. Nick. Hey, you know what? That's what people gonna say. Some people. Gonna, hey, hey, Nick. Nick pushing the man head down and everything. Ray, like, come on. Come on, Puto, what's happening? What's happening? Come on, hop. Now take this with you. Take this with you. Whole lot of more. Whole lot of more, my boy. Whole lot of more. Yeah, come on, take this with you. There you go. You, you started trying to head hunt. I'm going to block it with the shoulder and come back and counter with the right hand. Block with the shoulder, come back and counter with the right hand. Since you don't want to go to the body, I ain't got to worry about you going to the body. You know, he got caught with a two-piece at the end. Nick, Nick want to wrestle. Nick, wanna, he want to he wanna throw that man. He want to wrestle. <laughs> Hey, he look crazy, him swinging up like this, dog. Like, it do look kind of crazy. Right? <laughs> this shit. This. Man, come on, man. <laughs> man, come on, man. <laughs> oh, man. Man, come on, man. Man, what, what they was, what, what was he working on in sparring? Like, bro, in preparation for this fight, this must have been a last minute replacement or something. You get what I'm saying? Like this, this must have been a, like what was he working on? This man ain't throwing no body shots at all. Headlock, got him in headlock. <laughs> he like he like a, he like a British bulldog. Do y'all remember that? Y'all remember the British bulldogs? Y'all remember the British bulldogs? Oh, he like yeah, they put him in the headlock, put him in the headlock. Hey, listen, man, look your man. This man, yo man, we, we you know what? Oh, not nice little love. He throwing, he trying to throw a haymaker. See, he trying to, he swinging for the fence. Come on, man. True, true. Six down, six true. motor go. Six down, six motor go. Hey, um, the natural. I want to ask him, what have they been working on in training? <laughs> Everybody over there laughing. Tyson Fury and his wife laughing. 
doggone Frank Warren laugh. Everybody laughing, man. Everybody laughing. They, they like, look, this man ain't uh, see a turkey island chic over there. Like, yeah, man, come on, man. Everybody laughing at Come on, man. Man, come on, man. Go to the body break him down, man. If you go to the body, you make it a whole lot more competitive. You look silly trying to jump. In. He jumping in the air. Come on, man. This man Ray Vaughn about six seven. You jumping in the air swinging. He like this here. Yeah, there. Keep your keep your head. Keep your head still. Come on, man. Keep your head still. I'm trying to hit you. Come on. <laughs> this shit is, man. What kind of shit this is, man? <laughs> this is. <laughs> Come on, man. Bro. I remember how Mike Tyson used to break them tall fighters down. Mike go straight to the body. Mike goes, Mike, Mike could dip low and be bobbing and weaving. He be, he be, he be bobbing and weaving inside the pocket. And when he get in there, hack up, left hook to the body. Hack up, you know what I mean? Look, come on, man. Bro, come on, Nick. Go to the body. He, the man tall and slim. Now he got him in the headlock. <laughs> Referee like, look, man, look, look. I told this. I told you, bitch. You listen. Look, you put the man in the headlock one more time. You put him in the headlock one more time. I, I got, I got some. I'm taking the point. You, <laughs> they just clash the heads. Nick, boy, Nick, boy, Nick, trying to do whatever it takes, boy. Nick, Nick, like shit. Nick trying to rough him up. Nick trying to rough him up. Oh, that, that nice right hook by Nick. That's a nice right hook though. Nick looking for that one punch. Nick looking for that one punch, man. That's what he looking for. Yeah, man. I know I'm gonna burn one. I know I know when the main event come on, I'm burning. When the main event come on, I'm burning. You can believe that. <laughs> we burning, boy. You can believe that. Yes, sir. Just to show us rabbits eat carrots. There you go. Dog on Nick. Look here, man. You know, this is uh, you know what, man? I, I I can't even really say this in a this, this fight is so predictable. Like, this fight just so one-sided, bro. I can't, I can't give, I can't give Nick anything. Nick swinging haymakers. <laughs> he got hit in the back of the head. But he, he swinging haymakers. He like, oh, can't stay still. Whole lot of more, bye, boy. Whole lot of more. Play the more rock. Play the more. Play the more rock. He throwing hay. He just, ugh. he just throwing the wide hooks. Nick, man, come on, Nick. You do you know what a jab is? J Nick, go to the body, Nick. Nick, go to the body. You got to go to the chest, man. It's right. Oh, okay, dog on Ray. Ray had no sugar. Ray had no stomach a little bit. Nick said, Nick. Okay, Nick. Nick trying to. Nick caught him with a nice left hook. Both men trained the left hook since then. Tighten up, Nick. Okay, look at him. Ray. Ray going to the body though. How the how how is the guy that's seven feet tall going to the body and you fold? Oh, that's a nice right hook by dog on Nick. And you and you fire too. And you ain't even you ain't throw the body shot yet. Boy, no, boy, look at Nick. Nick, Nick catching him though. Nick starting to catch him a little bit now. Oh, that nice right, nice right cross by dog on Ray. Look at Nick, boy. Nick let the ooh, okay, Nick, okay, Nick. Nick like yeah, boy. I'm trying to ooh, that's not nice right here by Nick. Look at Nick. Nick wearing him down now. Nick like yeah, I got him, boy. I'm trying. Look, 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 this, I'm wearing him down now. Whole lot of more, boy. Nick, Nick, oh, no. <laughs> look at Nick. Look at Nick, nice right hook by Nick. Boy, Nick ruffled him up. Nick ruffled him up, Nick like look, Nick ruffled him up, man. But yeah, you you been running the whole fight. You been running the whole fight, my boy. Stop running. Stop running. You been running the whole fight. <laughs> Stay still. Stay still. Whole lot of more. Whole lot of more. Nigga, <laughs> nigga, Nick like Nick like. Nigga, hey, hey, somebody watching this fight right now. Yeah, man, the man been running. The man been running the whole fight, man. He was ready. <laughs> Hey, hey, somebody, hey, Pauline, Pauline, is somebody watching the fight right there? Yeah, man, the Mexican was ready, man. The Mexican dude was ready. We were trying to fight him. We were trying to fight him. Yeah, the man was ready the whole fight. You know what I mean? <laughs> Ooh, yeah. oh, fucking Nick, boy. Nick coming in there like a pit bull. Nick, like, Nick jumping in there. Nick jumping in there. <laughs> Nick jumping in there. Nick jumping in there. Nick jumping he said he jumping like he jumping in the air like Little Mac on, on Punch Out. Yeah, 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 for sure. You know that. Hey, hey, Leo, that is what it looked like too. That is what <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, but listen, motherfucker, shit, dog. All right, round round seven. Oh, this round eight. This round eight. <laughs> hey, Nick, like Nick, like yeah, I'm just buying my time, dog. Soon as he get tired, I'ma rush him. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 
hey, hey, hey, Nick, like, Nick, like, yeah, dog, I'm just buying my time, dog. But as soon as he get tired, I'm rushing him. <laughs> it's, it's a wrap. Hey, shout out to dog on Schoolo. <laughs> hey, Schoolo, I'm telling you what it is. I'm telling you what it is. If Nick, Nick waiting. He waiting like a damn possum. He waiting like a damn possum. He like, yeah, but I'm just sitting right here, boy. I'm playing possum right now, boy. As soon as he run up here, thinking this shit sweet, thinking I'm dead, thinking he gonna get something to eat, I'm gonna wake up and scratch him. You get what I'm saying? Nick, Nick, buying this time. <laughs> hey, they're gonna, they're, they're gonna Ray, <laughs> Sugar Ray, can Sugar Ray Vargas, can Sugar Ray Vargas pull it, pull it off? Hey, who favored in this fight? Ray Vargas is favored in this fight, right? I'm pretty sure he is. I'm pretty sure he is. I'm pretty sure he's he's favorite in this fight. Yeah, Sugar, we got, well, listen, we got we got Sugar Ray Vargas right now, y'all. We got Sugar Ray Vargas. Sugar Ray Vargas versus Nick Ball. Nick, oh, that's a night jab by Sugar Ray. Night jab by Sugar Ray. Y'all see Sugar Ray, man. Man, Sugar Ray, pull, tighten up, Sugar Ray. Nice, ooh, that's a nice combo by Sugar Ray. No, Nick, ooh, that's a nice level by Nick. Nick ain't playing. Nick say, boy, a whole lot of more, boy. I swear to God, dog, you better not get tired, dog. You bet not get tired. Not you better not get tired. You bet not get tired. Oh, that's a nice level by dog on Ray. Boy, ooh, that Nick, Nick throw him down again. No, he finna take a point now. He finna take a point. Ref finna take a point. That's it. That's it. All this wrestling, though, this ain't WWE, though. He ain't take the point. This ain't WWE. You gotta stop throwing people down, though. You gotta stop throwing people down. You get what I'm saying? Come on, man. Tighten up. Nick. Nice job by Nick. Nice job by Nick. Okay. Ray dancing around. Ray, Ray, Ray look like Ray look like he get kind of tired a little bit, though. Ray do kind of look like he get kind of tired. <laughs> Ray, Ray, you got to keep moving, Ray. <laughs> got to keep moving. <laughs> Nick, Nick threw an <laughs> overhand right like this. Like how like, 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 Nick threw the overhand right like how the girls used to throw punches when I was going to school in the 80s. He threw a windmill punch. He threw a windmill punch. <laughs> Look like some Wilder would have did. You know how Wilder threw the windmill punches? Nick had to throw a windmill punch. <laughs> oh, that's a nice left hook. He dropped him. He dropped him. No, no, that was a punch, dog. That was a punch. No, no, the ref said, no, that was a punch, dog. That was a left hook that dropped. I, I got to see that again. That was a left hook, dog. No, that left hook dropped him. That left hook dropped Ray. Oh, look at dog go, boy. Nick a dick. Nick like, yeah, boy, a whole lot of more. Yeah, nigga, I told you, boy. I told you. I got you. I'm going to get him. I'm going to get him. I'm going to get him. I told you I'm going to get him. Yeah, yeah. You feel you feel my power. Feel my pain. Feel my pain, my boy. Oh, he, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to get him. I told you I'm going to get him. Yeah, I'm going to get him. That's it. He, he better take a point from him. Oh, that was a knockdown. Oh, he, 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 no, I love that, that no, look at that dog on Nick. Nick like, boy, a whole lot of mobile, boy. A whole lot of, I'm going to get him. I'm going to get him. I'm going to get him. True, <laughs> true, true. Hey, what I'm like? Hey, man, Nick, man, Nick persistent, boy. Nick is persistent. I ain't, I, I got to give him that now. Oh, pussy ass nigga, what's going on, boy? I'm telling you, boy, I'm knock your fuck ass out, boy. Blow for blow, pound for pound, nigga. I got, I got the title, nigga. I'm telling you, boy, for the knock one of you what kind of niggas out, nigga. I got these hands, nigga. I'm throwing them paws at that nigga for the knock ass down again, nigga. Get your ass back up, nigga. Don't run, nigga. Don't run, nigga. I'm telling you, boy. I want a hold of smoke, nigga. I'm throwing them paws, nigga. I'm putting them hands on you, nigga. I told you what I'm gonna do to you, nigga. Catch with the check left hook, nigga. Check left hook, nigga. I told you, boy. Pound for pound, nigga. I'm the best. This more action than any Devin Haney fight. Put these paws on you, nigga. I told you, I got your back up, nigga. I got your back up, nigga. Watch that check left foot, knock ass down again, nigga. I'm telling you, boy. It is what it is, nigga. I'm gonna make it do what they do. I'm telling you, but we ain't even playing over here, boy. Man, I, I, they showed the replay. Look like, look like he kind of wrestled him down, though. Look like he slung him down. He slung him in here. <laughs> man, this shit right here, man. Man, come on. Hey, I looked at it again, right? This man slung the man down and did him. Come on, man. No. <laughs> Tighten up, Nick. Nick, <laughs> Nick, like hold out of boy. I got him. I got him. I'ma get him. I'ma get him. Stay still. Stay still. <laughs> Nick, Nick, swarming up now, boy. Nick is swarming the dude. Hey, tight. Oh, tighten up, Sugar Ray. Tighten up, Sugar Ray. Sugar Ray, tighten up. S stick and jab. Stick and move, baby. Stick and move. Drop that right hand on him. Nick, like boy. Nick, like boy. Nick, like no man. I'ma get you, boy. You ain't gonna make it to twelve. Nick, hey, you know what? <laughs> some telling me, some telling me Nick go get him. I don't, I don't know what it is. Nick, <laughs> some telling me Nick go get him now. <laughs> hey, no, not three oh five. Hey, Dane County, check this out. Some telling me Nick go, <laughs> Nick go, Nick trying to get him. <laughs> Key say, no, nah, Cole, that was a push out this way. That was a push in this way. But boy, <laughs> boy, Nick, look at Nick, boy, Nick, Nick, boy, <laughs> Nick. <laughs> hey, 
hell of a motherfucker. That boy, god yeah, damn, boy. Hey, man. <laughs> hey, this right here, boy. This nigga dog on. Hey, Nick, Nick ain't playing. Nick, Nick on him. I'm on him. I'm on him. I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna get him. Don't worry about it. I think I can. I think I can. <laughs> hey, y'all remember the new? Y'all remember the little engine that could? I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. Tighten up, Nick. <laughs> Nick, boy, Nick, Nick, hey, boy, Nick is older, boy. Nick ain't letting them breathe right now, boy. He's like, yeah, boy, as soon as you get tired, dog, that's it. I swear to God, dog, as soon as you get tired, boy, nigga, that's your ass, boy. You better, you better hope. You better hope, boy, you don't get tired, boy. I don't drop you one time. I ain't gonna lie, boy. Nick, shut, boy, listen, um, Vargas. Vargas got to stop throwing them loop looping. Oh, we got caught with a right counter, right cross counter though, a right hook counter. Vargas still looking slow now. What Vargas? Why are you dipping your head down? Don't dip your head down. Don't put your head down so he can hit you. Nick trying to time him. I'm trying to time him with that haymaker dog. Nick trying to time him right now. Vargas, them punches looking slower and slower. You gonna get caught with some shit, Vargas. Vargas, you gonna get caught. That right hook to the chin is right there all day. That right hook to the chin is there. If he, if Nick time it right, he got you. Nice right cross. Okay. Okay. Tighten up. Hold, hold on to him, Vargas. Hold on to him, Ray. Make the referee do his job. Make the referee do his job. That's right. Hold it on. Okay. Yo, yo, you, you see dog on Nick. Dog on Ray. Let them hands go. That's right, Ray. You got you to gotta spin out the pocket. That's right, spin out the pocket. Ooh, Lord have mercy, boy. Nick letting them bolos go. He throwing bolos. Dropping them fifth ward bees on them. Ray throwing them fifth ward. I mean, uh, uh, Nick Ball throwing, dropping them fifth ward bees right now, boy. All right, there you go. Ooh, Lord. Ooh, he, look at him. He just threw a left hook. Got him in the head. Hey, he got him in the head. <laughs> he got him in the head, lock. And pushing his head down. And then he came up with an uppercut. True, true, true. Boy, boy, this a dirty game here, boy. This dude here, boy, ain't playing. Shout out to... Uh, Shout out to Leonardo dropping that quarter of a dub. He say, if this was Money May and Kenny Bayless, this fight would have been stopped. You ain't rough enough, Floyd. Nah, 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 nah. You ain't doing that. Floyd picked the referees, the ring. He always going to make sure he got the right referees that, that, um, that's going to break up any inside fighting. If you inside fighting, y'all tussling a little bit, he always he going to do that. Um, that but that, when you the A-side, that's, that's what it's all about, right? Uh, shout out to James Bass. She said, another PBC fighter getting his ass whipped. Oh, you're talking about um, you're talking about um, um, Sugar Ray Vargas. No, I, mean, uh, I don't know. I don't know, man. Let me see. Sugar Ray, who winning this fight? Who y'all got winning this fight now? I think this round ten, right? This round ten. I drop my top. Ooh, that's a nice right cross by dog on Sugar Ray. Sugar Ray, boy, that's a nice right cross, Sugar. Nice right cross, Sugar. You know what he's doing. You ain't got it. You, you know, let him come to you. As soon as he come in there, drop that MC ham on him. Drop that bomb on him. It's there. Throw with conviction too. You know what? Ray Ray Vargas can get, get he can get Nick out of there if he, he because Nick is pretty much doing the same thing. But he time him that right hand right there. He coming straight down the middle. Dog on Nick boy. Nick throwing them bolos though. He he throwing fifth ward bees even though he ain't from Houston. True, true, true. He throwing fifth war bees, even though he ain't from Houston. Shout out to Miss Connor. Miss Connor, what's going on? Shout out to the wise one. Ooh, wee. Tyula. Okay, you see that there. You see that there. Nick, boy, Nick. <laughs> but hey, this referee, this referee got a oh, nice body shot. Nice body shot by Nick. I mean, by, by, by Ray Vargas. That was nice. Ray, but you winding up the backhand. If you 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 see you see you see how you just got counted with the left hook? That's all that's all um Nick need to do. Counter off of his offense. Catch and shoot. Block and shoot. Slip and counter over the top. Cause you showing him the same look. If you show him that same look and time that backhand, you can slip, like slip and come over the top. Bring that left hand to um there you go, look at <laughs> Man, Ray, man, I ain't gonna lie. Ray, Ray getting kind of muscled a little bit though. Ray, you you can't be in a position to let the man grab you, man. This round ten, y'all. This round ten. One minute left in round ten. 
What the heck I will say about dog go Nick? Boy, Nick's stalking and chicken hawking, boy. Nick is stalking and chicken hawking. He said, boy, I'm looking for that one punch, dog. That one punch. I'm going to catch him. I'm looking for that one punch, dog. If I get if I get that one punch in there. Look at Nick. Boy, Nick, Nick, Nick came to fight now. I will say that. Nick came to fight. <coughs> boy, as soon as, a Nick, as soon as Nick Ball get in there with somebody elite, he getting put slapped to sleep, bro. He ain't got no defense. And he leave himself wide open. Not, not that this that's a nice overhand right by dog on um by Nick Ball though. Sugar Ray, Sugar Ray dancing around the ring. Sugar Ray Vargas dancing around the ring though. Float like a butterfly, sting like a bee. Sugar Ray, tighten up the sugar Sugar Ray, Sugar Ray Vargas. And he looking like all the sugars. <laughs> sugar Ray Robinson, Ray Leonard, and 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 Sugar Shane Mosey. He looking like all the sugars. <laughs> true, true, true. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> hey, shout out, hey, shout out to the natural. Shout out to G5. G5, what's going on, fam? Hey, hey, G5, he looking like all the sugars. <laughs> Boy, <laughs> of course, of course I'm being facetious. Of course I'm being facetious. You get what I'm saying? Come on, man. Gotta say, coach, I got some flowers. Green on the outside and purple on the inside. Oh, you do? Oh, see, there with all hey, goddess. Hey, you you feel me? Hey, you, hey, listen. Listen. And guess what? Hey, guess what, goddess? It was approved by the heavens. <laughs> Woo, she got some. And hey, you know what? I got some purple too, though. Me, and you know what? Me and you might have the same stuff. Hold on. Me and you might have the same. Let me see. Let me see what I got right here. Me and you might have the same thing, guys. Let me see. Let me see. Yeah, I think that's what this is right here. Lord, hey, yeah, yeah, I got. I have some of that right here. Yeah, I got. <clears throat> Check this out, guys. I'm finna tell y'all some real shit. There's some zips that I buy. They three, 300, 350. I can get some zips for 250. The hell I know of it? 250. You get what I'm saying? And then of course the, the hundred dollar zips and stuff like that. You know, you know, the more, the more you pay, the more you pay, the more. You know the the, the higher the quality. They just say that. Okay, they the shit they gave they gave. <coughs> hey, who y'all got winning this fight now, boy? Nick Nick look like he fighting, boy. Ray Ray doing a lot of running right now. Ray they go Ray Ray looking like dog on. Woo! Tighten up, dog on. Yeah, shit. Ooh, what's a nice dog on crack? Right, 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 on right hook by dog on Nick. Boy, Nick let them hands go now. Nick like no nah, dog. No, no, dog. I told you, boy, it's time to wallow. Nick, boy, Nick let him Nick looking like a Tasmanian devil right now. Nick like, no, man. No, man. See this right here? See this right here, goddess? I'm 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 already I'm already with you on this, sis. I'm with you on this. See that purple in there? Y'all see that purple in there? Y'all see that? that that's the y'all see that green and purple with them red hairs? That green purple with them red hairs? I told you, man, I don't man, I man, man, I don't be playing, bro. I don't be playing, dog. I don't even I don't be playing, bro. That ain't no, that ain't that ain't no, that ain't no hundred dollar, hundred dollar, that ain't no hundred dollar uh, zip right there. Nah. That ain't no hundred dollar zip right there, bro. I, I don't smoke nothing but gas, bro. I'm paying top dollar for my three hundred dollars, three fifty, two fifty, two hundred. You know what I mean? <clears throat> anyways, anyways. Uh okay, okay. This, this round eleven, y'all. <clears throat> fifty seconds left. Fifty seconds left. Fifty seconds left. In round 11. Ooh, that's a nice left foot by dog on Ray Vargas. Sugar Ray Vargas. What thing I say about Nick? Now, Nick stalking it. Ooh, Nick dropped him. Nick dropped him. <laughs> Nick caught him. <laughs> Nick dropped him. Oh, Nick dropped him, man. Oh, my God. I got to see. Nick dropped him, man. Lord. Nick dropped him. They got to show the replay of that. He caught him. He caught him. Look like he caught him with a right hook. A, 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 a right hook or overhand right or something. I think it was a right hook. 
<laughs> oh, Rick, Nick Carter. Nick Carter with a look at Nick. Nick stalking that shit. Nick like, oh, look at Nick. Nick like, yeah, yeah, hey. Nick, I don't. I think we. I think Nick gonna win this fight, man. Hey, okay. I think Nick. I think. I think Nick. I think Nick. I think Nick Ball on dead enough to win. I think Nick Ball. I think Nick Ball. I think Nick Ball. I think Nick Ball don't come back to win for real though. Yeah, man. Hey, 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 uh, goddess. Yeah, man. We, we, I, I'm, I'm with you on that, sis. Hey, check it out, though. Right over, oh, that's right here. That left hook. But then he, what he caught him with? Pop, that right hook right there. Oh, yeah, he dropped him right there. He, he definitely caught him. He definitely caught him. See, check it out, though, right? Check it out, though. We got it right that, that, there, right? You see that, that, there? Finna break that thing open like that, that, there? Bam. You feel me? I, I, have, I haven't even got started on that one yet. I ain't got started on that one. That one there, that one there just sitting in the cut. I, I haven't even got started on that one yet. Round 12, it's the last round. Shit, it turned out to be a good little fight right here, boy. Shit, dog on David and Goliath. And you know the crazy part about it? Nick Ball didn't even go to the body not one time. Like, he's not going to the body. This is a fight of two halves. I think um Nick, I think Nick, Nick win this round. He got the fight. Nick got the fight. Cause right now he's he, he's taking the fight to Ray Vargas, Nick Ball. I'm trying to see. I'm trying to dog. <laughs> hey, hey, dog on Nick. Nick don't know how to cut the ring off. He just, oh, that's a nice little foot by Nick. Nice little foot boy. Nick landing. Man, Ray, man, Sugar Ray, Sugar Ray Vargas, Sugar Ray, Sugar Ray, what's going on, man? Sugar Ray gonna lose that belt tonight, man. Look like he gonna lose this fight right here, man. I'm just saying, bro, like he don't got, well, he don't got knocked down two, three times, something like that. Okay, okay, look at that. What that? Look at that. Nick, Nick, keep doubling and tripling that wide hook, getting on the inside. He hooking to get on the inside. He hooking to get on the inside instead of jabbing. Look at that, he letting them hands go. Overhand right over the shoulder. Ray, Ray, you gotta let the hands go. Nice body shot by Ray. Nice body shot. Ray, you gotta Ray, one two down the pipe. The one two down the pipe, Ray. Bap bap. The bap bap. The one two down the pipe. Nick time, Nick, Nick trying to time him. <coughs> That's what Nick doing. Nick trying to time him, man. Ray, come on, man. You got you dog you got dog on Nick. You gonna let Nick steal your title from you, bro? You gonna let Nick steal your title from you? Oh, that's a nice jab, nice jab by Nick. He pushing him now. Look at that, he pushing him. Whole lot of more, bad boy. Whole lot of more. Whole lot of more. He pushing him now. Ray dancing around the ring. Ray, you got Ray, you gotta go for the kill, Ray. Right, you gotta go for the kill. You gotta assume that you're losing. Cause you, you know, look. <laughs> Ray, see, that's how Ray getting caught. Ray running, going back, going straight back, and Nick just following him. Ray need to be pivoting. Pivot to the left, pivot to the right. He need to pivot. Ray doing some good body work, but you know. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my Ray, boy. Sugar Ray, Sugar Ray Vargas, man. Sugar Ray Vargas is what we call him. Dog on that dog on um, Nick. I think Nick won this fight, man. 13 seconds left. Oh, that's a nice left hook. Uh, nice right cross by Ray Vargas. Hey, I think, I think Nick, I think Nick might have pulled it out, y'all. He might have pulled it out on Orthodox style. That's a damn, that's a tough that, that's a little tough motherfucker there, boy. I, I ain't gonna lie. Let's give him a round of applause. Yeah, man. Hey, what you say? Hey, God, say, Coach, it's so loud, it scares me. You know what you got to do? You got to put it in, um, yeah, I ain't going to lie, but I got, sh man, shit. Hey, 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 you know, hey, hey, God, you know what I call that? I call that, you know what you got? You got that, ooh, wee. <laughs> That's what I call it, that, ooh, wee. Lord, have mercy. Boy, that's that, ooh, wee, Lord, have mercy. That's what that is. Man, I'm trying to man, Lord Hammer. Uh, Jay, he say many Tyson. Nah, nah, he ain't no Tyson. You know, he ain't no Tyson. You know, you, you know, he he don't go to the body. He ain't got no jab. He don't bob and weave. 
He ain't, uh, ain't, ain't nothing, ain't nothing Tyson, ain't nothing Tyson about that many there. Ain't nothing Tyson about that many there. No jabs, no body work, don't bob, don't weave. Hey, what is that? You, you, you said you said that one, you said that one hit and um and rest a minute. Let me tell you something. I got some stuff right here, right? This stuff, this shit I got right here. Cause I mixed the two together. I took I took the um uh, I took the snow cap. I got the white I got the white weed in here with the uh with the green and purple. I took them and mixed them together. You smoke this shit right here. This shit have you high for five hours. I swear to God. True, true, true. Five hours. Five hours. Five hours, bro. Nigga, I went to the gym, worked out, cause I like I like to work out high. I went to the gym, worked out. Like literally, bro. Like I'm 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 high on some stuff that I I smoked that. What time is it? At about twelve thirty. About twelve thirty. Twelve thirty. Let that sink in. This shit here, I'm telling you, but listen, bro. I got that motherfucker. Die y'all, boy. He said, I got some of that snow cap. Cut of you, coach. Yeah, listen, if you take the snow cap and mix it together, mix it with you gotta mix it with high grade though. Mix it with another high grade weed. Bro, I'm trying to tell you, bro. Man, that shit, man, them niggas, man, shit. Yeah, man. As a matter of fact, I need to shit. I need to re up. I need to put some more in here. I mean, I don't need to re up, but I need to put some put some more on my grinder. He said all Ray had to do was keep that jab all day. Keep the jab on him and pivot. Jab and pivot. He wasn't pivoting. He started going straight back, going straight back, moving around and let the man catch up to him. Jab step say, how many years you smoking? How many years I've been smoking? Probably about a couple of years. About wow. probably about about two about, about two and a half years now. About two and a half years now. Something like that. Yeah, man, like shit. When you smoke the kind of shit I smoke, you ain't I ain't man, I, I gotta have high grade shit. My shit, my plug already know. Yeah, I, I listen. Yeah, he got it. He, he want that high grade shit. Get get him that expensive shit. I need the expensive shit. You know what I mean? I need I need that expensive shit. That hundred dollar that hundred dollar ounce. Now nah, I ain't I don't, I don't do hundred dollar ounces. I ain't doing that. <sighs> Let's see what's up. I know I had a volume down. I'm, I'm looking at the uh, 116, 110. Uh, hold on. Is it a... Uh, they say it's a draw? Oh, it's a draw. <laughs> they said it's a draw. <laughs> oh, they said it's a draw. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <you know. laughs> hey man, I'm trying to tell you, boy. Hey, check this out. Check this out. I had I had somebody um uh, I had somebody uh my main man came from Michigan. True story. One of the uh my brother Mason. Mason uh, Mason from Flint, Michigan. He from Flint. He came to Tampa, he hit me up. He be in the chat, he called the show, he hit me up. You get what I'm saying? I hooked them up. I hooked them up. You know what I mean? I hooked them up. I want to tell y'all coming to the city. Y'all just hit y'all hit the old boy up, man. Hit the old boy up. Hit me up. Y'all come to Tampa. Y'all hit me up. If I'm here, just hit me up. You trying to get right? I got you. <laughs> and you know the crazy part about it too? Uh, my brother, my brother was like, he was trying to shoot me a couple of dollars. I was like, nah, man, don't shoot me nothing. You gotta shoot me nothing, bro. You show, yeah, I'm sure. You ain't gotta shoot me down. This, this, this here, this, this here on GP. This here on the shrimp. And I do that, and I do that because when I go to when I go to other people's cities, they be showing me love. When I go when I go to other people's cities, they be showing me love. So shit, you know. When I go to other people's cities, man, shit, they man, they be shit. They don't be paying you know what I mean. They be they be throwing shit at me. Shout out to JC. JC say fair call. 
I, you know, you know, at least I ain't tripping. I ain't tripping either way. And I ain't tripping either way. Shit, I'm sitting here. You know what I mean? He said, do you guys have dispensaries in Florida? Um, I think so. I'm not sure. I think so. I know the dispensary game is real strong in Vegas and in California. Um, do we have dispensaries in Florida? Yeah, we, we do. We do. We do. We do. We do. For medical. Well, you know what? It's, it's, um. Uh, it's for medical purposes, though. I think the ones we have is like for medical purposes. Like you really gotta have a get a doctor's note. You it, it, ain't, it ain't like Vegas in California. You really gotta have like a doctor's note to be able to go in there and get something, be pres be prescribed. You no, know, um, be um, you know, uh, you know, like a prescription. You get what I'm saying? Versus like in in L.A. in California, you just going to going to the dispensary and just <laughs> show them, give them your ID. They gonna run your ID, make sure you ain't got no warrants or nothing or whatever. Bam, okay, come on in. You know, it ain't, we don't have it like that yet. Uh, shout out to shout out to jab shout out to jab step. Hey, okay. to have a dub on your boy. He said you still got no virgin longs. Enjoy it. Yeah, 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 for sure, for sure, absolutely. Uh, shout out to Darius Mason. Yeah, for sure, fam. Uh, he said he said I'm fresh cherries. He said I'm fresh cherries for everybody, coach. You fresh cherries for everybody? Yeah, man. He said I'm fresh cherries for everybody, coach. Okay, 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 okay. Shout out to Leonardo. Hey, okay. Dropping that quarter of a dub. He said they he said they had to give it to give it a draw because ain't no way. Any stars coming from America if the refs in Saudi are allowing all that throwing and dirty fight? I mean, shit, you know, I mean, they got, they, they got, they got stuff everywhere, man. Like referees, it ain't just Saudi America, like Saudi, I mean, somebody Saudi, Saudi America, <laughs> I'm motherfucking high. Saudi Arabia, it's, uh, it's like that in America too. It's like that in America too. You know, you've seen some stuff that, Lord have mercy, boy. This shit right here. This shit right here, my nigga. Bro, just smoke some weed. Hey, goddess, I'm, I'm, I'm goddess. I'm gonna tell you something. Smoke some weed and listen to Dolph. I don't know what it is. Just smoke some weed and listen to that. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Just smoke some weed and listen to that. I promise you. I, man, I don't know what it is. That right there. But yeah, uh, Vargas, they, they said it's a majority job. Vargas, you know, I ain't gonna lie, man. I kind of thought, I kind of thought Vargas, um, I kind of thought he lost that, to be fair. But I ain't, you know, I ain't, you know, I ain't throwing no civil war behind this shit. I ain't going to war about this shit. Shit, fuck it. You get what I'm saying? If I'm, if I'm, uh, if I'm, uh, Vargas, if I'm, um, Nick Ball's team, y'all got to work on a body attack. You got to work on jabs and body. Jabs and body attack. That's what you got to work on. Oh, shit, I got, I got the sticks. I don't, really, I, don't really have no, I don't have no sticks, no stems. I don't have no stems, no seeds in my shit. You know what I mean? So, nigga be buying Reggie. Nigga be buying Reggie. And got all kind of stick, seeds and sticks in it. <laughs> yeah, Coach C. See, coach, see, 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 when they got the sticks in it, coach, the sticks in the seeds, that's good because we can take the seeds and then we can replant them and grow our own stuff and we can take the sticks. I'm like, man, you don't get that, man, you don't get that shit up out of here. <laughs> man, come on, man, you don't get that shit up out of here, man. Shit. You don't get that sticks, sticks and seeds shit up out of here. Shit. Yeah, shit, what we got to do now. Nah, nah, nah. Hold on, now. She, she. We got the man. Shit, I got some shit, nigga. I got some shit here that's gonna keep you high for five fucking hours. You smoke one joint. See this right here. This the long one. This the long one. You smoke one of these right here. Five motherfucking hours. Cause I don't took two. I don't took two of them and mixed them. He said, "Yeah, I'm from those days, coach. Frisbees under the bed. Yeah, 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 for sure. Shout out to uh." Hey, what did you say, Moe? You said you you said you you said at uh, at true level you don't need a doctor. Oh, okay, okay. I, I I think I think up here. You know what, um, Moe? I think up here. Well, I mean, I'm in Tampa now. You know, I used to live in Miami, but I'm not there anymore. But yeah, I think up I think up here. Man, let me tell you something, man. Them, but they, they, listen, like we got that Cali, we got that Cali weed here in Florida. We got that Cali weed here in Florida. So how about I tell my we got everything Cali got. Anything, anything that's in Cali, Vegas, we got it. You know what I'm saying? 
Yeah, we got we got the same shit. We got the same shit, literally. Tell him what I know. Ah, uh, he say five stems and C's. Yeah, motherfucker, be like, yeah, I got all, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Nigga, think, yeah, see, see what it is. See, the more C's, the the the, the, the better the weed. Like, bro, man, you don't get that shit out my goddamn face. <laughs> he said, he said, we doing Texas. Yeah, man, I was in San Antonio, man, bro. Man, somebody gave me some Reggie in San Antonio. And what you say? Uh, you, you say, hey, coach, I don't know if you heard, but um, uh, Akira, oh yeah, yeah, the brother who created Dragon Ball, yeah, passed away. Yeah, yeah, man, yeah, yeah, he passed away. I heard about that, man. Oh, Dragon Ball, yeah, man, the creator of Dragon Ball Z. I heard about that, man. Yeah. Let me, I mean, let me tell you something. I was in San Antonio, man. Man, I man, somebody gave man. This man gave me two blunts of Reggie. We sitting there. I ain't gonna say who it was, cause and again, I don't want to throw anybody under the bus. I don't want to throw the brother under the bus. But if he hit this, he know who I'm talking about. I ain't gonna. I don't want to throw the brother under the bus. Man, like I was. I'm like, okay, you got some. Okay, shit. You know, bro. I don't even smoke blunts. I smoke papers. But I'm smoking it right. And I'm like, like we both burning together. And I'm not high. Like, man, this shit. I'm like, what's this? Yeah, man, yeah, that's. We don't smoke the whole blunt. And I don't even smoke blunts. But I smoke, we smoke, we smoke the whole blunt together. I said, man, I ain't gonna lie to you, man. I don't even feel this, bro. Like, I, and again, like the brother said in the chat, he said, I got virgin lungs. So I'm not a smoker smoker. I just started smoking, right? And if you got a guy who just started smoking, not getting high off of your shit. That should tell you something. And I'm like, dude, like, oh, my nigga, this. Oh, hell no. You ain't gonna be talking about my weed like that. No, I'm, I'm, finna, I'm finna call my guy, have him bring some more so he can redeem himself. So he said, he, he, he's out finna call the plug. He's out finna call the plug. And uh, <laughs> I'm finna call the plug and have him, have him bring some more. The dude brought some more, right? That shit was that shit was still Reggie. True, true, true. So I, I had a bad experience with San Antonio. I say, man, you know, you you know, you never get you never get a second chance to make a first impression. I said, man, San Antonio, man, y'all 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 we trash. This shit trash here, bro. This shit is trash. You get what I'm saying? You know, like shit, this ain't up to my standards. SP, he say, uh, he say to this Akita, is the only one who ever have grown black man. In the house, fake charging up. Oh yeah, 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 man. Yeah, um, Japanese animation and Japanese got the best animation, best anime. He said you used to high grade coach. That Reggie won't. Man, that shit there, man. I I had got offended. Like man, man, I, man, I, I, I we didn't even finish the second blood. I, I had no hit it. I was like, no, nah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I like man, I'm good, man. Shit, I, I'm good. Let me go get me a Corona or something. To, you know. Maybe by drinking with a Corona or whatever. Like, let me tell you something. If you got some, if you got some real, real good shit, if you want to go to heaven, if you want to go to heaven, right? If you want to go to heaven on earth, get some real good, get some real good shit like what I have. Smoke it, and then drink a Corona behind it. I promise you. Goddess, you probably know what I'm talking about. I promise you, it's one of the best goddamn feelings in the world. When you got some, listen, when you got some good green that already have you there, but then you 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 have a, a corona behind it, or whatever your drink of choice is, no, long as it's smooth, I promise you, bro, you're gonna be. I don't, I don't want to talk. Like, that's when I be having conversation with myself. Hold on. Yeah. That's, what, that's when I be talking to myself and shit, right? I tell a motherfucker, right? I'm, I'm going I'm to tell y'all some real shit. This is some wisdom. Write this down. When it, when it comes to figuring out your problems, 
and you got to think things through and internalize it, the best person to talk to is yourself. Why yourself is the best person to talk to? I'm going to tell you why. No one understands you better than you understand yourself. And a lot of times the answers that you're looking for, that you have questions to, only you had answers to them. So my philosophy is, since no one knows me better than I know myself, then, you know, why not talk to myself? You can have the best conversations with yourself sometimes. True, true, true. Marvel told me I was crazy. <laughs> I was like, all right, all right. <laughs> Marvel told me I was crazy, right? I said, all right, okay, well. It makes sense to me. They, and then guess what? They said Einstein was crazy, though. They said, listen, they said, they said Einstein was crazy. <laughs> uh, Neil, DeGra Neil deGrasse Tyson, they say he crazy. You know, all the people who geniuses in the world, they say they was crazy. I don't know, man. That nigga crazy, dog. That nigga crazy, dog. That nigga have no... I need to talk. Yeah, I be, yeah, man. I be, I be, see, I be internalizing shit. I be, I be uh, internalized. You know, I got to internalize. You know what I mean? Hey, they, they, hey listen. Listen. When you, hey, let me tell you something. Shout out to uh, Leonardo dropping that quarter of a dub. He say, Coach, all this hydro people smoke now ain't natural. It's all altered. That's why it's so strong. That's why you got people having uh, panic attacks from smoking. Yeah, I ain't, yeah, I ain't never had no panic attack. I had panic attacks uh, when I didn't smoke. I had a panic attack one time, yeah. I never had a panic attack. But anyways, but yeah, uh, but this is the thing though, right? When you sit back and have that conversation with yourself, this is what it sounds like. We must internalize the flatulation of the matter by transmitting the effervescence of the Indonesian proximity in order to further segregate, to preclude on the issue of world domination with only circumvent, <laughs> excuse me, circumcise the revelation that it reflects the aphrodisiac symptoms which now perpetrates the Jericho's activation. Hey, that's, that, that's what it sound like. That's what it sounds like right there. You be like, yeah, man, you know, see what I got to do, right? This is what I got to do. Like, first thing tomorrow, I'm going to, you know, I think I'm going to jump on the computer and shit, check the emails and shit. Now, I know I'm going to get a couple of drop the addies, gun emojis. That's fine. But then, you know, I, I, got, I got me a, um, I bought me a, a chalk. I bought me a, like a, 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 content, a content creation board. It's like, it's like, it's like an all-white chalk board, right? And like, like, any, like any content, a lot of content creators, they have a, a content creation board. You write down your ideas and stuff, your strategies, you know, uh, times you're going to drop videos, do this and that. It's a lot of shit, right? I be sitting back, no, I'm sitting back, you know, you be having these conversations with yourself. Like, yeah, man, you know. Yeah, that shit right there. Like, a perfect example. You could, you could be in the gym, right? Let's say you're in the gym. You see a fine-ass female in there. You know, you might be on stuck. Now, sometimes you get on stuck now. When you get on stuck, like, damn, boy, damn, she fine than a motherfucker, dog. Yeah, she is fine. Damn. And you just, you just be admiring the beauty of a woman. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, it's like, you know, you smoking some good shit, and then when you, when, you, when, you, when you deep into your own thoughts in your mind, and then you become one with the universe. Y'all get what I'm saying? Anybody, anybody ever became one with the universe before? Anybody? Shout out to Jav Steph. He said, you think Ryan used, he said, you think Ryan used those boards? Nah, nah, nah. I mean, I don't know. You know, I, I have no way of knowing. But you asked me what I think, nah. Nah, he don't have to. He don't have to. Um, but you get what I'm saying? I'm like, shit, what, 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 what? He said, he said, only when I smoke. Yeah, man, I be motherfucking, you got to internalize shit. You be like, like, like you sit back and become, but when you become one with the universe, like everything just feel different. Guess what? I got some dab pseudo. And I got some dab. That dab. That dab came with instructions. I had a guy when I was in Vegas, right? I had got a whole lot of shit. I got a whole lot of stuff when I was in Vegas, right? I got a whole lot of stuff when I was in Vegas. Um, 
My main man told me, he said, listen, I was at a dispensary. Uh, Hardeen's. I was at Hardeen's dispensary. You in Vegas? You in Vegas? Go here. Go to Hardeen's. You in Vegas? Go here. He say, look, when you dab, this shit come with instructions. And they tell you, look, you do this shit, do this shit when you at home, you don't have to go anywhere and do it right before you go to bed. Something of that sort. And I understood why. You only need, listen, you don't need much. You don't need much of that, you know, listen. You don't need much, bro. Like, all you need is like, you get like a little corner. Man, shit. Shout out to Tila. Tila, what's going on, Tila? He said, he said, he said, he said, dap ain't no joke. Nah, it ain't no joke, bro. That shit ain't no, them daps ain't no joke, bro. Ain't no joke at all, bro. At all. Uh, Marco say, uh, shout out to Marco dropping that two dollar super chat. What you say, fam? He said that, um, coach, you got to try golfing. Golfing faded, buzz. Oh, you know what? I need, I, I need to do that then. I want to shit. I want to be on a golf course with Canelo. Shit, you got damn right. Damn so do. Shit. Let me tell y'all something, man. Y'all better get y'all some money. You get what I'm saying? Get y'all some money, man. Don't let nobody come to you talking that broke shit. I'm telling everybody this in the chat. If you are an optimistic person, don't have people who are pessimistic, pessimistic around you. If you are a high energy person, don't have people with low energy around you. Because people... If you're a positive person, don't have people that's negative around you. Because what happens is people like to transfer energy. I'm going to give you a perfect example of what I mean by that. What is transferring energy? You have a, some of you sisters who, who practice a lot of spirituality and stuff like that, you know where I'm going, you know what I'm talking about. You, you have people, when someone is in a bad mood or they're just always negative, and when they come around you, shit don't feel right. They have, they have that negative energy, right? And um, when they try to project how they feel on you, like try to make sure you're having a bad day, say some shit that's trying to piss you off, what they're doing is they're trying to transfer that negative energy to you. They're trying to transfer that energy to you, right? Don't let nobody, don't let nobody transfer their negative energy to you. You got to block them. I have people, I have people. What is it, Kyle? Uh, which one? That right there? Yeah. yeah, so yeah, they're trying to they're trying to transfer the energy. And you see a lot of that even on social media. Trolls do that. Trolls try to transfer the energy. When you get a when you get a guy who say he gonna do A, B, C, and D to you, yada yada yada, he sound like he he's trying to transfer that negative energy to you. They do it in chats, do it in social media. That's why you got so many people who be having nervous breakdowns. Yeah, man, you know cyberbullying and stuff. They're transferring that negative energy to you. You get what I'm saying? Don't never, don't let nobody transfer their negative negative energy to you. Never. Now nah, hold up, swole up. You in a bad mood. You feeling miserable right now? I tell you what, have a Klondike bar and take that shit that away. True, true, true. As a matter of fact, I'm not even fixing to entertain you. Cause you wanna argue. I can't argue with you. You wanna argue. I can't argue with you. You mad. Look at you. You mad. I don't get paid to argue with you. Who is you? You ain't nobody. <laughs> this ain't 
dog with these niggas, man. Yeah, nigga, sign the contract. 60, 40, 70, 30, 80, 20. Take whatever we give you. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cut the Memphis. Cut the Memphis. You better not come to Chicago. You better not. <laughs> niggas, man. Woo, yeah. Ooh, it's, some, it's, some special, it's some special people here, boy. It's some special, it's some special mofos on this shit here, boy. Like, it's some special, listen, it's some special mofos. Uh, Steven say uh, Ball got robbed. Okay. Steven feel like Ball got robbed. Okay, really, nothing wrong with that. Uh, Jessica say, give him a Snickers. Hey, you remember that commercial? Give him a Snickers. You know, um, you know when they, when they say you're not feeling yourself today? Oh, they, they showing the, uh, the highlights of, highlights of <laughs> Joseph Parker on Wilder. Wilder, 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 Wilder. What the do? <laughs> man, I ain't gonna lie. Man, shout out to shout out to Deontay Wilder, man. To this day, man, shout out to Wilder, man. Wilder, <laughs> hammer, hammer, hammer blow, hammer blow. <laughs> shout out to Wilder, man. Shout out to Wilder. You don't, don't ever forget when I found you, you you were strung out on coke. When I found you, you was you was like a big house, contemplating about killing yourself. So don't you ever forget who brought you to Big Time Box. I drugged you back. I brought you back. I provided food and put food on your table for your family to eat. And I'm doing it for the second time. So you do, don't you ever forget that. Yeah, man. <laughs> he said that right before the second fight. I was like, man, Kawada was mad. Fury was getting all his love. Yeah, man, it is, it is what it is, man. We just, man, we just vibing, man. Don't you ever forget. <laughs> hey, let me tell you something. Well, listen, when, when, when I'm on the good green, dog, it's going to be very hard for me to get me off my square. I'm like, man, shit, yeah. Man, for, let, me, let me go ahead and go on over here, man. I ain't trying to hear this shit this nigga talk about, man. Right now, man, I'm feeling, right now, I'm feeling good right now, man. I ain't trying to hear this shit this nigga talking about. So, no, like, like, you can, like, if you, if you, in, if you operate in the spiritual realm, because we spiritual beings, as my brother Professor Griff would say, he said, we are all spiritual beings having a human experience. So you got a lot of, there's a lot of, some, quite a few black women that I know, uh, do, you know, the ones that I know, some of them, not, not a bunch, but some of them. Like they, they, you know, they, they, they very, they have their crystals, they beads, they be meditating, they have they like, uh, like, you know, I, I, I used to think that shit wasn't real. Like, man, he, man, he, man, they tripping. No, nah, that shit, that energy, like that shit real, bro. Like the energy, bro. Like the energy. <laughs> See, hold on, hold on, wait a minute. See, I'm feeling something right here. I'm feeling something right here. Um, you know, have you had any troubles lately in your life? Yeah, I did have some troubles. Okay, I'm seeing that. I'm seeing that. Is it involving a woman? As a matter of fact, it is involving a woman. Okay, okay. You know, um, is this woman close to you? Like, y'all share some tiny kind of ties? Yeah, that's my baby mama. Oh, oh, I saw that. I did see children. I did see children. Okay, okay. All right. Um, um, dang, okay. You all y'all separated? Yeah, I'm separated. Child support. Yeah, child support. How you knew that? That's it. That's it. You gotta separate from that. True, true, true. <laughs> do you have a homeboy? Do you have a homeboy named Man Man? Yeah, I do have a homeboy named Man Man. Okay, okay. Um, um, is, are you going through something with you know your, I'm I'm seeing a Tyrone, a Tyrone in the picture. Yeah, you mean third land Tyrone? Yeah, that's who my baby mama would cheat on me with. True, true. Yeah, yeah. They, true. <laughs> hey, they go to, hey, they go to feel it. They go to feel it. Hey, uh, Moise say she said them crystals witchcraft quotes. Hey, you know, I mean, I, you know, I hear all kind of stuff. I hear, um, I hear voodoo. I hear voodoo is um is bad. Then I hear it's good. Man, I man, I don't know. I don't know shit. I don't know. All I'm saying is there's some truth to everything. There's some truth to everything. You get what I'm saying? So it's either gonna be on the negative plane or the positive plane. Either way, you know. Hey, Jason, follow Christ. Say they give them the they give them the answers. <laughs> hey, he said, Coach, who we got for the main event? I got Joshua. I got Joshua. That's what I'm picking. Joshua. I'm picking Anthony Joshua. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna I'm get up and we gonna have I'm gonna take a smoke break for the Joshua fight. Shit. I'm still kind of high from the last shit, though. But the gospel fight, I'm taking a smoke break. That's what I'm doing. Let me see. We good. 
We good. Hey, shout out to uh man, hey man, shout out, uh, shout out to Timothy Bradley, man. This show has been sponsored by Timothy Bradley. Hey, okay. shout out to Tim for dropping them dosi and throw bam dollars on your boy. Hey, Leroy. Super chat received. Playtime's over, boy. boy. <laughs> Hey, that's a good question. He said, if he's going to win tonight, what upset in sports history will equate to that? Uh, I don't know about sports history, but boxing? Hmm. That's a good question. Bo I don't know about sports history. But boxing... Uh, Boxing, I don't, I don't, I can't think of nothing from a boxing standpoint, Tim, to where a non-boxer got in the ring and beat a boxer. Do, do you get what I'm saying? Like, I, I can't, I can't, I can't think of anything. I can't think of anything offhand, to be honest with you. I can't, I can't think, of, not in boxing. When a guy who has an 0-1-1 record, a guy who has an 0-1-1 record in the sport, and he comes in the ring and he beats a guy that's a seasoned vet in in in, in a sport that he's not that, that 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 he's not that's not his cup of tea because this guy comes from the MMA world. You get what I'm saying? So that's a good question, bro. I don't think I think I don't think nothing. I don't think nothing would top that. To be honest with you, I don't think nothing to top that at all. Down from the bar, there's a platform stage. He said Oz would suggest Buster was a lot bigger upset. Yeah, but Buster Douglas was a real fighter. If you Buster Douglas had a good amateur record, and Buster Douglas um, had a good professional record pr prior to fighting Mike Tyson. So it's not like Buster Douglas was just this bum that just walked in off the street. No, nah, no, nah, Buster Douglas, like you no, know, he was, you know, you hear what I'm saying? No, nah, he wasn't no, he wasn't no. Killer, killer, but Buster Douglas was a professional boxer. And you couple that with Mike Tyson hanging out all night with Bobby Brown on coke, stand up, you know, uh, you know, you couple, mix that with that, and then Buster Douglas' mom had them passed away, and his wife, and I think his wife was in the hospital with cancer or something of that sort. You take all of that and mix all that together, man, you got a recipe for disaster. True, true, true. Yeah. Yeah, my, yeah, um, you talking about Mike, Mike and Buster Douglas, but I think Buster, Buster was like, but the thing is, yeah, this is the thing though. Buster Douglas was is a boxer, man. I'm, I'm saying a non-boxer, a non-boxer who got an on one professional boxing record. Come, like a lot of people use Buster Douglas. Yes, he was a high underdog, but bro, like, don't a lot of people don't know Buster Douglas' background as a boxer. You don't know his amateur record, none of that. But I'm talking about a non-boxer, a guy with an on one record coming in the ring beating. A two-time unified heavyweight champion. Nah. Nah. Uh, shout out to um Osceola. Shout out to Osceola for becoming a member. Salute to you, fam. And shout out to Marcus. Marcus Gutierrez. He said Kwame Brown type upset. Yeah, man. I'm just, man, like, a non-boxer coming in there? Nah. Nah, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't seen that. I ain't seen that. I haven't seen that. All. Hey, as a matter of fact, you say, Coach, why is this fight so early? Because they're fighting in Saudi Arabia. They're fighting in Saudi Arabia. Matter of fact, give me a minute, guys. Give me a minute. We're going to listen to some music right quick. Uh, I'll be right back.
trying to see what's up, man. Judges. Drinking the goddamn Sprite. I got to drink a Sprite like my, my um, voice go to getting hoarse. I got to drink a Sprite. I ain't going to lie, man. This dude, Zane, bro. We're going to see what's up, man. Like, we're going to see what Joseph Parker is able to do. Like, Zane is... <laughs> This a boy, this a big dude. Zang about 200. Zang got to be about 285, 290, somewhere up in there. Joseph Parker sitting there. Boy, they know they got a tall task ahead of them, boy. Lord have mercy. Man, they got a man. Nah, Mo, you said, nah, I wasn't, nah, I wasn't having a smoke break. No, I wasn't having a smoke break. I'm, we gonna listen. We gonna have a smoke. I'm gonna have a smoke break after this one. After this fight right here, absolutely. I'm burning. I'm burning this. After this right here, I'm burning. I'm burning one of these. You know what I mean? One of my jisms. I ain't going nowhere. So, shout out to KO Sports, man. Salute, fam. KO Sports, Flex BK, salute, uh, Flex BK, Ricky Ricardo, Thug and D. Hey, Thug and D, what's up, man? Thug and D in the building, Host Delgado. Uh, goddess, you know, my sister goddess is here, you know, the green of things in life. Um, shout out to Tila in the building. Hey, Tuck and D, man. I'm scared of that Asian there, boy. I got the China. I call, I call Zane the Chinese assassin. I think he'd never be your intern champ. Whoever win this going to be the mandatory, I think. I'm not sure. Well, they call it, dude, the Chinese assassin, the beast from the east. The beast from the east. Man, that boy, that's a scary boy. That's a, ooh, Lord have mercy. He got a whole country back in him, too. He, hey, listen, he got an entire country back in him. The Chinese invasion. Look at Joseph Park. They looking at each other face to face now. Look at Zane. Boy, Zane, ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm all Zane. They not that much taller than each other, okay? Yeah, that motherfucker say, hey, guess what? I'm, I, I, I got nervous just looking at him. True, true, oh, I got true. Me scared. Got me scared. I'm, I'm, got me scared over here. I don't know, man. God, damn. Look at Joseph Parker. Tighten up, Joe. What you gonna do, Joe? Joe, what you gonna do? There you go, man. Round one, no started. Two minutes and 20, 40 seconds left. Uh, open hand stands. This is the open hand stands fight. Open hand stands. Both guys, both lead hands on the same side. Right now, they're fencing for position. Fencing. Fencing right now. I want to see what uh, Joseph, Joseph Parker, going. he's going to, he got to be aware of that straight left, of course. But he's going to have to get around that weak side. Get around that weak side, man. Because you don't want to be lined up for that straight left. Oh, that's a nice jab. By, but Zane, ooh, Lord have mercy. Goddamn Zane, boy, that beast from the east. The, the Chinese assassin, boy. Shit, that's a weapon of mass destruction right there, boy. China don't sit. China don't sit. What are their weapons over here? Well, no, you know what? No, they're in Saudi Arabia. So they're in Saudi Arabia. My bad. My bad. My bad. God dang, Zane tried to land that left hand, that back hand just then, boy. Boy, that's a boy. God damn, them gloves look small as hell on his hands, too. Joseph Parker fighting to the, he fighting to the body, jabbing to the body, coming up top to the head. All right, Joseph. A minute and 30 seconds left, guys. Right now, they're trying to fill each other out. I like the way Joseph Parker's changing levels on defense. You know, you got you to gotta get his guy. Right now, they're trying to, right now, they're trying to fill each other out right now. Okay, nice back end to the body by Joseph Parker. Zane, Zane, ooh, Zane, ooh, Lord have mercy. Zane finna let them hands go in a minute. He finna let them hands go in a minute. I can, I can, I can tell you that right now. Big Bang, Big Bang finna let them hands go in a minute. They just filling each other out right now. Joseph Parker, you still got the straight right now. Still got the straight right. Oh, that's a nice jab by Zane. 
Nice jab by who? Lord have mercy, boy. Another jab by Zay. Zay ain't like, man, this is what it's going to be. Zay, woo, he tried to land that motherfucker straight left, boy. Ooh, my Lord, boy, Joseph Parker. Joseph, come on, dog. God dang, Joseph Parker, man. Boy, don't let him catch it, boy. Don't let him catch it with that devil, boy. Okay, looping, uh, looping left hand, but he hit, hit Zang on the back. I like Zang poise. Zang got a good jab, but he looking to set. He looking to set that straight left up, boy. He said, "Boy, I'm gonna catch you." I already know, boy. Just a matter of time. Now I love the way Joseph Parker is changing levels on defense. He's bringing his head up and bringing his head down, moving a little bit out off the line, feigning, come up a little bit, then go back down. You get what I'm saying? Not not giving. Zang an easy target to hit. You get what I'm saying? I like that. True, true, true. All right, all right, man. That's round one of it. Round one in the books. Hey, what to say, Flex? Hey, shout out to Dog on the Boston the Story, man. Bro, Boston the Story, what's up, brother? What's going on, fam? What's going on, bro? What's going on? Boston the Story in the building, man. Yes, sir. Man, I'm trying to tell you. Let's see what's up. Uh, this is the end of the first round. Uh, both men filling each other out. That's a big dude, bro. <laughs> that motherfucker. That motherfucker big, bro. That motherfucker big. I'm just telling you, bro. That, you, know, you know what I mean? Like, man, that's... Both of them were just filling each other out, though. I, Joseph Parker tough now. Joseph Parker coming to fight. You can believe that. He got Andy Lee over there with him. He got Andy Lee over there. Hold on. Round two don't start it. They ain't got some long ass arms. Round two don't start it. We're gonna see what's up. Now, I now I do like what Joseph is doing. They got it. They fight for lead. They they listen, they they they, they fight for lead hand, uh, hand uh lead hand control. Zane just dropped that straight left down and he's trying to get his range. Cause that's what he wants. He wants to land that straight left and he's gonna come back that right hook. Nice right cross a little bit by Joseph Parker. Zane kind of blocked it a little bit. Joseph Parker, he, you know, he ain't. I want to see he reaching with the back end though. Reaching with the back end a little bit. Joe, uh, he, he, nice, nice jab by Zane. Nice jab by Zane. Joe, you gotta, you gotta stop circling to the strong side. I know both of y'all, I know both of y'all got an open hand stance. I get that. But you got to stop circling to that, that strong side, fam. You got to go to the weak side. Yeah, see, he got to see Joseph Parker got to go to that weak side. Because, see, the thing is, you don't want Zane getting comfortable. Okay, you just, nice, nice, that was a nice overhand, looping right hand, but it got, it got, yeah, man, see. You got to go to the weak side, man. He, he setting you up for the left. Look at her. He got him. Look at her. Well, Y'all going to see what I'm talking about in a minute. In a minute, you're going to see what I'm talking about. Zang, okay. Zang threw the left, but he missed. That's it, Joe. Joe, you got to get up out of there. Oh, oh, Zang, oh, that, oh, he went to the body. Man, he caught Joseph Parker in the chest just then with that backhand. Dang, Zang closed in pretty fast. He, he, you know, he kind of fast to be so big, though. Now he gonna double the jab. Now listen, it looked like Joseph Parker had the same game plan. Well, I don't want to say the same game plan they had with Wilder, but nice, nice backhand to the body by Joe. Zang is looking for that shot. Oh, nice, nice left foot by Dog on Joseph Parker. I like that. Zang, you got him. You got him in the corner now. Our thirty seconds left in this round, y'all. Thirty seconds left. Nice body shot by Dog on Zane. Put the weight on him. Put that weight on him. Put that. Got to put that weight on him too now. That, that, that's what that's what Tyson Fury did to Wilder. Put that weight on him. Both men traded punches just then. I like that. Joe keep reaching with the back end. I give him that. He keep reaching with the back end to the body, but I'm, I'm afraid he's going to get timed. If he if if he, if if he continues to if he if he's predictable with it, he's going to get timed. He's going to get caught coming back out, or he may get caught coming in. They get caught coming in because you can you can catch him with the straight you can catch him with the lead hand coming in reach with the back end or you can catch him with the left hook 
on his way, on his way, either coming in or pulling back out, either or. True, true, true. Either or. Shout out to the Duchess of Wisdom. Duchess, what's going on, sis? Shout out to the Duchess of Wisdom. De the Duchess is here. Shout out to Timothy Bradley, man. Timothy Bradley was, is here. I don't know if he's still here, but he was here. Dr. Paul Evans, the Boston historian, in my opinion. SP got beat. Salute, fam. JC, G5. Uh... The wise one, Harvey in the building, Carl in the building, Lance, what's going on, fam? Hello, Davis, Ahmed, salute. Shout out to School of X Man, SP Got Beats, La Jessica, Miss Connie Stevens, Food Revolution, uh, Sheila from Cali. All right, here we go. The Goddess, Tila, Summer in November, Mimi 24. All right, round round three don't start. He throwing that jab now with conviction. Now they're part of telling Zane you got to you got to pump the jab now. Pump the jab. Stop waiting. Pump that jab. Parry the jab and go on top. There it go. Joseph Park. I want to Joe. Joe, you got to get off that. See that you know the only thing the only thing I don't like I'm gonna be honest with you. It's the third. It's the third round. Oh Lord, have we would have caught you with that? That might that might have been a good night, Irene. Oh no, that's a nice nice straight left hand. Nice straight left straight right hand by Joe. Nice left, ooh, nice left hand on right cross by Zane, though. Boy, Zane cracking up. Ooh, Lord have mercy. But them pussy look like, look like they hurt, bro. I ain't gonna lie, look like they hurt, fam. Damn. Let's see what's up. They throwing punches with mean intentions, boy. Man, this, this right here ain't making no sense. Man, this right here, man. Shit. Ah, right. damn, boy. This shit looks scary. Oh, there goes Zane for pumping the jab. I want to see Zane got to get more active with his jab, though. He got to get more active with his jab. Uh, Joseph Parker keeping his head off the line. Zane trying to wait to time him. He got to, Zane got to get a little bit more active, though. Let me see. All right, Joseph Parker threw a two piece to the forearm. Zane, I'm, I'm trying to figure out what he's waiting on. Oh, no, ooh, I, I like the way Joseph Parker shot that back end just then. He didn't really land, but he the, the speed, oh, oh, he dropped, oh, my God, straight left. Put him on his back. Poor dog go, Joseph, listen, put him straight put him straight on his behind. That straight left, that's what he was waiting on. That's what I was telling y'all. He got to stop circling to the left. That's a hard-hitting agent there, boy. Boy, uh, uh, Lord, it's almost circling to his right, my bad. He got to start circling to his right. Yeah, Joe, Joe look like he ready to go. Joe still kind of hurt. Joe still kind of hurt, man. Joe ready to go. Joe ready. Can he make it out of this round? Joe ready to go. Joe, hold him. He got caught with a jab. Come reaching in. Tighten up, Joe. Run. Yeah, Joe still hurt. He got caught with a two-piece and a jab just then. Yeah, Zane, Zane know he got him. Zane like, yeah, it's over with me. Look at that. The man, the man coming to the ring. The man coming to the ring like, hey, Zane, listen. Listen, Zane walking back to his corner like this here. Like, hey, baby, what's up, baby? What, 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 what do you know? What do you know, baby? What do you know? What do you know, baby? Zane is walking to his corner. You know, you know, you know, who loves you, baby? You guys remember um, Kojak? You guys remember Kojak, right? Y'all remember, remember what Coach you say? Who loves you, baby? <laughs> hey, that was what hell, boy. Hey, boy, gonna be like, yeah, see, we see, we want to see, we want to see your fighter. Fight, he got to fight Zane. He tied, he caught him. I told y'all, he got to stop circling to, I told y'all, he had to stop circling to the weak, to the strong side. What did I say earlier in the fight? I said, y'all gonna see what I'm talking about. I said, he gonna hit it with that straight left. Joseph Parker kept circling to his right, which is the strong side. 
I said he need to circle to the weak side. True, true, true. I said he got to circle to the weak side. Stop circling to the strong side. That's what that's what I was talking about. And then I said, you, I said, y'all to see what I'm saying. Y'all to see what I'm saying. That's what I was talking about. Uh, shout out to Mike Jones dropping out two dollars super chat. Salute, fam. Um, yeah, look, he getting tagged with that jab now. He getting tagged with that jab now. Zane, Zane, Zane finna turn it up a little bit. He getting tagged with the jab now. And he's still circling to the strong side, man. Go to the weak side. Go, oh, he got caught with a straight left. That's how you got caught with a straight left. Why are you circling to the strong side? If you want to land your back end, you can land it going to the weak side, man. Yeah, Joseph, yeah. Joseph Parker finna get put to sleep. Oh, that's a nice dog going two piece by dog going um uh, uh Joseph Parker. But Zane came back though. Zane came back. Parker, circle to the weak side. Look, okay, now he finally did it that one time. Look, look at the lead foot placement. His foot is on the outside, though. His foot is on the out. Okay. Man, you got caught with that straight left again, dog. This, yeah, this, this, this ain't this is gonna this is gonna this is gonna be in ugly here, boy. This gonna end ugly. I already knew that though. I picked Zane, I put Zane to knock Joseph Parker out. So Parker going to sleep. I think everybody know that. Oh, nice, okay. Nice little uppercut by Parker. There you go, tighten up. Z Joe, stop circling to the man power hand, bro. Nice body shot. Okay, if you're going to hit him with that one too, pivot. Don't hit him and back up. Bro, listen. Fam. Hit him and pivot. You got to hit him and we side pivot, man. Zay, look, Zay setting them up. Zay setting them up. Almost caught him that left hook. Zay setting them up. Joseph Parker, you telegraphing that right hand. You telegraphing the right hand, dog. You got hit the straight left again. Yeah, Joseph, Joe ain't got nothing, man. Joe finna go. Joe finna go. Oh, look, he got caught with a jab just then. Zay, Zay walking him down. Zane walking on nice straight left again by Zane. That straight left, nice two piece by dog on Joe. The problem is, he's trying to take a point from Joseph Parker. He say, I think I think he said this is last warning. This is last warning. Okay. Okay. This is last warning. Zane, Zane, Zane ain't even feeling it though. They say Joe hitting him low. Zane not even feeling it. I ain't mad at Joe, though. Yeah, hit him low. Do what you got to do, man. Hey, Skulo, what you say? You say Joe pissing me off. Hey, Skulo, the only thing I want to, the only thing I want to, want Joe to do, Skulo, is, the only thing I want him to do, fam, is pivot to the, pivot to the weak side. Because it makes it harder for him to get hit with the straight left. Pivot to the weak side. By him pivoting, uh, by him pivoting to the strong side, you're setting yourself up for the straight left hand. Pivot to the weak side and make him. And if he and if he's trying to hit you, if he pivot to the strong side to the weak side, he'll be able to, he'll be able to slip and drop his right hand straight down the pipe while getting on the outside of, of Zhang's jab, or duck under and come up. You get what I'm saying? But by him pivoting to the strong side, you I mean you fighting it, you already fighting the guy in the open hand stance. You fighting in the open hand stance, rotate to the weak side, fam. True, true, true. See, that's what pissing me off. It's round four. Look at that Joe. Shh. Look like Joe got hit. Nice two piece. For some reason, Joe feel come, but he's blocking it though. Like you're not you're not hurting Zane with anything of significance. Blocking and pairing in the shots, catching your jab. He catching your jab. He catching your jab now.
Man. Let's see what Joe. Okay, look, I caught the left hand again. Man, he keeps circling over there. Like, bro, it's like he haven't figured this out yet. And you know what Zang is doing? As soon as Zang get close enough, he'll step and make sure his foot, his lead foot is on the outside before he can shoot that straight left. Watch, watch his feet. Watch his feet. He keeping them occupied. They're touching gloves, touching gloves, touching gloves. And then he'll move his foot ever so slightly to the outside and then step. It's like little subtle things he's doing. Little subtle feints with the feet and stuff like that. Fighting a little bit with the head. You get what I'm saying? You see how Zane, now you see how Zane turned it to the weak side? Do you see how Zane is turning to Joseph Parker's weak side? Did y'all see that? Zane turning to Parker's weak side, but Parker won't turn to his weak side. Come on, man. True, true, true. Zane is literally pivoting to his right, which is Joseph Parker's left. He's pivoting to the left, which is his right. How come Zane is pivoting to his weak side? Joseph Parker's weak side, but Joe, he got Joe circling to the strong side. Joe, you got you got to be seeing this. You have to be seeing this, fam. Now, Zane, Zane going to, okay, now watch. See what he doing now? He going back. Why, when he throw his shots, he's, he makes sure his lead foot is on the outside. Now, you see what Zane doing? Zane's circling to Joseph Parker's left. And now he's standing there, standing there, standing there, backing him up. Now he's circling to the left ever so slightly. I'm looking at his feet. Why, why when he get ready to throw that shot, watch where that foot, watch where that lead foot be at. So he, you get what I'm saying? He's setting him up. He's setting him up. Setting him up, man. Yeah, man. I'm not, it's, it's real smart what he's doing. It's real smart. Joe, Joe know the left hand coming. He trying to make him miss with it. Joe, go to the, okay. He trying to make him miss with the left, the backhand to come back with his backhand. I, I, the only thing I want, dog, I just want Joe to pivot to, to the weak side. You see Zane doing it. Zane, Zane, Lee Zane is pivoting to the weak side. He's circling to, to the weak side the entire fight. Uh, shout out to our man. Shout out to our uh, Lena. She said, get him Wu-Tang's <laughs> She called her Wu-Tang's Okay. Kel Brook out there. Oh, they don't have, do, do they? Oh, the Kel Brook out there. Okay. Shit. Schoolo said, you can tell Zane thinks, thinks in the ring. Yeah, he's a thinker in the ring. That is true. He's a thinker. He's he definitely thinking in the ring. Team Zane. Zane got that brother over there. He got a Zane got a brother over there training him. He got a, he got three trainers. One, I think the lead trainer of the brother. He got the brother, the brother over there. He got the brother, the interpreter, and then he got the cut man. Look here, man. Don't worry about it. We're finna get him out of there. Dude saying they wanted to see Wilder fight Zane. I said, man, Wilder kills. I mean, Zane could kill Wilder, man. Shit. I wouldn't mind seeing I wouldn't mind seeing Zang and AJ fighting either. That that'll be woo, two big dudes like that. Both of them can crack. Usyk. I don't know. Usyk Usyk gonna do a lot of. That'll be a good fight too. Zang and Usyk. That footwork. Usyk got some damn good footwork. And he he's used to fighting bigger fighters. Usyk gonna move around a lot. Get them thinking. Beat them with fangs, stuff like that. I don't know. We'll see. This round five, no, this round six, y'all, round six. My bad, round six. Let's see what's up, man. Locked in on this, okay. They fencing with the lead hand. Zane looking to drop that level. I want to see Zane work a little bit more, though. Zane got to work a little bit more. He's doing a lot. He's doing a lot, but I want to see him work a little bit more. Joseph Parker is changing levels with the defense, keeping his head off the line now. I just want to see him. Let me stop repeating myself. Let me stop repeating myself. I want to see the man um, pivot to the weak side. <laughs> I want to see the man pivot to the weak side, man. That's all I'm saying. Because let me tell you something. 
I, if um, if Joe do that, he, he can set that. He can set his. He can set his right hand up real easy. He can set his right hand up real easy. Because because I think I think if he get if he if he get caught, it's gonna be a timing shot. Now Joe Joe you Joe you did I like that. Uh, Zane Zane just threw the straight left, and Joe Joe got his head off the line real fast. He threw he threw it with some hell of a speed too. Joe, okay, got caught with a straight left again, Joe. Joe, go to the. I'm tired of you know I'm, I'm tired of saying speaking repeating myself, dog. Both men fighting at a good pace. Both men look, look to be in shape. Both men look like they're in shape. Zane breathing a little bit. Joe breathing a little bit. It's round six, y'all. 24 seconds left for round six. Joe, if you're going to lean your head to the right, give him more shoulder. If you're gonna lean your head to the right, I think it. Nah, you know what? If Joe, if Joe, if Joe, if Joe was to pivot to that left, he'll be able to, he'll be able to do what he want to do. Pivot to the left, but give him that shoulder so he can catch. He can catch that jab. He can catch that jab. You know, catch, catch the jab or slip it. He can he can block that backhand when it comes. That's why I want to see Joe just just you know pivot to that left. Shout out to y'all, Salute fam. Hey, Duwap say Joe can't hear you. <laughs> hey, Duwap. True, hey. true, true. Hey, Duwap, you ain't never lie. He damn sure can't hear me. Hey, hey, I do, hey, I do be talking. I do be talking. I do be talking like they can hear me. <laughs> Man, you hear, you hear what I'm talking about? Hey, bro, I ain't gonna lie, but I be so into it. I be so into it. I do, it do, you know what I mean? Y'all right, though. He can't hear me. He can't hear me at all, bro. He damn sure can't hear me, boy. Shit. <laughs> Shit. I listen, I want his trainers to tell him that. Come on, all right, round seven, y'all. Round seven. Damn. Zane got some long ass arms, boy. And them arms long. You know what I like? Both of these men are fighting a patient. That's a nice jab by Zane. Joseph Parker, nice, nice body shot. He, he threw one to the head, but he missed. But he came back to the body, landed it. All right, Joe. All right, Joe. You, you see, you see that you see you see what you did right there, Joe? You moved to the left a little bit, then went back. And when he reached with the backhand, oh, he looked like he caught Joe. He caught Joe with a straight left. Caught Joe. Like he buzzed him a little bit, too. Zane kind of step a little bit now. He trying to stay. He's he coming in the high guard. He coming. He want. He want Joe to throw. He not. He not scared of Joseph Parker's power. He want him to throw. He's in the high guard. He want him to throw. When you, listen, when you when, when you got a fighter stepping you in the high guard, he wants you to throw, cause he wants to counter. He wants to counter off of your offense. I call it. I, some, some some people call it trap counter. Let's see what's up. It's a minute and 30 seconds left. Night two piece by Joseph Parker. A minute and 30 seconds left, guys, in round seven. Night, oh, Lord have mercy. Nice two piece by Zay. Man, he called Joe good. What? Uh. Oh, nice straight left again. Man, that's straight left. He, bro, that's a timing shot there. That's a timing shot. That's a timing shot there. The way, the way, see, he's setting them up with it. Zane being very patient. Man. He got he, he got that high guard up. What they call it old what they call the old peekaboo? Nice straight left again. Nice straight right by Joseph Parker. Oh, nice straight right by Joseph Parker. Lord have mercy. Listen, Z Z Z Joseph Parker caught uh caught Zane with a straight right. Zane shook his head like that's all you got. And he came back with his straight left. And man, he ate it. He like, man, that's all you got? Joe caught him clean. He was like, he, he just shook his head like that. Damn. 
Y'all see that? Hey, Ducky D, you saw that? He ate it. He, he ate it. He took it like a G, too. Zane, Zane ate that right hand like it was nothing. Hi, God. Oh, he caught Joe. He counted him. He, he, oh my God, he caught Joe with that right hook just then. Counted him. Joe wrong with it, though. God damn. Joe, boy, oh, man. Hey, sh hey you know what? This, hey, this fight, this fight got me on the edge of my seat. I'm like, it's like it's a matter of time before he knock him out. It kind of feel like this. It's like, you know the knockout coming. It's like, man, he going to catch me. It's, it's a matter of time, you know? He says, Zane taking deep breaths. Yeah, you know, you have um, the, uh, some of the body work that Joseph Parker is doing. Some of the body work. Mm, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what Joseph Parker, man. Look like they're showing the back. They're showing the back right now. That's what it look like they're showing. They're showing the back right now, guys. Yeah, man. They're showing the back right now, the locker room. Is that in Ghana? Yeah, I think that's that's in Ghana. Ghana walking, walking in the back. Shout out to Goddess. Gotta say, gotta say, uh, Zane came to eat. Mike, the mobile mechanic. What's going on, fam? There you go. All right. Hey, so far this is a good fight. This is a good fight so far. We in round eight. Round eight. Straight left. He shot the straight left and missed. Oh, that's a nice dog going right here by Joseph Parker. Joseph Parker caught Zane. Clean on the jaw, on the chin with the right, right cross, and ducked his head down, and he ate it. He caught him. He turned his head now. He caught him clean. He turned his head. Okay, shit. Joseph Parker, shit. Joe, Joe, okay, Joe, Joe putting his hands together. Zane, Zane pushing him. You can't push his head down, Zane, like that. Straight right hand by Joseph Parker. Straight right hand, Joe. Zane got to Zane got to become a little bit more active. He he might be getting out hustled some of these rounds. Ooh, nice dog on Joseph Parker timed it good too. That's a good timing. Look like he got hit with a left hook. Look like he got hit with a left hook. I mean, the right hook. That's what it looked like. Straight right. Oh, nice straight left hand by Zane. Joe, nice left hook by Joe. I'm trying to, Zane got him on the ropes, tapped him. He hurt him. He caught him on the chin. That's a knockdown. Caught him on the chin. Caught him on the chin. He barely tapped him too. Like he barely tapped him. Caught him on the chin, dog. One minute and 15 seconds left. Can Joe stop him in the eighth? Knockdown. Can Joe stop him in the eighth? Straight left. Oh, nice right hook. Nice right hook by Zane. Joe hurt. Joe hurt, boy. He hurt. He hurt. He got that right hook caught him. He hurt. Straight left by Zane. Joseph trying to fight, though. 55 seconds left. Can Zane stop him? Can Zane stop him? I like the way, I like the way Joe dipping his head down and grabbing him. Make the referee do his job. That's a vet move by Joseph Parker. A vet move. You don't close the distance, now let that jab go, Zane. You don't close the distance, now let that jab go. You got to let the jab go. You don't close the distance, fam. Nice straight nice straight right by dog on Joe. Zane kind of breathing hard a little bit, though. Both men are breathing hard, to be fair. This is just a ninth round. 20 seconds left. Nice straight, nice straight left, um... By Zane, but it was oh, nice straight right here by Joseph Parker, and he came back with the left hook to the body. He th he, hey, Joseph Parker throwing that he throwing that backhand hard, boy. He throwing that backhand hard. I ain't gonna lie. He got Zane backing up now. Yo, they kind of win it, boys. I'm okay. You go Joseph Parker, but Joseph Parker he throwing fastballs with that backhand. You can believe that now. Zane don't got a little tired. Zane don't got a little winded now. See, he don't got a little, he don't got a little winded now. Bro, if you if you look at the hook, he caught Joseph Parker. It looked like he barely touched him. It looked like he barely touched him. Hold on, they show the replay. He 
caught Jane right there. Straight left. Oh, that's what it was. He caught him with a straight left and then came back with the right cross. Oh, that's what it was, that right cross. That straight left did the, 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 the right cross, the follow-up with the right cross. That's what it was. The right cross, uh, the follow-up. Right cross over the top. All right, this round 10, round 10. Nice jab by Zane. Both men in the open hand stance. Uh, I'm going to say this, man. Shit, motherfucker, Joseph Parker, uh, he lasted longer than I thought he was going to last so far. That's a tough dude, bro. Shit, Joseph Parker, man, he, listen, he made a believe. Listen, he made a believe out of me on this fight right here. I mean, his last fight against Wilder, he made a believe out of me. But I'm just saying, man, like he fighting, you know, Joe's still hanging in there. Hey, we're in the championship round. This round 10. It's two minutes and 20 seconds left. 220. 220 and 10. We're in the top of the 10th. Uh, I don't know, man. I'm trying to see. I'm trying to see. Uh, nice dog on uh, two piece. It looked like uh, I'm not going to. Joseph Parker seems to kind of be outworking Zang. Zang seems like he's waiting. He's waiting for a shot. Zang, you got to work to get your shots off, man. You got them long ass arms and you ain't even work pumping the jab like you're supposed to. Oh, nice straight left hand by dog on um Zane. That he shoot, he, that was a nice time. Nice straight backhand. Nice, nice three peat punch combination by dog on Joseph Parker. He landed both backhands, the right hand. Oh, he got caught with that left hand just then too, boy. Joseph Parker did. Both of these men kind of winded. There you go. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see, Joe. Joe, get your head off the line, Joe. Okay. There you go. Let's see what's up. This round, this round, no, this round nine. I thought it was round 10, my bad. I thought this was round 10. This round nine, my bad. We're not in the, we're not in the 10th, we're not in the 10th round yet. I like, okay, I like the way Joe dipping his head down Keeping his head off that line, I I still want him to pivot to the left though. But okay, he throwing that fastball with conviction. Just he, he can't telegraph it though, cause he gonna get caught over the top with get over the top. Round nine. Joseph Parker kind of outworking um Zang a little bit. Joseph Parker kind of outworking Zang. Yeah. Zang, Zang hardly throwing punches. Nice jab by Zang. So it's one thing we do see with Zang. He can be outworked. You can outwork him. We see that. Zang sent back waiting. What are you backing up waiting for? Zang, I don't know, Zang tired or what? Look like he tired. Look like he backing up waiting. Like, like you that side, you supposed to be stepping. AJ back there waiting. Okay. Ah, okay. That's a drop down. We'll see him. AJ, but it's showing AJ back there practicing, boy. AJ, boy, shit. Oh, Lord have mercy. Oh, that right hand, boy. That right hand. Working that left hook. Working that left hook, too. You got to work on that left hook, too. Stephen A said, AJ look good. Reese Max said, "How old is Zang? I think I think he about I don't know about forty, somewhere up in there, somewhere up in there." Shout out to Reese Max. Shout out to him. We got some cash outs, man. I will I will address the cash outs. I get to the cash outs. And uh, and shout out to uh, we well, matter of fact, we got two cash outs. I will address the cash outs after the fight. I'm watching the fight on my phone, so all right, this round ten, y'all, round ten. We're watching the fight on my phone. Cause my TV tripping. All right, um, round ten. Oh, I like that. I like that. Boy, they gonna listen. Joseph, pa Joseph Parker, tough dude, man. He a tough dude. I, you know what? Joseph Parker very well could be out hustling Zane. 
Zane keep throwing that hook and pushing his head down with the elbow. You can't be doing that. Zane got to become more active. Like he's hardly throwing punches. Oh, nice straight left button. I think Joseph Parker blocked that. I think he blocked that. Nice, uh, nice double jab back in to get on the inside by Joseph Parker. Nice counter left hook. Nice hooks, nice body shot, combo body shot to the body by Joe. Shit, motherfucker. Listen, man, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Joseph Parker, man. Joseph Parker, man, he, that, that's a tough dude, bro. He could have been folded in this fight. Yeah, man, Joe, I ain't gonna lie. Joe, Joe, Joe impressing me, fam. I mean, he kind of he kind of outworking dog on Zang right now. Zane sitting there waiting. I don't know what he waiting on. Nice combo by Joseph Parker again. He got blocked, but nice uppercut and left hook by Joe. Joe, Joe getting out some combinations. Nice uh, uppercut, left hook by Joe. Joe seemed like he get, got his second win right now. Look at the snap on his punches. Look at that Joe boy. Zang ain't throwing no punches at all. Has he thrown a punch yet this round? I think he did. I think he threw maybe one or two. He waiting on Joe. Zang look tired. Zang tired. He looking for that straight left. That's it. He don't want to work. You got to work to get on the inside. You got to work to get on the inside. But I'm going to tell you why. He could be apprehensive about that straight left. Yeah, Zang tired. That's probably what it is. He probably apprehends about that straight right. My bad, not straight left, the straight right. Ooh, nice, the nice dog on right cross. Yeah, Zane look like he tired, bro. And look, and look at look, look at the spring in Joseph Parker step now. His energy. Now Zane backing up. Zane backing up. Park, Parker, Parker taking it to him a little bit. Zang ain't doing nothing. It's kind of hard for me to give him a round when he ain't throwing no punches. He ain't throwing no punches. I can't, I, he ain't throwing no punches. True, true, true. Um, shout out to Shotgun. Hey, okay. Dropping that quarter of a dub. He say, coach, if Zang is hurting Parker like this, imagine what Wilder's power would have done to him if Wilder didn't have the dent in his head. I mean, why see it? Wilder, Wilder, um, Wilder, Wilder landed, landed some, no, Wilder landed some right hands on him. You can't really say that. The styles make fights. Wilder had an opportunity to do it. Wilder had an opportunity. He had his opportunity, man. Shit, Joseph Parker, uh, Wilder had his opportunity. Shout out to, shout out to how good stuff. He say, uh, Okay. Dropping that quarter of a dub, he said. Um, he said that little dude won. Okay, I got you. Cash out. Round eleven. Round eleven. Shit, Joseph Parker, boy. He Joseph Parker look like. Look, look, hey, look, hey, look at the spring in Joseph Parker step. Shit, new motherfucker, Joseph Parker, boy. I don't know. Nice jab by Zane. Nice uh, counter jab by Doggone Parker. Shit, nigga Park, nigga Park ain't scared now. Zane ain't gotta let that jab go though. You ain't gonna win no fight. Just sit there and letting your hands go. Don't work that way, buddy. Zane, you got to let your hands go. Joseph Parker let them hands go right now. Zane pulling your punches. Come back off the counter. Go to the body, Zane. Go to the body. Oh, nice right hook. Nice right hook by Zane. But Joseph Parker outworking him though. Joseph Parker outworking on Zane right now. Shout out to uh Jab Staff. He say Parker closing on closing strong. Yes, he is. Uh this is round eleven, guys. A minute and forty seconds left. Joseph Parker looks very comfortable. Uh, Zane is waiting, waiting. 
<clears throat> You're not going to win a fight like this here. Let's see. Nice, nice, all um, nice one, too. Zane took a deep breath just then. Look at, look at Joe. Y'all, now I want y'all to look at jo Joseph Parker's legs. Look at his legs and look at his upper body movement. Do you see the spring on his step? It looks like, it looked like Joseph Parker has, has a second win. Bro, he looking, he look pretty looking good right now, fam. Joe, Joe got a lot of spring in his step. He, he look, 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 look like he overcame the adversity in the fight. And now look at him. He looks like a total different fighter. And look what he's doing. He's going around the weak side. Well, he did just he did just then. Now he's going around the strong side. Hold on. Look what he's doing now. Going around the weak side. You see him circling to the weak side? You see that? You see him circling to the weak side now? Do y'all see that? Shit. He's circling to the weak side now. Nice job. You see what Joseph Park. And now Zang is circling to uh, Parker's strong side. He got Zang flinching. It could, you know, it could be them body shots. It could be them body shots that uh, Joseph Park was hitting Zang with. Zang, you ain't going to win this fight like that. And hey, you know what, man? Zang tired. True, true, true. Shit. And hey, you know what? Hey, Zang tired, bro. Zang tired. Yeah, he tired, bro. He ain't letting his hands go. He tired, bro. Like Joseph Parker, bro. Hey, man. I don't know, boy. Joseph Parker might. I, you know what? Joseph Parker might win this fight. Jo, you know what? Joseph Parker very well could be winning right now. You could say he won them last four, four rounds or so. Like, he very well could be winning this fight right now, bro. Like, for real. He said they're telling Zane to go for broke. He better go for broke. He better go for broke. Round 12, this is it. Two minutes and 50 seconds left. Zane got to let his hands go. A lot. Love, I love the faints from Joseph Parker. He fainting real good. Zang, Zang got to work his jab though. Instead of waiting on, instead of waiting on that shot, you got to work that jab, fam. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. I mean, look at the energy from Joseph Parker. Look at the energy from Zang. It's like night and day. Zang putting his weight all on. You can't be doing that. Dipping, 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 changing levels, changing levels. Zane just sitting there waiting, waiting, waiting. He just took a deep breath just then. He tired. Zane tired. That's what it is. He tired. And Joseph Parker know it too. Joe know it. He, he working him with feints, working him with head movement. He, he, he know it. Joe know it too. He said, I'm in better shape than this guy. Oh, nice straight back hand by dog going on Joseph Parker. Another right hand by Joe. Joe, 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 Joe has to, um, I like the speed he throwing the punches at too. Zane don't lost his fight, bro. Zane lost his fight. One minute and 25 seconds left in round 12. The bottom, we're in the bottom of the 12. Bottom of the 12. Zane don't lost his fight, bro. Shit, Joseph Parker holding his own on Zane, man. Shit, I, boy, listen, I got to take my head off of Joseph Parker, fam. I picked him to get knocked out. Shit, hey, you know, shit, hey, boy, listen, I got to take my head off of Joe, man. Nigga, Joe, Joe holding his own right here. Zang, Zang, Zang still ain't letting his hands go. Joe, I, I love his, his faint game, though. Going to the weak side. He going to the weak side a little bit. Just go to the weak side a little bit. Because he, he, he not comfortable there. He not comfortable there. Zane took a deep breath again. Took a deep breath again. 
Joseph Parker is out working Zang in round 12. Joe, listen, Joe, look, hey, look, look how fresh Joseph Parker look. Zane, Zane flinching. He flinching on the faint. He biting on the faint. 20 seconds left. Joe know it too. Joe know it. Joe say this man tired. Joe say this man tired. Goddamn Joseph Parker, man. Man, this motherfucker impressing the hell out of me, bro. Joseph Parker is really impressing me, fam. I got to give him credit, bro. There you go, there you go. That round number one. Let's give everybody a round of applause, man. That round 12 over with. Nice two piece by Joe. Yeah. Yeah, man. Zang, Zang ain't do nothing them last five rounds, bro. Them last five rounds, he really ain't do nothing. Yeah, man. Yeah, Zane tired. Big and tired. Um, shout out to Doctor Paul. What do you say, family? Say don't under, don't don't under, don't under, 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 underestimate Mari people. Okay. Shout out to dog on Kenneth Johnson. You say it's a draw or Zane with the upset? No, I don't think Zane, Zane was the favorite. Zane was the favorite, so if he win, it won't be an upset. He was the favorite. And I, you know what? This fight tells me, like a lot of the people that are the Wilder fans, they'll see, look, man, y'all see how good Joseph Parker is. Y'all see, y'all, you see how good Joseph Parker is. Like he could have packed it in several times in this fight. When he got knocked down two times, he could have packed it in several times in this fight. He didn't. He didn't. Let's give both men a round of applause. Yeah, Zang, Zang got to get some. I want to see what the reps, I want to see what the score is. You know, you know, we can't predict this now. We can't predict this. You know, you know how, you know how boxing is now. We can't predict it, so. You know, we don't know what the judges are going to say. You get what I'm saying? We don't know what the judges are going to say, so we'll see. Again, I don't have the volume up. I have the volume down, so. Boy, if, boy, if doggone, if Joseph Parker win this, shit. Yeah. Joseph Parker, he say shit, nigga. I don't beat Wilder. Gave him his third loss. That's why Wilder was getting back. I say shit. Joseph Parker, boy, had some pop. Some big dudes. That's a big dude, bro. That's a big dude. For real, though. Um, the unofficial scorecard, they have Joseph Parker winning by two rounds. The unofficial scorecard. Unofficial. Of course, um, I didn't hear the commentating. I didn't hear the commentating. You guys know me when I do these fights. No, we call these fights. We don't do no commentating. We'll see what's up. We'll see what's up. Styles make fights. Yeah, I, I, again, uh, yeah, Styles make fights, man. Joseph Parker, man. Joseph Parker fought a hell of a fight, bro. And he started going to the weak side later on in the fight. What is it? 113, 113. What is it? Okay, Joe Warren. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Majority decision. Yeah, that, that means, yeah, um, yeah, that was the right decision. That was the right decision. Joseph Parker beat <laughs> Deontay Wilder and he beat Zaylee Zane. Let's give, uh, let's give Joseph Parker a round of applause. Yeah. 
Joseph Parker beat Deontay Wilder and Zane back to back fights. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Joseph Parker beat Zay Lee Zay and Deontay Wilder back to back. He taking the he taking the tough fights. But this ball been taking the easy matches. Fighting other ball. He taking the tough fights. Wilder, y'all say he was a hard hitting the hardest hitting heavyweight in the history of boxing. Don't worry about that. I got that. But I'll take him out. Beat Wilder 12 round to zero. Zay Lee Zane, he coming off of two back-to-back -back knockout victories against Joe Joyce. Stylistically, that style was tailor-made for him. You want me to fight Zay Lee Zane? And guess what? And he was the underdog. See, he was the underdog. Y'all pick me, y'all pick me to fight Zay Lee Zane? No problem. I I take him out. Come on, man. Joseph Parker, bro. Like this, this is, bro. <laughs> oh my god joseph parker joseph parker beat two two top 10 heavyweights back to back see this is what it's all about he beat two top 10 heavyweights back to back how many fighters favorite fighters are doing this uh um uh, and what you say about uh, boston the storm you say parker won you 300 oh that's good man that's good everybody else listen i'm saying these other dudes hold on now now my body he ain't got to do that he ain't got to do what joseph parker did joseph parker fought deontay wild beat him just beat zay lee zane Two top heavyweights back to back. We got to give it up to him. He meets the boxing criteria. Level of competition, check. How many top 10 fighters you fought? Check. He fought two back to back. Career defining fights, this is one of them, check. Did you fight the best in the division? Check. He like he meets the, he meeting the boxing criteria. But guess what? It don't matter in this day and age. He how many how many TikTok followers he have? Well, how many how many Instagram followers he have? Well, he don't deserve no shot at my fighter. You know he ain't no draw. My fighter the cash cow. True, true, true. That's that, that, that's that's why I'm done. That's why I don't tap down. I don't tap down on this shit. I shout out to Ben Dover. He said a uh, great example of why triangle theory doesn't work. No, exactly, it doesn't work. But listen, but um, that's all these dudes do is on on, your, on social media is, is triangle theories all the time. You saw what he did to Poach Out Willie. What you think he gonna do to Whole Kid Cheese? Whole Kid Cheese can't still stand a chance against Hobo Sam. You saw what Hobo did to Poach Out Willie. Dude, you do know that just because he did the Poach Out Willie don't mean he gonna do it to Hobo. Just because he did the Poach Out Willie don't, don't mean he gonna do it to um, um, the Whole Kid Cheese. Yeah, I did not. Yes, it do. <laughs> and, and, then, and then we wanna argue hypotheticals all day, 10, 11 hours, arguing hypotheticals. Hypotheticals. What if? Well, see, if, well, what if if my fighter catch him like that? You get what I'm saying? Like that, what these dudes be doing? Shout out to uh, Boston Historian. He said the heavyweight division is about to get cleaned out soon. I mean, you know. One thing about it, ain't nobody, hey, 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 um, Boston Historian. One thing about it, um, ain't no, ain't nobody from America gonna clean it out. True, true, true. We ain't got nothing over here. You know, we know ain't nobody from America gonna clean it out. Doggone Joseph. Hey man, let's get Joseph Parker a round of applause, man. That dude right there, bro. Joseph Parker, Joseph Parker made a believer out of me, fam. Joseph Parker, man, like, he said Parker versus who next, coach? Parker, good, good coach. Uh, he said Parker, good coach. Hey, no, no, listen, listen, listen. Joseph Parker deserves a right to pick and choose who he want to fight. If he want to fight a cherry, let him fight a cherry. But this ball been taking the easy matches, fighting other balls. J Joseph Parker deserves an easy match if he wants one because he's doing what a lot of fighters are doing, but he's doing what 
a lot of the most popular fighters in the lighter weight divisions are not doing. True, true, true. Notice I say popular fighters. In my opinion, say they got a rematch clause. Well, if they got a rematch clause, that's good then. We 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 get we get to see it again. We know we know it's gonna be a good fight. We get to see it again. Steven said, I don't want to see it again. Don't watch it. <laughs> hey, 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 see, hey, hey, see how simple that is, Steven? Uh, I wouldn't mind watching it again. You don't want to see it again, don't watch it. It's, it's that simple. Uh, shout out to uh, Elena. You say Parker made Zane look like he needed some milk. No, I mean, Zane... Uh, I don't know. It looked, it looked like the second half of the fight, he just got tired. He became very predictable. He became very predictable. It's like he was looking for that one shot. He wasn't working the jab. Like how you how you that tall? How you that tall and got them long ass arms, but you ain't you you ain't working your jab. He was fencing with his jab throughout the entire fight. And then when you get the guy hurt, you can't finish him and get him out of there because you're not putting your punches together. You're looking for the one shot. What I noticed about Zane, Zane depends on just the right, just the back end. The straight left. That's what he's looking for, the straight left. John the SP, he said, I'm like that Jake Paul fight fights. Oh, you like that with Jake Paul fights? No watching zone. Yeah, I'm watching. I'm watching. I'm watching Jake the Snake, man. Oh, I'm watching Mike Tyson. I'm watching Mike Tyson. That's what I'm watching. Buddy say Zang is basically a Southpaw Wilder. No, no, no. He way better than Wilder. No, I can't say that. I mean, to say he's a Southpaw Wilder would say that him and Wilder got the same style. No, they're two different styles. He's not. He's not a Southpaw Wilder. He has. He has better skills than Wilder. He just. He just didn't. He didn't. He didn't display it today, but. You know, he's got better skills than Wilder. He just he just wasn't putting his hands together. He, was, he looked like he was tired. Yeah. Uh y'all must say Tyson 57. Come on. Hey man. He said Tyson gonna take 20 million, take a dive. Uh, you know, I don't I don't I don't think Tyson gonna take no dive against uh against uh Jake Paul. That's what that's why they're gonna end up in a draw or something. That uh, Tyson ain't taking no goddamn dies. I mean, that I don't think that ain't gonna be no real, real fight like that. That's not gonna be a real fight like that. To be honest with you. So that's not gonna be a real fight like that. That's gonna be an exhibition, like a real exhibition match. That is that's gonna be very similar to what we saw with Roy Jones, with Roy Jones and uh and Mike Tyson. That, that's it's gonna be just like that. Yeah, it's gonna be just like that. That's what it's gonna be. Oh, you know what? Shit, I'm finna. It's time to burn. It's time to burn. It's time to burn now. Look like the main event finna get ready to come on. So look here, man. I'm finna take a smoke break. Y'all, y'all, y'all can split, take one if you want to. Look like we got we got 391 in the chat, and we have 396 watching on Twitter. So we finna take a quick a quick station identification break. I'm finna burn one right quick. If, if I, y I might be on stuck now, but don't worry about it. It is what it is.
All right, let's see what's up. We back. We back, man. I just had to, you know, I had, I had to get me some Betty right, you know. <laughs> y'all know, uh, y'all remember um, an artist by the name of Betty Wright? Some of you, some of you young whippersnappers, she's from Miami, from Liberty City. Y'all probably don't know who Betty Wright is, but for those who are old enough to know who Betty Wright is, I had to go get me some Betty Wright, you know. I had to go get me some Betty Wright. Yeah, man. I had to go get some better right, man. Hey, what did he say? He said, Coach missing that perp with the white. <laughs> yeah, man, you know what I mean? Shit. I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready to get this fight on now. Ready to get it. Hey, this way it's at, man. Like, my advice to y'all, don't even get emotionally invested in this boss and shit like that no more. I it is what it is, man. Like, once, once the um once you got sanctioned bodies, not enforcing mandatories, and becoming a number one contender don't mean nothing because it don't mean you're going to get a shot at the title. And uh, fighters saying belts don't mean nothing. You know, we follow what we follow the blue floor, maybe the blueprint. You know, uh, this guy don't bring nothing to the table. Like, like now, now it's there. I've, I've accepted it. So okay, that's why I say, look, don't come to me telling me about what no fight I ain't doing. And that other guy, look, y'all, y'all say it was all right for this nigga to do it. So let everybody, let everybody do it. Ran off on the floor twice. I mean, shit, you know, you don't, you know, it is what it is. I say what I say and I deliver it. Hey, dog on, uh, what you say, full revolution? You say tonight, tonight after the pan? Yeah. Yep. Okay, here coming Gano walking to the ring. Two Africans, the two Africans coming to the ring. Shout out to Mike, the mobile mechanic. He say Parker versus who? Oh yeah, I already read that one. I already read that Mike. Yeah, man. Shout out, hey, shout out to the goddess, man. Shout out to the Duchess of Wisdom. Uh, La Jessica's in the building. Food Revolution. Shout out, um, Lisa Bell's. You know, Lisa Bells is in the building, you know, uh, Mimi24, uh, Miss Connie. Miss Connie is here. Ahmed is here. School of X-Man is here. Yeah, this is where we at. What's, what, what time we got? Okay, it's 7.17 over here. It must be a 12-hour time difference or something of that sort. I don't know. All right, Agano 37, um, Okay. 6-4 versus 6-6, six, six, 272 versus 252. Both men are orthodox. All right. <laughs> Two Africans in shungo shape. In shungo shape. You know, you know what I mean? Yeah, man. They got Michael Buff over there. Michael Buffer, he doing he, he called he called in the fight now. He finna let he finna let it go. But at least say this is a lose lose fight for AJ. If he wins, he's supposed to win. If he loses, he's the last stock of boxing. I mean, it was it was the same way. I guess I guess he would say it was the same way for Tyson Fury. You know. <laughs> hey, you know what I'm laughing at? Oh, okay, dog on Ingano. Ingano got the light showing. Okay, okay. Yeah, that dude, that looks scared. That, I ain't gonna lie, Gano, Francis and Ingano do look scared. I ain't gonna lie, that's, yeah, that's scary looking motherfucker, that boy. You ain't gonna wanna, you, you ain't gonna wanna meet him nowhere in no dark alley. Hey, what did it say, Food Revolution? She say, finally, after 54 fights on this card. Hey! <laughs> She say, finally, after 54 fights on this car. That's crazy. That, like, would you rather have a bunch of fights on the car or just a handful of good fights? Because they, well, I just thought they, 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 they milking this. I'm like, 
Bro, it's some people went live 10 o'clock this morning. Think about the people who went live 10 o'clock this morning. We're going to cover this fight. I, th I, think, I think the fight started what? Uh, 10 this morning, 11 this morning. Just imagine that. And what to say, uh, she what to say, Tila? He said, "Real talk. I'm just, I'm just glad he's making money for." Oh, okay. You talking about somebody else? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, that brother, that boy. Here come Joshua, AJ. All business walking. <laughs> hey, yay. Hey. I want to say, um, I'm hearing, I'm hearing that, um, I'm hearing that, uh, they, I'm, I'm hearing that the Saudis may be in play for the Chris Eubank and Crawford fight too. Like shit, you got, you got the Arabs want to put that bread up. Shit, man, you can't turn that down, man. That's that, that's what they say, right? You know what Floyd say? Yeah, um, and um, I'm gonna keep making the game. I'm gonna keep making the game. You know, um, y'all keep fighting all them tough fights. Y'all keep fighting them tough fights. You know, this this illegal bank robber over here. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That's what they leader said. That's what they leader said. She like to see that she said pretty and pink. Okay. Okay. I'm riding with Joshua, man. It's too it's too many, it's too many of y'all want to see Joshua lose. I'm riding with Joshua, man. I'm riding with AJ, man. I like AJ. I, I, I definitely like this version of AJ now, the one that's Ain't so goddamn friendly and shit. I ain't like all that friendly shit. Yeah, man, I'm glad both of these brothers are getting paid, man. Both of them getting paid. The Saudis don't came in and putting out that money. But you're going to have to fight. Fans on, hold on, fans on got 57% will win. Uh, well, when uh, said the Ghana were gonna win the fight tonight, only forty three percent say Joshua will gonna win. That's on fan zone. If you guys, if you guys on the zone, if you on the zone, uh, they got something called fan zone. Well, okay, D block. They picking, but the fans, is, the fans are picking um in Ghana to win. D block. <laughs> hey, shout out to uh, shout out to the king. What you say? What you say? You say thanks, coach. New to the channel. Yeah, I appreciate that, fam. I appreciate that. Thanks for being a new subscriber, fam. Jason Phillips say I'm high. I'm, the both of us are. You know, I'm feeling good. Feeling good right now, man. Feeling good right now, man. Yeah, man. George Myers say Betty was a bad sister. Yes, yes, she was. Betty Wright, man. Betty Wright, man. Yep. I had, I had to, I, I had, well, I had to go get Betty Wright. That's what we say down here in um and in, 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 um, I don't know what they said throughout, yeah, probably throughout Florida. Yeah, I had to go get Betty Wright. That means you had to get right, right. You know, I, you know, I didn't have to get right. I had to go get Betty right. You get what I'm saying? Shout out to the, uh, the Metal Hendrix. Don't everybody believe in Google? Go Google that shit. Hey, okay. Dropping that half a damn dub with your boy. Hey, Leroy. Super Jack received. Playtime's over, boy. Boy. Shout out to Metal Hendrix. He say salute, coach, man, fam. Let's go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Shout out to. Uh, Shout out to uh, Jason Follower of Christ. Okay. Jamie say, Coach, I'm driving to Massachusetts listening to you. All right. John say he 50 50. Somebody say they high, huh? Look at Toby Reggie. Man, that, that, listen, I don't, I don't even know how to spell Reggie. Talking about some damn Reggie. I, I don't smoke that. I feel, boy, shit. D block, you get some real weed, boy. You, you showing up gonna be hot. I believe it too, man. Cause my, my experience in San Antonio, I mean, when you were well, San Antonio, like what three hours away from you guys, something like that. But um, yeah, they, 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 they weed trash. JC, what's going on, fam? He said AJ better handle his business. This dude easy. I mean, he go, man. AJ, AJ gonna do his thing, man. Ain't no MMA guy gonna beat this dude, man. He said, man, Joshua has so much pressure. I mean, I, <laughs> I, really, I really don't think so. I don't think it's 
<laughs> you know what I mean? I'm just being honest with you, dog. I don't think it's really no pressure like that at all. Like <laughs> he said, what well, he said was at work driving the truck. You make me want to be there and watch uh, watch Ray and Nick. Oh, okay. Yeah, shout out to all the truck drivers, man. You know, I used to drive trucks, man. I drove all over the country. All over the country. You get what I'm saying? So, okay, Francis and Nick. Hey, man, I ain't gonna lie, boy. In shungo shape. You know what? They need to, they need to get Francis and Gano to play to be the next Black Panther. That's what they need to do, bro. I don't know how good his acting is, but what what Marvel needs to do? They need to take they need to take Jack Kirby and Stan Lee's character, Black Panther. They need to make take Francis and Gano and make him the next Black Panther. True, true, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We got to work on his acting, but um, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that's what I do. Shout out to Tila. She said, Coach, you have a prediction for, for a KO by round? No, 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 I, no I, don't, I don't have a prediction for a KO. I just got Joshua winning. I got Joshua winning. I mean, as a matter of fact, I think I said I had Joshua stopping him in like the 10th round. I think that's what I said. Somewhere around there. I got Joshua winning. Dog on edit, edit the hitman Hearn over there. Edit, edit the hitman Hearn over there. Yeah, say, man. You see they got, you see they got edit the hitman over there, man. Y'all heard me? They got edited. They got edited. Hitman Hearn over there, man. Over there in the corner. Okay, okay. Ooh, who this fight to get ready to get started, boy? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, man. All right, this is it. We finna get it on. This is it. Hold on. All right, this is it. Round one don't start it. AJ going to the body. Mm -hmm. Nice fangs, both men holding their ground. And Gano got some long arms. AJ got some long arms too. I like that. What uh I like that. Okay, nice, nice left hook. Nice left hook by Dog going Gano. I like the way he threw it. He didn't land, but I like the way he threw it. Nice, nice half step back by ja by Joshua. You got the reach. Keep that jab there. Now Gano, of course, is looking to throw the right hand over the top. Understand to be so. Nice check left hook by Gano. He didn't land, but you know I like the way he threw it. Two minutes and ten seconds left in round one. Top of the first. Nice jab, nice jab by Gano. Left hook got blocked. AJ going to the body. Okay. Ongano, Ongano threw a left hook and missed. AJ got up under it, came with a right hand. They tied up. Nice jab to the body. By, Joshua going to the body early. Nice faint. Both men trying to parry. A slapping left hook by Dog on Ongano. Nice jab to the body by Joshua. He throwing some stiff jabs to the body, too. He going to try to weigh him down later in the fight when the, when the body shots. Nice right hand by Angano looping. Joshua blocked it. Nice right hand, though. I don't know if he had his fist open or closed, though. He got his hand open. I don't know if he had it open or closed when he, when, uh, when he landed it. But he did land it, though. You can tell, you can tell. Oh, nice straight right here by Joshua. Drop the Ganu. Drop them. God damn. That's straight. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. Yeah, man. Hey, boy, Lord have mercy. Joshua put him down. Straight right here by Joshua, man. Joshua, like, what's happening, man? Did I tell to tell you, boy? Ooh, okay. Nice jab to the body by Joshua. 
Okay, and Ganu throwing wide, wild open hand punches. He don't know how to throw. He don't know how to throw that throw his right hand properly yet. He don't turn southpaw now. He don't turn southpaw. No, no, he didn't. No, he didn't. My bad. My bad. I thought he turned southpaw. My bad. My bad, guys. Sorry about that. Nice double jab by AJ. Nice. Both men fighting good. Lord have mercy, boy. <laughs> hey, all that AJ hate. All that AJ hate now. <laughs> Y'all hate. All that AJ hate, y'all see. <laughs> Look at that. Woo! He tied with two. Hang up. Yap! Woo! Lord have mercy. All that AJ <laughs> Yeah, man, he ain't gonna get locked. I'm like, man, look, this dude is a box. This is a boxer versus the MMA fighter, dog. This is a boxer versus the MMA fighter, fam. Come on, man. I know you don't like AJ, but goddamn. <laughs> I'm a. I'm going to take a boxer over an MMA fighter in the boxing ring seven days a week and twice on Sunday. True, true, true. <laughs> anyway, we got, we still got time. It's a long way to go in this fight. He know, he know, he know that right hand, that AJ, he know that right hand is something else. He know that motherfucking punch, boy. <clears throat> I get it. I get it. Trust me. They go AJ, and I told y'all, AJ, AJ been active. This is his fourth fight in 11 months. His fourth fight. Okay, okay, nice stiff jab by AJ. Jab to the body. He gonna set that right hand up again. And Ogano, Ogano gotta try to find a way to land his right hand. He got his hands open, though. Like, I don't know if he's... When he when he when he throws his right hand, I need to see if his fist open or close. It gotta be close. Nice, I, you know. I like his check left hook though. He has a check left hook that look that's pretty good. In Gano, how come hey, how come Anthony Joshua gloves looks looks so much smaller than Engano's? Nice left hook by Engano. Joshua blocked it. Both men are going back and forth, pushing the tempo. Pushing the tempo, you know, trying to trying they they trying to hold they trying to hold their ground. I like what Angano was doing. He's trying to hold his ground. Nice, uh, oh, nice right hand by Joshua. Angano threw a jab. Joshua ducked under it and came over the top with the right cross with the right hook. Oh, he hurt. Gano hurt. He was wobbling a little bit. God damn, Joshua ain't playing with this boy here, boy. I like nah, you know. Shit, they both of these, but this needs some big jokers, man. Shit, I don't know. Yeah, Gano. Yeah, man. Jo jo Joshua, Joshua need to go back to the body. Just go back to the body. Okay, I like that jab by Gano, but I like the half step back by, by AJ as well. Keep him, keep him in the middle of the ring, AJ. The right hand right there. The right hand was right there. If he reached with that jab again, right cross over the top like you did last time. If he reached with that jab again, right cross over the top. It's going to be there. He biting on every feint, too. Nice jab. He biting on every feint. Oh, straight right hand again. Joshua dropped up again. <laughs> he dropped up again. What is it? Joshua ain't playing. Y'all keep hating on Joshua, man. Y'all keep hating on Joshua, man. Man, they ain't going to let no MMA fighter beat him. And Gunner was an MMA fighter, man. That man an MMA fighter. <laughs> he ain't no boxer. Joshua finna get him out of there now. Oh, he out of there. Oh, he. <laughs> Look at Joshua. <laughs> My nigga. My nigga. Just y'all see Joshua, man. Y'all see Joshua, man. Come on, man. Man, come on, man. Y'all sit there got your y'all sit there got your nuts cross on Joshua. Yeah, man. Oh no, man. He ain't gonna do. Boy, he catch Joshua with that right hand. Y'all know he chinny. What what uh Brady 12 say Joshua big and soft. True, true, <laughs> true. Brady 12 say Joshua big and soft. <laughs> okay. Shout out to Shadow Ghost, man. Shout out to Shadow Ghost. Big and soft, huh? Hey, you notice, you notice when you said that, Brady 12, I started laughing. I say, man, all right, all right, okay, all right. <laughs> Take it sweet, huh? Take it sweet. 
Yeah, man. Listen, this man is an MMA fighter. Remember that. Tyson Fury went 12 rounds in this dude. <laughs> when he went 12, was that 12 rounds or 10? Tyson Fury. <laughs> And <laughs> now Brady moving the goal pole. He said AJ Ducky Fury. <laughs> oh, 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 bro. Hey, man. Hey, man. I get it, dog. I get it, dog. You don't want to. I get it, dog. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> I understand, bro. <laughs> hey, they going to move the goal pole. He Ducky Fury. Sir, sir. Okay, you okay, right now. Right now, you move the goal pole. Now, now you talking about Fury. Fury ain't got nothing to do with this. <laughs> As a matter of fact. Oh, we talking about the Gallo. You know what I mean? Man, bro. That man still, that man still asleep? <laughs> he still asleep? Oh, man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what we not going to do, we not going to try to dis deflect. Y'all want to bring up Fury? I ain't talking about Fury. If we not going to try to deflect. AJ just knocked this dude out. Y'all picked and gone over to knock the man out. Y'all was wrong. Listen, we all trying to deflect now. No, we ain't moving the goalposts that fast. No, you know, no, 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 we ain't doing it. I, I, listen, I've been dealing with y'all for a little over three years. I know how y'all do it now. Y'all, you, hey, 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 y'all start to sound, you start to sound like uh, Spitz fans right now. Wait a minute now, hold on now, we, you know, wait a minute now, we, you know what, no, 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 who ain't gonna fight next? Who ain't gonna fight, dude, goddamn, he just got through fighting this dude, like, you know, <laughs> I get it, 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 I get it. I get it. Uh, oh, man. Bro, listen, Ty, listen, listen, Tyson Fury went, didn't Tyson Fury go the distance with the dude? <laughs> didn't Tyson Fury go 12 rounds with this guy? Look at AJ, poor counter. Hack up! By poor counter. He tired him. Hey, get your ass out of here, man. You, you're an MMA fighter, man. <laughs> man, you're an MMA fighter, man. Get your ass up out of here, man. Taking this shit sweet. <laughs> listening to the you listening to these dudes online. How about your AJ Chinny? AJ Chinny, you'll be able to get him. <laughs> hey, food revolution. Hey, dude. Hey. <laughs> Hey, that's just a wisdom. Yeah, man, you can get him, though. AJ Chitty. You know he ain't got no chin. Look how big you is. In shungo shape. In shungo shape. Yeah, you in shungo shape. You got the strength of old goon. That man broke his ankles, man. Come on, man. True, true. Yeah, yeah, true. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I know. <laughs> may fight ain't gonna beat no goddamn boxer, man. No boxing ring, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. <laughs> Hey, come on, man. Who, who, what, what heavyweight, what heavyweight gonna go to twelve rounds with this dude? Broken. <laughs> AJ like, AJ like, man, y'all got. AJ like, man, you got me fucked up, man. <laughs> Eddie Hearn jumped up. Y'all so Eddie jumping up. Y'all so Eddie jumping up, man. Y'all so Eddie, man. Eddie jumping up. Look at Tyson Fury sitting there clapping. Oh, you ain't trying to clap, no. You went twelve. You nigga, you went twelve round with it, dude. You went twelve round with it, dude, man. <laughs> you went twelve. What about AJ? Slapped this motherfucker, man. Slapped him. <laughs> look here, man. Yeah, you ain't had no business over here, man. You know, look, look, man. Look, man. You a good guy like you. You know, we both, we both African. We both from Africa. You from Cameroon. I'm from Nigeria. We both African. You my brother. But look, man. Um. In the octagon, in the street, you will beat me. I can't do nothing with you. But in this boxing ring, man, I, you know, man, you now you know. Look, man, now you know. Goddamn well, I wasn't going. You know, goddamn well, I wasn't going to let you win, right? You know that, right? <laughs> you know, you know, I wasn't going to let you. AJ Potter told, look, look, man, look, you know, I wasn't going to let you win. Right? Come on, come on, man. I, you know, look, you went twelve rounds with Tyson Fury. You did good. I ain't Tyson Fury. I'm finna get your ass out of there. True, true, true. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, I ain't. You know, look, 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 look. I ain't Tyson Fury. Yeah, it's going to sleep. And see, this what it was. It was a lot of Tyson Fury fans was really rooting for Ngano because his Fury fans hate Joshua. So instead of them admitting that damn Tyson Fury struggled with an MMA fighter, 
No, or what it is now, 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 because he, because he, 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 he shocked everybody. Well, how good, how good he was against Tyson Fury. We just know what he gonna do to AJ. Watch what he do to AJ. That's what it was. True, true, true. That's what it was. That's what it was. I know what it was. I know what it was. I'm talking about the Boston fans. I know what it was. It was the Fury fans. I know what it was. Uh, anyways, but um, it is what it is. Um, AJ, AJ knocked him out, man. AJ put him to sleep, man. He got a, he got a, he got a, he got a, you know, you get what I'm saying? It, it's, it's levels to this shit. <laughs> hey, easy work. <laughs> AJ like, man, it's easy work, man. Easy work, mate. Fourth fight. This is his fourth fight in 11 months. You good, man. You'll, you'll bounce back. You'll bounce back. You're my brother, man. Give him some, give him a hug, AJ. Give him a hug. Give him some sugar, too. Give him a hug. Give him some sugar. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, Gano. Gano, you still a bad man. You still a bad man. Just, you know, just uh, you know, you ran up on life to the Joshua. Hey, the hair, look at that. <laughs> hey, NPR say now Mike has to knock out J Paul. Listen, NPR, brother, I'm gonna tell you something. Iron Mike Tyson at 75 years old. Going we listen, we gonna now that's if the fight, if the fight is not already. If it's going, if you know, be, if they, they're going to be pulling punches, it's going to be like Roy Jones, and you get what I'm saying. But yeah, man, I think Tyson is what thirty years older than Jake Paul. Yeah, man, shit. Hey, Reese, Matt, what you say? Reese say, uh, what you say, Reese? You say Eddie jumped on the uh. <laughs> they gonna be mad. Hey, it's a whole lot of hey, you know what? It's a whole lot of it's a whole lot of niggas over here on to Boston Twitter, Wilder fans. Well like, yeah, man, and God don't and God don't go get him. <laughs> it, it was a wild it was Wilder fans and Fury fans. Yeah, man, you know, and God don't and God don't go get him. Yeah, man, you know, AJ Chitty. You know <laughs> hey, they wouldn't tell themselves all this crazy, right? Yeah. They were, they were, they were, they were convincing themselves, and they, cause it sound good. It sound good, right? They were convincing themselves in their mind, you know. Yeah, man, she was eating that. She, you got to say he cheated too, now. And get what? And he, he, and he, he ducking, and you know, and, and Fury ain't really trained. That, that was, but AJ Joshua, you know, he saw. <laughs> hey, well, <laughs> oh my God, boy, this shit is bad. Oh, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. I get it. Trust me, fam. I get it. I understand. Uh, shout out to Rod. He said, why are the shaking like booty meat right now? <laughs> shit. Man. Shit. Hey, he, hey. hey, man. Man, shit. That right hand. That, but that, hey, that right hand devastating, boy. And hey, shout out to C-No. C-No, salute to you, fam. That right hand was devastating. Shout out to uh, Shotgun Sandwich. He said AJ obviously had air weights in his gloves. Yeah, he had some air weights. <laughs> he does have some air weights. Shout out to Ebony. Hey, okay. Dropping that quarter of a dub. How you doing, sis? She said, Coach, why is the boxing power so different than MMA? Or is it more timing? Please explain. Um, it just MMA is different. It, it, it's, it's two different sports. Um, one sport is more technically sound. They know how to properly throw a punch. And um, it's gloves. There's no grappling. It's just MMA and, and boxing. It, that's kind of like apples and oranges. Outside of the striking, you know, um, I mean, don't get me wrong. There, there's some dudes in MMA that can, they can crack. Like, they got good not good punching power, but they really don't have any gloves on. They got gloves, but they don't really have gloves on like boxing. But I, th I, think, it's, I think it's more the technique. It's the more the technique, and it's just two different sports, you know, from a striking standpoint. It's just two different uh, techniques. The stances are different because you can't really stand in, in the MMA the way you'll stand in boxing because you're going to get kicked with it. You're going to get checked with a, with a leg, whether it was a leg check, a kick, or whatever. Um, you know, I don't, I don't know a whole, whole lot about MMA. I like it. I like it. I want to um, cover more of the sport myself, but it, it, it's just different. It's just different trainings. It, it's differences. Go from the there's a platform stage People pimping, pimping Sharp as razor blades Yeah, they stand different in everything, you know And then in MMA, you gotta prepare for every goddamn thing You gotta, be, you gotta know jujitsu, kung fu, karate Doggone uh, uh, tai chi, you know 
You got you gotta know judo. You gotta know everything, goddamn MMA. Shit. Al Rogan said MMA is a street fight. Everything is self body. Other other, you know, another one of my friends missing ear parts. Yeah, man. Shit. Shout out to Troy. He say Parker Joshua next. Yeah, I wouldn't mind that. Parker Joshua rematch? Absolutely. I got um Parker, Parker Joshua rematch? I wouldn't mind that. I wouldn't mind that. You know what I mean? So uh, I wouldn't mind saying that. Uh, well, I, I do know that Anthony Joshua's probably going to fight again soon. Hey, Troy, this is Anthony Joshua's fourth fight in 11 months. Fourth fight in 11 months. Let that sink in. So he's super active. That's what Joshua was doing. He was fighting. Like right, right when he lost to, uh, lost to Uzi, he took a little break, but he came back and people criticized him, fine, but he kept fighting. He don't have four. This is his fourth fight in 11 months. How many fighters you know doing that right now? How many big name fighters you know doing that right now? Four fights in 11 months. How many big name fighters you know doing that right now? Shout out to Frank Force. He said, great. I'm, I'm very happy for AJ. I mean, a lot, a lot of people had their nuts on them. <laughs> but, you know, but no, nah, but I'm, I told you guys, I'm going to take a boxer over an MMA fighter in boxing. It's in the, in, 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 not MMA, inside of boxing. I'm going to take a boxer seven days a week and twice on Sundays. Jason Follow and Christ say a new way. No, nah, not even a new way. Not even a new way. Not four fights in 11 months. He said Parker has had five fights in 14 months. Okay. And Parker had five fights. Parker's been active. So if you look at it, uh, Joseph Parker and Anthony Joshua are two of the most active fighters in boxing. You get what I'm saying? So I'm not saying they're the most, but they two of the most. And we're talking about we're talking about um big name fighters. Fighters that have a name. You a lot of these dudes, and listen, you ain't you definitely ain't gonna get no American fighters. You ain't gonna get no American fighters fighting that much. Not at this stage of their career. You're not gonna get that. What to say, Pastor Beauty? She say coach, she say coach, um, coach got a live going. Pick up some authentic uh, Japanese state. Oh, okay. You get what I'm saying? Francis got 20 mil, 10 mil per round. <laughs> hey, listen, I'm gonna take a. Uh, he said Fury versus AJ undisputed. I mean, yeah, Fury, Fury, Fury got to beat. Fury got to get by Usi. That ain't gonna be no easy task. Yeah, that ain't gonna be no easy task there, man. Shit. I'm telling you, boy, that, that, that motherfucking Usyk, that, that motherfucking good, bro. I'm telling you, that motherfucking good. That footwork, that footwork gonna be a problem. You know? I always, you know, I always look at a fighter's footwork. Because everything starts with the feet. Everything starts with the feet. Bro, this is nice here, boy. Lord, dropped him with the straight right, right cross. Sat him on his ass. His eyes rolled in the back of his head. And then he, oh, look how he did it. Threw the jab to the right. He threw the jab to the power hand. Poor counter. Hack up. Lord have mercy. Hack up. He saw it coming. But when he saw it, it was too late. AJ <laughs> like, AJ like, man, that man, you even the motherfucker, man, shit. AJ looking like, no, man. Hack up. Lord have got him out of there. Broke his ankles. AJ <laughs> like, he broke his ankles, man. AJ <laughs> like, man, you know you ain't, man, you know, you ain't, look here, man, you know you ain't. Yeah, look, bro, I, look, I, look, man, I'm a businessman. This is my 11, fourth fight in 11 months. Ain't no MMA fighter gonna go to distance with me. <laughs> AJ say, look, ain't no MMA fighter going to distance with me. Hey, that, that, that ain't happening. I know you got big muscles. I know in Shango shape. I get all of that. But listen, ain't no, <laughs> no 
<laughs> up in the, I picked AJ to stop him. I thought it was gonna be late in the round, though. I thought it was gonna be late on. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't know he was gonna get him out of that that early. Listen, I did not know he was gonna get him out of that. He got him out of that early, but AJ like, man, look here, man. Hey, look, bro, look, hey, bro, look, hey, look here, bro, bro. Check this out, bro, bro. Listen, bro, bro. My baby mama, look, my baby mama, bro, bro. I got my baby mama over there, right? Big booty Judy, she waiting on me. Big booty Judy waiting on me, bro, bro. And um. I told her, you know, she say, look, she say, look, um, you know, uh, we got to be somewhere in 30 minutes. I say, look here. I say, look here. Give me about nine minutes. Give me about nine minutes. That's all I need. About nine minutes. I'll be done. You know what I mean? You sure? Because we got somewhere to go in 30 minutes. You know, she say, she, you know, look here, bro, bro. Check this out. Hey, bro, bro. Look here. Um, you know, you know, you know, you ain't going to this, right? <laughs> true, true, true. I don't know, man. I heard you with Chini. They said you with Chini, and they said you big and soft. All right, cool, no problem. Look, you know you ain't going. You know you ain't going to Disney, right? My baby mama told me. My baby mama told me we got somewhere to be in thirty minutes, not thirty. Thirty. We got somewhere to be at thirty minutes, and um, you know, you ain't and, and, and I, I can't let you go to Disney. I'm trying to tell you, man. Hey, Mo Brain say Francis on the phone with Dana. Hey, 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 you know, hey, man, Dana, look, look. Yeah, yeah, what's going on, buddy? Yeah, man, um, you know, yeah, I'm ready to come back. Oh, you ready to come back, huh? Oh, okay. You done made some big money. You done made some lot of boxing money. You did good. You okay, you ready to come back? Yeah, man, you know, it's it's different. It's different over there. It's different. Shout out to Doughboy. He said, do you think AJ can finally beat Usyk? Nah. I, th I think, I don't know, man. I don't know. Anything can happen in the sport of boxing, but only time the Usyk is a really, really good fighter. And a lot of people don't understand that. Like, I've been watching this guy since the Olympics. He's a really, really good fighter. And he, he's, he's in hell of a conditioning. He understands angles very well. He has crazy feints, and he has really, really good footwork. And he can get around. He got. He can get around the strong side or the weak side. Like this dude, good. And and he fights at our up tempo. He good, bro. That dude good, fam. Y'all gonna y'all gonna see. Uh shout out to he, what he say. He said Usyk adapts in the match. Yeah, uh, Cino, you're right. Usyk does. He's a, he's a very highly high. Like a lot of people didn't know nothing about him. Kenneth Johnson said Usyk is soft to the body. That's his kryptonite. Kenneth Johnson is right. That's Usyk's kryptonite, the body. He can't take no body shots. If you get a fighter, I'm going to drop the phone lines. If you get a fighter that's committed to the body, pop, Lord have mercy. Well, he caught him with the Zeus right hand. They talking about, yeah, boy, who's, if, if, if God who catch Joshua with that right hand, it's over with. Man, shit. Like, as though, as though Joshua ain't got no power. Yeah, man. <laughs> hey, Joshua, Joshua ain't really breaking. Look like, yeah, man, just, just another day at the park, man. You know, I, you know, I, he got knocked down. He got knocked out. Let me go ahead and drop these phone lines, man. Let me go ahead and do this right quick. Uh, get ready to drop them. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Let everybody call in. You want to talk some shit? Call me. Start some shit, bitch. Sup, fool? You going to talk shit about me, homie? Where you from? Hundreds of niggas is waiting for your motherfucking call, and they all talking shit about you right now. Call the coach at 530-494-9636. We waiting on your bitch ass. Call what's your name you call from? Hey, how you doing, coach? This is Adolfo from Town. Adolfo, talk to me. Oh, man. Tyson Fury gave Nganu way too much fucking respect. You know, he thought it was an e he thought it was easy for him going into that fight two months ago. And when you, t but when you look at Anthony Joshua, a man who takes his boxing seriously, and there is a result in just less than two rounds. I mean, I mean, I, I do respect Ngannou, 
or coming into boxing and, and trying out his luck. But when you have a guy like Joshua who takes his boxing seriously, it, that's all it takes. Just uh, just a less than two rounds to knock him out. Wait, wait was that was that that was the second round, or did he do three? Second. Second round. Dang. That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God, damn. I, I thought I, I thought he made that. He ain't making the three. <laughs> <laughs> he, 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 oh man! He didn't make, he didn't make it to three. Oh, I was like, man, I ain't man. I yeah, ain't. And, and 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 that's my point is that look at Fury. He he gave him way too much respect. Even and you see that this is why I hate boxing sometimes, man. Yeah. Because you know I can't wait for Fury and Usyk because I want to see what Usyk can do to him. If Ngannou can put a dent on Fury, I can't imagine what Usyk will do. But at the same time, like I said, I respect Yanu for doing for coming into boxing. But after today, man, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, it's now up in the air again. I mean, we'll see. We'll see. I mean, you got to take you got to take boxing on a fight by fight basis. You know, the triangle theory really doesn't work in boxing. We'll see. You know what I mean? So, which I yeah, exactly. Awful, man. So anyway, that's my call, Coach. All Thank right. you. I'm just saying, like, it was motherfucker really thought that Joshua was gonna lose to this MMA guy, like literally, like people who's supposed to be boxing fans. And I'm like, damn, they serious? I'm like, I, you know, I don't know if they were trolling or what. I'm like, dude, like, I mean, I get it, you know, I get it, but damn, like y'all, either y'all had that much respect for Engano, and you know, or you had that much um uh, dislike for Joshua. I'm like, man. This dude the MMA. I'm like, this dude the MMA guy. Um, come on, man. Um, caller, what's the name you call it from? Hey, what's up, coach? It's D Block. D Block, talk to me. Ooh, this is how we do it. This is how we do it. This is how we do it. It's Friday night. And they tell you not the fuck out that MMA fighter, coach. Can you believe that? Yeah, that yeah, I was Classic. Yeah, I can believe it. That was, <laughs> I mean, so, somebody somebody in the future as a little kid is going to get a, a poster and then it's going to have AJ under in, in the back of the wall and it's going to show him when he knocked out that MMA fighter in Ghana. See, this is transcending, coach. This yeah. is to another level <laughs> of don't you ever, 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 ever come back here. Don't you ever come back. See, these MMA fighters still don't listen. They want that. I know what they want. They want payday, payday. Yeah. But at the end of the day, are you willing to risk your life? Today, you looked at Ngannou, coach. He could have died. What you got to say with that? I mean, you know, in, in any combat sport, you know, they put their lives on the line and one punch can, you know, hurt, hurt a person or whatever. That is true. I mean, that's the risk that these fighters are willing to take, you know what I mean, for monetary gain. So, I mean, he tried his luck. AJ slept him. You know, he thought it was, you know, he thought it was sweet. You know, because uh, you know, cause okay. some some say that he arguably beat Tyson Fury, and uh, some people felt like he got robbed against Tyson Fury. So they was like, "Well, since he since he gave Tyson Fury a hard time, what you think he'll do to AJ?" They, the triangle threat theory, and I'm like, uh, "Is it just me?" I'm like, "AJ gonna stop this dude." I don't see no MMA yeah. fighter beating him. I said this on the show. Like, he gonna stop this dude. He gonna I said he gonna stop this. Dude. He gonna knock this dude out. I picked the TKO I mean, stoppage, but um, he's stressed yeah. out. And I'm like, man, like, you know. Coach, I'm going to let it go like this. You know, I've been smoking nothing but Reggie. I mm -hmm. feel good. I feel glad. I know you're smoking your own thing, Coach. You got your own brand. You got your, you know, you. I, I know where you're coming from, Coach. But for me, right here in the hood, I'm relaxing with my Reggie. Mm -hmm. It makes me feel good. It makes me relax. I'm drinking my, my drink. And let me tell you something, Coach. Mm -hmm. When I hit that Reggie, it, it hit so good that when I saw him knock him out, I thought he knocked him out to another world. D block, D count, D city, D ville. Baltimore, stand up. I mean, just me just hearing the word Reggie give me a headache. <laughs> true, true, true. Just me hearing the word Reggie give me a headache. The stickiest of the icky. You want to smoke with the old boy Rick James? You get what I'm saying? Sit your five dollar ass down before I make change. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, guys. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Let me let me put y'all on mute for a minute.
Hey man, yo, um, hold on. Matter of fact, is someone on the line? No, I thought somebody was on the line. My bad. Yo, you get what I'm saying? So I'm like, bro, like, I'm like, this dude is an MMA fighter, fam. Like, I, <laughs> I mean, he, he got a nice story. You know, I, I love the fact the background he came from. He was a beast, big name in MMA, but he was a beast, big name in the MMA. And I think a lot of people overlook that. He's a big name in the MMA. He knocks people out in an MMA. This is boxing is different. You get what I'm saying? So I'm glad that uh, now this is good for boxing that AJ slept him. This is good for the sport that I love that AJ slept him. Like, look, man, this is how you take care. This is how you take care of drop shots. Nah, this dude here, he's a beast, but he ain't got no business in the ring with me. That's that's what you do. That, that's what you do. You get what I'm saying? Dude come in your house, your sport, you do him like that. <clears throat> call him, what's your name, where you call him from? Jamie from New York. All right, Jamie from New York. I'm talking to him. Hey, Coach, I hear you got him going back to NNA. Uh, when did he say that? So, he told you, no, because no, um, I heard somebody, somebody make a comment in, um, the, the, in the chat. You know, messing around. Oh, yeah. But, uh, you know, he thought, he thought it was going to be sweet over here fighting AJ. You know, I don't know if you're a, a, a true professional boxer in a boxing match, man. There's no way. There's no way. <laughs> uh, I, I thought Joshua was going to, um, you know, take him out later in the fight, seven or eight. But, you know, even easier than I anticipated. But, uh, Coach, I want to talk about Parker, man. Real quick, man. Um, that was a great win for him, bro. I've been listening to you, you know, the whole time. Mm. And I'm happy for the man, bro. That, that's a perfect example. A guy that um, I heard that uh, that win is going to set him up, you know, to get a title shot. Yeah. And that's a perfect example of, uh, of uh, you know, uh, doing it the hard way, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That brother right there is not cutting corners. So, I hope he gets his title shot, man. You know, and I'm really happy for him. I also picked him to win a decision. And, um, yeah, man. That's it, Coach. I'm going to continue to try, man. I'm going to talk to you uh, maybe tomorrow. Absolutely, fam. All right? Hello, guys. <laughs> Damn, I just thought I had to sneeze. Yeah, um, I'm just saying, bro, like, again, <laughs> he's an MMA fighter. And let me tell you something. This needs to happen to a lot of these guys. I kind of want to see, even though Mike Tyson is 58 years old, I want to see, well, he'll be 58 this year. I want to see Tyson sleep Jake Paul. Just let him know that this ain't sweet. You know, I, I want to see him sleep him. Like, we got to, you know what, dog? We got to, this is what we got to do. Let me go in and take care of you right quick. Let you know, let you know it ain't sweet over here. You get what I'm saying? I know you fight set up fights and stuff, but uh, let me let you, let me let you, let me let you know it ain't sweet over here. I'll call it, what's name you call it from? Troy Graham, Baltimore. What's uh, going on, sir? That's what I talked to. Him. It was a good, a good night of boxing for UK fighters, and it, it, uh, which it also proves that boxing's alive and well everywhere except for in the US of A. That's what that's what these these fights prove. I never had Joshua lose in that fight ever. Mm. I said if if if, but I never had him losing it because I I think he's a much more serious, focused fighter than Fury is. Uh, his last four fights were fights he should have won. Uh, you know, he fought Alawalin, he fought uh, Jermaine Franklin, and I forgot who who the other dude was. Uh, Parker, I'm surprised that he won, but. You know, as I was listening to you speak on it, once you said around seven and Paco was still around, mm -hmm. I said to myself, all Paco got to got to do is go to his body and stick to his body because this guy's letting him hang around too much, so he's getting tired. Mm -hmm. And lo and behold, he, he won on points, right? Who won on points? Talking about um... Parker. Yeah, Parker. Yeah, yeah, he won on points. So. Yeah, Parker won on points. So. It's kind of like the obvious matchup now. You put you you, you get the rematch with Park and Joshua. What is this, what is this, uh, Coach? We in March, right? So yeah, March, let's yeah. say they fight in July, huh? So 
Yeah, man. You know, set that fight for July. Have a fight in July, and that'll be that'll be a good fight for the sun. You know. Yeah, 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 for sure. Well, I mean, we'll we'll see what's up. I mean, boxing. You know, it's it's a sport that's very very hard to predict. Uh, fights, you know, the fights come out of nowhere. You know, you know, money dictates everything. So, um, yes, sir. it is what it is, man. I'm, I'm happy for Anthony Dawson. I'm glad he took care of the MMA fighter because there was some people that was talking real crazy. Yeah, man, you know he, you know, <laughs> yeah. yeah, man, you know he. So he did with Fury now, you know AJ Cheney. I'm like, man, y'all listen, y'all. This dude, the MMA fighter, man, AJ gonna knock this dude out because he, the, the, the way he fights, he gonna knock this dude out. You know, and uh. You know, so I mean, you know, so some dude was talking crazy. Now, now, now they got some sense. Now we knocked them out. Look, dude, you was good at MMA, UFC, but now we put you to sleep. And now it, it, it give a lot of those guys who think it's sweet over here, even with the MMA fans and stuff like that. Okay, you you see what's up, you know. And then even with the Jake yeah. Paul stuff, like Mike can knock this dude out if he want to knock him out, you know. So you know, let, let me tell the you what, if it's it, 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 if it's not like a scripted fight and not like just a, just like what you said, you know, uh, what is it, you know, uh, exhibition fight, right? Mm. Michael just, he, he can still blow people out to the body. Because if you look at it, Jay Paul fought one boxer and he lost, right? That was uh, Tommy Fury. Was, yeah. Was, yeah. Well, was well, that Tommy, Tommy Fury. I, I, don't, I can't even, I don't, I don't even know if I want to count him as a boxer, but in, in comparison exactly, to Jay Paul, but yeah. he, yeah, see, he fought one guy who actually has boxing experience and he lost. Mm. Mike Tyson, yeah, he is 57, but what you got to understand, Mike Tyson's at a peaceful place in his life, and he, he's keeping himself in good shape. Yeah, he smokes a lot of weed and all that, but he's in good shape, man. So I, I think a couple of well-placed body shots will put put this dirty boy back in his place. Yeah, we got yeah, we got to get Jake Paul he, out of there, man. We got to get him out of there. Hey, shout out to yeah, we Trump, do, man. I can't we stand him. And we got we to gotta get Jake Paul out of there. Look, man, when he when he do wanna do when he do wanna 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 play play, wanna play play with this thing, gotta we got you gotta get him out. We gotta we gotta we gotta get we gotta get Jake Paul out. Jake got to go. <laughs> Jake got to go. Jake got to go, dog. I was, you know what I mean? Like Jake, uh, listen, Jake got Jake got to go. He got to go, man. You know what I'm saying? Like I I, I like Jake Paul. I like him, but he got to go. And I'm, I'm putting on the Jake Got to Go campaign over here. Like, literally, he got to go, man. Y'all know I'm a Mike Tyson fan, boy. You know, I got Mike. Where I got Mike at? I got Mike right there. I got shit. I got Mike right there. Mike right there. Hagler right there. Sugar Ray Robinson right there. I got Roy Jones right there. Pernell Whitaker right here. Man, shit. Nigga, hey, man. Motherfucker, man, this my nigga. Shit, that motherfucker got to go, man. Shit. <laughs> shit, I ain't trying to. It, 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 this, this, we got to knock this motherfucker out, Mike. Look here, man. Look, this dude can't box a lick. Still. I don't know, man. Boy, Jay Paul laying there right here. I said, y'all saying the same shit that y'all was saying with Ngano. Ngano was a great fighter in the MMA, not boxing. But he's a great fighter. I, I love Ngano. I, I, I love him. Um, Jake Paul is a horrible fighter. Like literally. Leaves himself wide open for everything. Tyson gonna kill this dude. Now, the only way he don't kill him is if it's just a regular exhibition match where they're gonna be pulling punches and and this and that and, and, and you know, whether whether it's a regular exhibition match or something of that sort. You know, you know, so other than that, other than that, like, nah, I'll call it, what's your name you're calling from? What's up, Coach? This is Coach Eddie from the ATL. What's happening, brother? Coach Eddie, talk to me. Not much, man. I just want to just chime in on the this vicious knockout that we just seen, man. That was, uh, shoot. That was devastating right there, man. Uh, AJ looked good, man. Looked like he back, bro. He, <laughs> he looked like the old AJ that I, that I seen. He's going to be tough to beat, man. Uh, the way he, he keep looking, I don't know what Ben Davis. I think with AJ, his problem is not really always been physical. It's been his mental. Like when he fought Usyk, he lost for the wrong reason. I think he he tried to fight Usyk's fight. He tried to outbox a master boxer. 
And instead of just going there trying to steamroll the guy, man. Uh, so he, I don't know. I think right now he's on a good good place. He looked good. He looked strong. Man, that is one of the hardest right hand I ever seen in my life, man. I ain't even gonna front, man. I was in here watching that and I was like, dang, man, like he's almost broke the dude neck, man. Yeah, um the with the Usyk, no one is gonna steamroll Usyk. Because Usyk has excellent footwork, great fangs, and he has very, very deceptive power. Um so mm -hmm. I, no one you're not gonna I've been watching this dude, I've been watching the dude since the Olympics, man, when he was in the Olympics. That dude was good, bro. Like he has very, yeah, very oh yeah. he has very, very good you know, he's weak to the body, but he has very, very good footwork. And he uh, he's good and he, he picks up the tempo on you. Um but as as of like the AJ, um AJ looked real good, but I gotta keep it in this proper perspective. This was the MMA fighter. That's right. He should look good against a Francis Ngannou. He should. Yeah. AJ is a really good fighter, real good boxer. Um, and he did what he was supposed to do, to be honest with you. I didn't think he was gonna knock him out this early, but he did what he was supposed to do. You know? Oh yeah, it was vicious, and uh, I think if him and if him and Tyson Fury were to fight right now, I think I think Tyson Fury is diminished in my, in my opinion. But uh, I'm gonna bet I'm gonna put a lot of money, hate on um, heavy on AJ to knock out Tyson Fury because he ain't really been looking good. He look like he's on the downside. And uh, if AJ catches Tyson Fury with one of the right hands, he going to sleep. He ain't gonna get back up. Because you know that that's my call, coach. I right, shout out to Coach Eddie. Salute, fam. Um, what you say to Don? Say they're calling for a while the AJ fight. Who? <laughs> hey, listen, 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 listen. Wilder, Wilder, AJ should have fought each other a long time ago. Uh. Uh, they should have fought each other a long time ago. Like for real, but that that ship has sailed, you know. Um, that that was very very toxic with the Alphabet Boys. You know, they rode with Wilder. Anything they ride with turned to shit. I noticed that. Uh, Carlos, what's your name? You call it from? Hey, what to do, Coach? Yes, sir. Carlos, what's your name? You call it from? Hey, what to do, Coach? All right. Hug up on you. Um, next time when you call, brother, when I say call, what's your name? When you call it from, brother, just uh, tell me your name, and we can make it happen. Other than that, I'm getting them, I and mean, I got a million goddamn text messages. Coach ain't, coach ain't, you know. Let's try this again. Uh, call her, what's your name when you call her from? It's Patrick from St. Louis. Patrick from St. Louis, talk to me. Hey, Coach, man, I put this right here all on Ben Davis. I think, you know, when you look at this fight and you look at what's happened with AJ mm. since Ben Davidson came back, you know, into his corner or got into his corner and left Tyson Fury, you see the big difference that he made and how he disposed of these two guys. I did not see this in coming. I had uh, type, I mean, uh, Angana winning this fight, but just how easily he dispatched to those two guys, that shows you how much a difference it makes if you have the right guy in your corner. Oh. Yeah, I see what you're saying. You're talking about the actual trainer. Um, ben, you know, Ben Davidson used, used to train, train with Tyson Fury, but Fury got rid of him because he needed a certain style in order to beat Wilder, and he got with Sugar Hill. But Ben Davidson is a great technical trainer. Like he he really is a good trainer. Like he really I don't think he used to box, but it doesn't matter. Like he know his stuff. He's really really he's really good. And um, uh, Joshua looks a lot better with Ben Davidson than he did with Derrick James. To be fair, he looks a lot better. Well, then think about this though, Coach. Look at uh, Wilder. When Wilder got uh, Malik Scott in his corner. Yeah. Now, when uh, Wilder fought Fury, they went toe-to-toe -to -toe for 12 rounds. And really, a lot of people believe Wilder won that fight. Yeah. But, you know, it was called a draw. But once he got rid of Ben Davidson and went with Malik Scott, 
after that, he got whooped two fights in a row. So no, I'm just mean, saying you mean, that's, you, mean, you mean once um Tyson Fury got rid of Ben Davidson after the first fight and Tyson Fury ended up I um, mean once once um uh uh um Wilder? Wilder got rid of his his trainer. Oh, you you talking about um, and, uh, um the brother uh, Mark Breland. Mark Breland. Yeah. Mark Breland. And once he got rid of Mark Breland, you know what I mean? He was he was you know he was easy to work. I mean, I guess both guys uh switched trainers after that first fight. But I no, think no, he no, started no, no, big no, 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 Wilder, Wilder, Wilder had Mark Breland in the second fight. He fired him after the second fight. I, I, when he when he when he lost to Fury, he fired him. He fired him. Right, like, oh, right. Yeah, that's what happened because um. You right. You right. He felt like you right. You know he he, he accused Mark Breland of spiking his water bottle, drugging him, on top of all the other things that he said was the reason why he lost. The costume was too heavy, crabbing the bucket referee, water bottle was spiked. Fury had egg weights. They put juju on him. It was a whole bunch of stuff, you know. So. Um, but look, man, hey, um, Patrick, man, I got you, man. Uh, salute. Hey, shout out to Patrick from St. Louis. Salute, brother. Salute to you, fam. Uh, caller, what's your name? Where you calling from? Hello, Coach. This is Godwin from Lagos, Nigeria. Man, Godwin, man, from Nigeria, man. I haven't heard from you in a long time, brother. How you doing? I'm good, man. I normally come up your um Instagram page to make one of the comments once in a while. Yes, sir. Man, right. coach, that was a devastating knockout, man. I'm happy for Anthony Joshua. I think Joshua is back. Let's hope and see how the future goes for him. Mm -hmm. That was that was a devastating knockout. That was a good one. Yes, sir. It was a good and one. And I also want to commend you. Uh, thanks for your program. I appreciate you. I listen to you a lot. You're doing a good job. Good job. I appreciate you, Godwin, man, man. I mean, you, you, um, you know, I really appreciate you, man. Shout out to all of the, the family out there in Nigeria. I really appreciate you, brother. I'm glad. I'm glad you called the show. Yeah, no problem, coach. Thanks, man. Yes, Bye. Sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, man. This uh, this brother here, Godwin from Nigeria. He been he been listening to me a long time, like almost pretty much when I first started. You know, when I first started. You get what I'm saying? So, yeah, man. Uh. Yeah, Sheila, shout out to Sheila for <laughs> Sheila say Nigeria in the house. Yeah, yeah, Nigeria in the house, man. Nigeria's in the house. Yeah, God when God been like he been following me like since um he been riding with me since like uh shit. I started I I, I got crunk in 2021, so yeah, since around that time. Oh, y'all talking about Wilder, huh? <laughs> y'all talking about <laughs> Oh y'all talking about Y'all and y'all in the chat talking about Wilder, huh? All right. All right, all right, all right. So what what y'all talking about? He said, Coach, Canelo fighting Jaime Mugil. Yeah, we already yeah, yeah, we already knew that. Yeah, we already knew he fighting Jaime Mugil. That's gonna be an easy that's gonna be an easy win for Canelo. Canelo gonna dismantle with Jaime Mugil. Like literally, he gonna he gonna dispatch of him. Jaime. Um. Yeah, he gonna dispatch of him. Hey, what to say? Uh, else aside, he said Fury never dug AJ. All of a sudden, here goes the BS AJ fans beating. Oh, so y'all, so what? What are y'all talking? Y'all talking about Fury, AJ, and Wild? <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so what y'all talking about? Fury, AJ, and Wilder? <laughs> hey, Ali Muhammad say, uh, Coach, what about, he said, what about Nganu versus Wilder? Oh, uh, that'll be, that, that'll be, <laughs> I don't know, that'll be, that'll be a heck of a fight. Because if Wilder, if Wilder catch him with the straight right down the pipe, you know, it is what it is. All, the beat Wilder, all you got to do is just put him on the back foot. The beat Wilder, you just put him on the back foot. Press him. He can't fight off the back foot. It's, 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 really, it's really that simple. 
To beat Wilder, just put him on the back foot. You take away his power because he can't throw. He can't step into it. You go to his body. Uh, you make him fight your type of fight where he has to think. And you know he's going to you know he's going to go back. He's going to be doing like this here. Doing like this. Here. You get what I'm saying? Like that. Look, look at Because he don't, he don't have a jab. He don't have a jab. He don't have a hook. Like literally, he doesn't have anything. But if you stand right there, I could drop the right hand straight down the pipe. The one, two down the pipe. But that's, that's about it. That's about it, you know. What to say, Frank? You say you say Wilder has to be hiding in the basement right now. Yeah, I mean, I'm not. I, I'm I'm not, man. You know, I mean, I get it. I do get it. You know, I get it. You know, I get it with Wilder and stuff like that. But you know, it is what it is, man. You know, Wild 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 enjoying his life, man. Wilder right now. Wilder right now. He's looking at um. Uh, I you know. I think he's in the studio though. I think I think he's in the studio because I know I know he's um he's making um he's making uh uh well Wilder Wilder making them Afro beats Afro songs Wilder in the studio Wilder in the studio doing his thing man like shit you know Wilder man shit that dude made a lot of money bro that dude later made a lot of money Wilder made him some good money fam Wilder made him some good money he made some good money in this sport bro. I think I think Wilder Wilder probably got a couple of more good. Hey, you know what? That will you, you know what? That should be the next fight there for Wilder in Engano. Uh, what you what, what you said, fam? You said um somebody said um Engano and Wilder. Yeah, you know what? This is the thing though. After mm, I know wasn't Wilder them trying to make that fight already though. I think uh, I think I think they were trying to make that fight before, but AJ came and took it. I think AJ came and took it, and so now you know what? After Engano got knocked out and put to sleep, I wonder what his value is going to be like. Nelly Conte to say it's official: Canelo versus Munguia May four. I mean, we are we are, we we knew he was going to fight him. So uh, you say both been booted and knocked out by UK heavyweights. Oh yeah, yeah. You know what? Hitman, yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't even think about that, y'all. Yeah. Joshua and and uh, Fury. Joshua and Fury, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, you know, I didn't, I didn't, even, I didn't even look at it that way. But you're right, though. What you say, G five? You say no. Wilder lost, and Engano took his place. Yeah. But see, this is the thing, right? Because they were still, you know, people were still saying, "No, man, AJ Duck and Wilder." Because he don't want to fight Wilder, but 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 him fighting Joshua and AJ fighting each other, it was a known fact. And Wilder did say it, and 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 Joshua said it, and Eddie Hearn said it that in order for him to fight AJ, both of them had to win their next matches. It was contingent upon both men winning their fights. AJ won, knocked out Robert Hellenius, and and um and Wilder lost to Joseph Parker. And there were people still saying, oh, man, he still can fight him. He still can do this and do that. Look, dude, like, you dudes got to be held accountable. Shout out to Nick Rich in the building. Nick, what's going on, sis? Like, dude, there has to be some level of accountability. You can't just, okay, well, even though I messed up, give me another chance. No, no, that was, this was, that was an agreement, fam. All you had to do was beat Joseph Parker. So, I mean, you know. And then what it is, man. All you had to do beat Joseph Parker. The man lost. And then he looked, then he looked terrible doing it. He said, Oda Wileen. Oh, yeah, I'm talking about um uh well Joshua knocked out Oda, Robert Hellenius and Oda Wileen. And he, but he, he looked terrible doing it. The man was all in that like this. He would, he would, he was doing this to Joseph Parker. You get what I'm saying? Like, no, nah, man, nah. he looked terrible, bro. Like, you can't, you can't give a dude, you can't give a dude, you can't reward him like that. Do you get what I'm saying? No, nah. no, nah, you can't reward that, bro. You get what I'm saying? No, nah, he, he ain't got no skills. Like, he got rid of he, he, he and, and, and you know what? If I'm if I'm wilder, I get Malik Scott back. I mean, I get uh, you got to get Mark Breland back. 
You got to get Mark Breeland back. The big, you know what I mean? You, you have to. Because at this point, you with Malik Scott, but you regressing with Malik Scott. Hey, shout out to Nick. <laughs> Nick said, <laughs> hey, he regressing with Malik Scott. Dude, you ain't got no jab. You ain't, you know, you still ain't doing squats. Dude, like, you ain't doing no squats. You get what I'm saying? Like, if, like you ain't doing no squats, bro. No leg. Like, you, you feel me? Come on, man. Like, you ain't doing no squats, bro. Malik Scott more like his homeboy. And Malik Scott is a yes man to Wilder. Tell him everything you want to hear. Yes, 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 yes. I was in L.A. I was at the, I was at the Brick House gym, right? And, and, and anybody in L.A. know the Brick House gym, that's where Duante Wilder trains at, him or Malik Scott. Anytime you see a video where Malik Scott training from um, Ellie Setback or whatever, they're in the Brick House gym. And, bro, like, that's all they do. We, uh, yo, you know, yo, Deont yo, see, see Deontay, you know, you know, he, you know, he 10 times better than Muhammad Ali inside the ring, and he fought 10, time, 10 more times more battles than Ali outside the ring. Like, these are the type of people that he, these are the type of people that he, that he has in his corner. You ain't gonna never get better when you got, when you got a bunch of yes men in your goddamn corner. Uh, shout out to DJ Dix, Dixon. Hey, okay. He said, always said that AJ, he said, always said that AJ the second best boxer in the heavyweight division after Usyk, but people hates, hates AJ for some unknown reason. Well, you know, how it's supposed to be, DJ, is the fighters have to fight each other and then we can come to a conclusion. In this era, you know, fighters, ain't, a lot of them ain't really fighting. Some of them ain't fighting each other like that. And we never get to the conclusion because, you know, it, it, that's just the area that we're in, you know, so. Uh, shout out to Al Rogan, dropping that quarter of a dub. Hey, okay. He said, Coach, why everybody using the same cut, man? Which cut, man, are you talking about? Hey, Leroy. Super Jack received Playtime's over, boy. boy. Which one are you talking about? Stitch Duran? Down from the bar, there's a platform stage. People primping for the sharpest blades. If you're talking about Stitch, yeah, people, you know, I mean, people can hire, you know, people can hire anybody they want to hire, you know what I mean? Like, I spoke to Stitch Duran. I'm going to get him on the show. I'm going to get him on the show. And um, I spoke to him, have his number. So I'm going to get him on the show, man, and... Uh, you know, he told me how it works is the promotional companies reach out and hire him. You know, so they'll reach out and say, hey, man, we need you, you know, because he's known. He's a known cut man. And Stitch Duran comes from the MMA. I don't know if you guys knew that, but Stitch Duran was worked in the MMA first before he transitioned to boxing. How do I know? He told me this out of his own mouth in Vegas. You know, in Vegas. He told me this in my own mouth in Vegas, so. You know, so I'm trying to, man, I'm trying to see, man, like, you know, it is what it is, man. Like, we, we ain't got, as I said, bro, we ain't got nothing over here, bro. Heavyweight division, we're done. <laughs> hey, Sheila, we are done. We are done. Like, there's nothing that we can do to change anything. Like, we, we ain't got nothing in America on the heavyweight scene. Everybody, other heavyweights from around the world are better than American heavyweights. We ain't got nothing. They say, well, man, they're they playing football. They're playing basketball. Well, whatever. Well, whatever they doing, what we have now, what we have now ain't, uh, what we have now ain't, ain't nothing. We ain't got nothing over here, bro. Not when it comes to no heavyweights. Everything else here. Well, heavyweights and cruiserweights, no. Heavyweights, cruiserweights, light heavyweights, and maybe even super middleweight. We ain't got nothing. Super middleweight, you can say, well, we, well, well, we got Caleb Plant. <laughs> we got Caleb Plant. David Benavidez is a light heavyweight now. He done moved up, so we ain't really got nothing. Uh... We ain't got nothing in middleweight. 
So in America, let's look at it, bro. In America, from middleweight all the way up to heavyweight, we don't have no talent, no nothing really. And from junior middleweight to junior middleweight, welterweight, ugh, shit. 140, I'd probably say Devin Haney, and, and um, but really mostly it's not even, it's just him, American. And that's because he moved up. 135, one to 130, 126, man. Uh, I got, you know, I got you know, to look at, I got to look at that. We ain't really got nothing, bro. We got lightweight. One, we got some talent at 140. Welterweight, Crawford and Spence and Jerron Ennis. Well, Crawford ain't and Crawford ain't 147, 147 no more. He's moving up to 160. So he's going to middleweight. So um man, I, you know what, bro? Now now I see why over here in America, the lot of the content credit, what well, a lot of the Boston fans and the content credit, they only talk, they only want to talk about the same fighters. It's going to be Canelo, and he Mexican. It's going to be Javante Davis. He from Baltimore. It's going to be Terrence Crawford. Everybody hates Terrence Crawford. Um, everybody hates Canelo. Uh, Tank, Ryan Garcia, Devin Haney. Bill Haney going to make sure everybody talking about Devin Haney. Um, they don't talk about Osaki Foster. They don't talk about Raymond Ford. They don't talk about um, Cool Boy Steph. They don't talk about, well, you can't talk about Gary Russell because he ain't even fighting. So it's some fighters ain't worth talking about. They ain't talking about Jamal Talo. The only time they talk about Jamal Talo is when he don't went to the club and got drunk. Uh, you get what I'm saying? So. I get now 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 I get it. Now I uh yeah, I ain't I was I ain't finna be arguing with no motherfuckers on none of this shit, man. Shit. It don't make no you know what I mean? It ain't it ain't no need. It's it's a waste of energy. I wanna say this in closing. Do not allow others to transfer their energy onto you. Shout out to the Dexter of Wisdom. I'm glad you're here. And the goddess is here as well. Do not allow other people to transfer their energy on to you. What do I mean by that? You got a lot of people, especially on social media, they're very toxic and they're very negative. And you have people who are in bad moves, angry moves, shit ain't going good in their life. You know, they, they, they wife left them, they, their husband left them, their baby daddy left them. Uh, third leg Tyrone ain't laying it down like he used to, and they and they like to project their miserable, they like their attitudes. They may have an attitude. They may be a guy who come around. This nigga just want to have start a fight, bring bad energy. Might be a chick. So what they're doing since we are all energetic beings, as Professor Grift once told me, we are all spiritual beings having a human experience. You have to guard your space from people trying to transfer their energy onto you. Do you get what I'm saying? That negative energy. Soon as you see it, you, oh, okay, boom. Oop, no, hold up, swole up, get on out the way. Now I'm going to get up out of here. I'm good. Because that's what they want to do. And on social media, it's full of that. Motherfuckers going, yeah, man, you know, they want to they project. They, they're trying to transfer. What's that movie with, um, there's a movie with Denzel Washington. Well, I think Denzel was a cop. He ended up getting this guy busted, and this guy ended up getting the death row, death, uh, getting the uh, the death penalty, and he ended up getting killed. And but he had this demonic spirit in him that transfers from different people. Yo, that's what it is. Falling, falling from different pe different people, and it's looking to, you know, infect. Those who are there, you get what I'm saying. So y'all, so you got you got to protect yourself against that. Protect yourself against that. That's all. Understand what people are trying to do to you. You get what I'm saying. 
Let's give everybody a round of applause. Um, shout out to Dante. Hey, okay. Dropping that quarter over. Hey, dub on your boy. Hey, Leroy. Super chat received. Playtime's over, boy. boy. He say, Coach. He say, Coach. Are you planning on getting um Hitman Hearn on the show? You know what? I haven't even thought about it. That's a good question, though. I should. I should. I would. I would. I would love. I would love to get um Eddie Hearn on the show. You know, I would love to get him on the show. That's um. I haven't even thought about that. But that's that's a good question. I'm gonna I'm gonna see what I can do. Down from the bar, there's a platform stage. People pimping, pimping, sharp as razor blades. Hey man, shout out to everybody who called the show. Let's give everybody a shout out who gave a super chat. Uh, well, gave a cash out rather. Wow. Shout out to Paul. Shout out to Paul. Hey. Uh, for dropping a twenty dollar cash app, he dropped a five dollar cash app. Okay, and uh, we were talking about Usyk is left hand. Yeah, Usyk, Usyk is the southpaw. He talking about Holyfield is right handed. And shout out to Paul again. He said he's a left handed Holyfield. Oh yeah, he talking about Usyk. Yeah, I think I think Usyk probably had better footwork than Holyfield though. Holyfield didn't have the footwork that Usyk had. Um, shout out to Anthony. Hey, okay. Dropping that half a dub, man. He say thanks, coach, for uh, new to the channel. Hey, I appreciate you, Anthony. Let's give all of the cash apples a round of applause. <laughs> yeah, man. Let's give a shout out to everyone who gave a super super chat. Uh, oh, shout out to Dantes again. Hey. Dropping that quarter of a dub. He said, ask him, he said, ask him, ask him about that Booger Ray fight. We're trying to promote. Hey, you know the crazy part about it? Uh, hey, Dante, I had did two, I did two shows, fam. Two shows. Real talk. I did two shows just promoting Eddie Hearn in um Eddie Hearn and um Booger Ray Leonard. Dead serious. Two shows. Two shows. Right around the time when they was beefing with each other. And, and, and um, Booger Ray said he want to put hands on him. I did two shows, just no fight, no box. I had Eddie Hearn versus I had Eddie Hearn versus uh, I had I had a. Uh, that's when I came up with. That's when I came up with Booger Ray Leonard. Damn, sorry about that. Why my damn camera keep going off? That's when I came up with Booger Ray. I said I got to come up with a name to promote this fight. I say Eddie the Hitman Hearns versus Booger Ray Leonard, and that's that's when I came up with that. Real talk. Uh, shout out to Dante. Hey. Shout out to Al Rogan. Okay. Shout out to DJ Dixon. Okay. Shout out to um, Doughboy. Okay. Ebony76. Okay. Shotgun Sandwich. Okay. Uh, Cino. Okay. Shout out to Rod. Okay. Sh shout out to Metal Hendrix. Okay. Mike the Mobile Mechanic. Okay. Shout out to um, the Boston Historian. Okay. Shout out to Ben Dover. Okay. Shout out to Jab Step. Okay. Shout out to uh, uh, Mike Jones. Okay. Shout out to Marcus. Yeah, shout out to Marcus Gutierrez. Hey, okay. Shout out to uh this show has been sponsored by Timothy Bradley. Shout out to Tim Bradley. Hey, okay. Uh dropping that 200 dollars uh, $200 super chat. Uh shout out to uh J J J Osceola. Hey, okay. Uh Mar Marcos Gutierrez. Hey, okay. Leonardo Rodriguez. Hey, okay. Darius Mason. Hey, okay. And shout out to shout out to Mark. Hey. Keith Bulldogs. Hey, okay. And Mr. Nice. Hey, okay. And I think we have one more super chat. Um, and shout out to uh shout out to my brother. I think I think I think he's from my, oh, the, oh that's my sister. I have you know what? Hey sis, I haven't seen you in a long time. Simbola way. Simbola way. I haven't seen you in a long time, sis. It's been a long time. Shout out to my sister. Hey, okay. Um for dropping that. Bam, dub on your boy. Hey Leroy. Super chat received. Playtime's over, boy. Boy. Yeah, I haven't seen you in a minute, sis. Uh, it's nice, nice seeing you over here. Let's give you give you um a shout out as well. Hey, okay. Let's give let's give all the on um, the uh, super chatters and cash shoppers a round of applause. <laughs> hey, cut me said UFC tomorrow. Oh, if it's a U if it's a, if it's a UFC, if it's a UFC, oh you sitting in the hospital? I'm oh, sorry about that, sis. If it's a UFC fight tomorrow, we might as well go live for that. 
hey, if it's a UFC fight tomorrow, we're going live for it. True, true, true. We're going live for it. Shout out to uh, School of X-Man. Uh, shout out to Nick Rich, Superman, um, Hitman, Sheila from Cali. Aye, okay. Shout out to the one Mr. Ham. Aye, okay. Miss Connie Stevens. Aye, okay. Mimi24. Aye, okay. Shout out to the Goddess. Shout out to the Duchess of Wisdom. Aye, okay. Tila from um, North Omaha. Aye, okay. Al Rogan. Aye, okay. Shout out to... Uh, Jamie from New York. Aye, okay. Yarmus from Brooklyn. Aye, okay. School of X Men. Aye, okay. I'm um, MK Productions. Aye, okay. Jay Greens. Aye, okay. Superman. Aye, okay. Knockdown 305. Aye, okay. I'm Ed. Aye, okay. Shout out to Nelly Content. Aye, okay. Shout out to uh, John. Aye, okay. Shout out to Small Axe. Aye, okay. Jason Follow of Christ. Aye, okay. Frank Forbes. Aye, okay. I'm Ed. Aye, okay. Shout out to Sheila and Callie. Aye, okay. Shout out to Elena. Aye, okay. Shout out to uh, G5. Aye, okay. The Natural. Aye, okay. Who else we have, man? Uh, the Natural, Hitman 42, Nelly Content. Oh, yeah, and before we go, we got to say all praises due to the most high, the most exalted, the greatest human being on the planet Earth, Mr. Al Heyman. Well, you know, I guess I got to be like everybody else and sing Al Heyman. <laughs> I can quit my job now, baby. Six figures, baby. Name them names, man. They know who they is. Name them names, they please. The is. names need to be they named. Know who they is. <laughs> the Mexican monster. If you sitting here watching the show, hate watching, didn't want to hit the like button, Riley, get them. Look, fuck you. Fuck the plane you flew in on. Fuck them shoes. Fuck the socks with the bell on it. Fuck them cheap ass cigars. Fuck your yuck mouth teeth. Fuck your hair piece. Fuck your chocolate. Fuck Guy Ritchie. Fuck Prince William. Fuck the Queen. This is America. My president is black and my Lambo is blue, nigga. Now get the fuck out my hotel room. And if I see you in the street, I'm slapping the shit out of you. And I want to tell y'all something. When they try to bring that negative energy, energy, energy to y'all, wanting to argue and get your blood pressure all high, this is what you tell them. You want to argue. I can't argue with you. You Mad. Look at you. You mad. I don't get paid to argue with you. Who is you? You ain't nobody. <laughs> hey, but hey, hey, when they walk up to you, when they, when, they, when, they, when they start hating on you, and they're walking up to you trying to knock you off your square, trying to bring that negative energy to you, this is what you tell them. Let me address something to some of the haters out there about me. Y'all can kiss my ass twice. <laughs> when they come in your office trying to tell you, I'm making all kind of demands, trying to make you upset, get you out of your character, this is what you tell them. Who you think he is, DJ Quick? No, huh? no, I ain't saying that. Kick and I didn't say that. Huh? Oh, you must be Jimmy Walker. Well, you ain't nothing. You don't deserve nothing. You don't get nothing. You get what I give you. I got a contract between me and you. This say you do what I tell you to do. Therefore, shut the fuck. Don't say that. Don't speak to me. Don't look at me. I tell you something. Money. You know. I just say. Blue. If I raise up, gonna be trouble. Trouble. I'm walking off. If you feeling good, like I am, and they're trying to knock you off your square, this what you do. Hey. 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 And no matter what, tell, let them know that you still love them. I still love you. No. And let them know, man, that you're running things. Yep, that's right. I'm running things. I'm running things. Cream corn. That's why they call me that. Smooth. I got more measure for your pleasure. Stick with me, baby. I'll have you farting through silk. <laughs> and let a nigga mess with me. I'll jump on him. All 93 pounds of pure dynamite. Oh! 
Hey man, shout out to Food Revolution, shout out to Nick Rich, shout out to um just G5, Sheila and Cali, Nuttle Hendrix, uh, shout out to Salome, shout out to Superman, and just everybody in the chat, man. Elena La Jessica, shout out to Jack and Hernandez. See you guys on the next one, man. Hey, man, I'll see you guys on the next one, man. Um, we're going live tomorrow night, man. So y'all be on the lookout. Keep notifications. Please sign up for the newsletter. Thank you guys for sharing the live shows. That's why we've been doing so well. This show is nothing without you guys. If you guys don't share the shows, let everybody know that we own. We don't We don't grow as a community. We got 1,000 subscribers last month. We're on our way to another 1,000 this month. We have over, uh, we're doing very, very good. Doing very well. So see you guys tomorrow, man. You know my motto, don't meet me there, beat me there. Peace. Man, I'm out of here, bro. Let's go. Come on.